hours coming your way. Instrum's toffee and other yummy goodies coming up. It's time now for a little hip action. Here we go. Well, it's a brand new month, and that means time for a brand new theme called Foodie Friends and Family. All month long, we're going to feature recipes from members of our In the Kitchen with David family. So we wanted to bring you recipes that were going to be really exciting from folks that you see on the show or that support our show. So you're going to be hearing a lot about a fun recipe tonight that was helped in its development by Chef Nate from Le Creuset. And we're going to be talking all about that coming up. But first, Let's tell you what's coming up from KitchenAid. When I was in Chicago, I saw a lot of cool things happening with KitchenAid, so we're awfully excited about that. But we've got Tina V with us tonight. Tina Varelli is here with the KitchenAid three and a half quart artisan design stand mixer in the mini size. These are remarkable. You're getting that glass bowl. You're also getting all the great beaters, including that flat side beater. And you're going to enjoy six easy payments and a great sale price, but that sale price goes away end of day today. Full price on this mixer is $419 and change. We're about $150 less. And with the reduced shipping and handling, about $157 less. And look at all the gorgeous colors. We're going to tell you all about it coming up. It's the KitchenAid three and a half quart mini, and it'll be along in short order. So stick around. 10,500 of you have dialed in today for this fantastic today's special value from my most favorite brand, Le Creuset. And you see Chef Nate Collier there, and he is loading us up with looks to be French fries, which I know makes no one unhappy, particularly our Stacy. All right, we're going to be talking to you about fantastic colors, but this is a two in one, folks. It's a four and a quarter quart Dutch oven baker, but the lid is a skillet and a lid all in one. And you're going to love it that we've got all the cool colors over there. So just to the left of Chef Nate, you're going to see all the great colors, including the white, the flame, the cassis, also that Caribbean blue, and your uh, cerise and oyster. But is that soleil now gone? Can somebody reach in there and get that soleil out of there? Because it's gone. All right, soleil is sold out completely. Is that right? And emerald sold out earlier, but over 10,500 sold since midnight. And we're now last call on flame and what can ship right now. Is that correct? Oh, in the advanced order, we're about to sell out of flame too. Good grief. Lots of, we started there with nine colors. Good grief. Now there are like seven, soon to be six. All right, so we're going to be talking to you about a great recipe tonight. And this is actually one of the recipes in the today's special value recipe backup from Le Creuset because this recipe was developed in part with Chef Nate Collier. And these are his chicken thighs that are sauteed and then braised in some white wine along with some great vegetables. And then there's a mint gremolata on top. Oh, delicious. It's so fresh, David. Good to have you here, Chef. Yes. So we're excited about this. So what we've already done is seasoned these chicken thighs right. up. We have browned them until they got good and crispy. Delicious. And according to your recipe, we should remove these and we're going to put them right into this grill pan lid that comes along with today's Double special duty. Item. So you're going to get double duty. I call this the two in one yep. because you get the larger vessel and then the lid vessel up top. And then to this, we're going to add our vegetables. So in go leeks. Leeks. We've got some radishes. Uh, radish. And I love, if you guys have not braised with radishes and little baby turnips, I love that in the springtime. It just leeks adds smell great. Leeks. It just adds a nice, bright punch of flavor. So not all braises and stews need to be rich and super heavy. This is a lighter um, braise. And what do we have turnips. here? Turnips. Turnips. Yep. Well, this is going to be great for the stew. That's yeah, so absolutely. Nice. And then a lot of minced mm, garlic. A lot of garlic and some salt and pepper. And generous salt and pepper. And, and then you're going to get all that beautiful flavor off the bottom, David, because you know the heat retention. We're going to deglaze, right? Deglaze with a little bit of white wine. Again, a nice, bright, light stew. I love this. Mmm. Oh, you smell that garlic and leeks right away. It's totally delicious. smell it. Are you kidding? I want to eat Real, this right I know. Now. Well, we're going to later. <laughs> and then what we're going to do is add in our stock. Right. Is that right? Exactly. So this is chicken stock. And then we're going to carefully place our chicken thighs back in, but we're not going to submerge them in the liquid. Correct. Tell us why. So we don't want to submerge them in. We did such a good job, David. Look at how well you brown that chicken skin. It's nice and crispy. Yeah. A little confession, perfectly crisp chicken skin, I think is almost more delicious than bacon. I don't want to offend you, David. No, but, it's all good. Okay, it's, it's all delicious. good. But we do this so it stays crispy in the oven. Exactly. Right? And we won't cover this braise. We're going to put it in uncovered. So you cook through, those vegetables get nice and tender, but not mushy. And the chicken stays crisp because you braise it uncovered. 
Does the mint gremolata go on after it comes out of after the oven? After it comes out. So after it, stays it comes out nice and fresh when you when you pull it out. And that's really nice with fresh mint and gorgeous. And here's what it looks like when it's all said right. and done. Now this recipe comes with today's special value. It does. I think we're also making it available on QVC.com. Yes. So we're looking forward to that. So Chef Nate, thanks for being a Absolutely, foodie friend and David. family that member tonight. So delicious. I can't wait to taste we're it. We're gonna see you back all later right. a little bit uh, a little later with today's special value. Stacy Lou! You're wearing green tonight. Is that in honor of St. Patty's Day or our emerald green today special value color that sold out? A little bit of both. So thankfully, we do have St. Patty's Day coming up, so I'm still appropriate, even with our sellout of that emerald. Hey, look what's coming up. Not the only thing brand new is the today's special value, but we've got something you've never seen before from Enstrom's. This is their two-pound chocolate almond toffee slabs that for the first time ever come in custom printed Easter boxes. We have milk chocolate, we have dark chocolate, and we have them today for a ship immediately, or we can send it out a little later in April, April 1st. But this is heaven in a box. Again, brand new. Wait till you see those Easter boxes. It's coming up in just a bit. But right now, a little trivia question for you at home. And we'll reveal the answer in a little bit. I want you to give me your guess in the chat on David's Facebook page in the live stream. But the average American ate approximately how many pounds of chicken last year? Was it 219.3 pounds, 36.7 pounds, 48.9 pounds, or 93 and a half pounds? Hmm. Either way, it's a whole lot well, of chicken. Well, my question for you is that fried chicken, <laughs> baked chicken, Chicken wings. Chicken wings. <laughs> Could be any of those things. If it's fried chicken, I might go with the bigger number. All right. Welcome on in, everybody. It's four big hours of In the Kitchen with David tonight, and we are going to lead things off with our friend Mark Charles Massilli, the gadget guru, who was just with me in Chicago. Till last and night. I understand. Oh, you came home last night. Last night. I understand that you were busy all show long finding all kinds of new goodies. We literally, that this show, we land on Friday. We don't stop till Tuesday till night. Till Tuesday night. Yep. I was with Mark Charles for a couple of those visits, and yep. I am. See, I was privy to see some of the cool things we got coming oh, in. Yeah, we got, we got a, some fun stuff happening. Maybe a good but year. right now, we're going to start off with Kunra Khan, a set of two three in one shears with easy grip handles. So you're going to get not one pair of these, but two of these. I'll oh. show you right here. Mark Charles is using them to cut them in that clam packaging. Yep. But you're getting two here, and they're three in one. Three Tell in us one. about that. So the first time ever here, I'll show you this. The first time we ever put an actual handle on top of the um, snips to actually grab it like a regular scissors, so it can be righty and lefty. We put a bottle opener right there for you. And then the last but not least thing you can see, there's a little shimmer on there. I don't know what I just did to my finger. There I think you might have nipped it. Yeah. There we go. Um, there's a little shimmer right there, and that little shimmer is an extra little box cutter on there. Why I love that is because. It'll go through your boxes that quickly. And what I love is it's not just going to open up that, but because of the way this is built, this is actually strong enough to go through and break down your boxes. So you have that box cutter right in there. And I didn't do that with my hands. So you know what? No, I know you didn't. I know you had a you had a sore on your hand. Yes, I think I that's did. what, what yeah, is bleeding. I I just so what we're gonna do, Mark Charles, I think I'm bringing you a band-aid. Okay. So if you want to step over there and get your band-aid, and I'll go through colors while you're gone. Uh, just let's be clear, Mark Charles did not cut himself on the shears. That yeah, was just a sore he had on his finger. All right, I think it was from when you were traveling there, young man. All right, so this is yellow. We're limited, yeah, fewer than 200 in that yellow. Beside that, I've got it for you in, we're calling this eggplant, fewer than 400. Then we're going to get right into our spice, thank you. Then I've got it for you in green, emerald, then blue, then black, then aquamarine, and then finally in the red. All of this coming your way for twenty-two dollars and fifty cents. Mark Charles behind you there. So we'll, if you use that Q card, you're getting five easy pays. Now, how long is the five easy pay? Is that for all month? All month. I was gone for the first few days of the month. I missed this one. All right. So for the whole month of March, if you use your Q card on any item, you ordinarily would have gotten three easy pays. Now you're getting five. So if you want to put this on five pay tonight, then just use that Q card, and that's fantastic. We've got all the great colors for you, but remember, you're getting two pair here. You're not getting one pair, but two. So you're going to enjoy both pair in this pack up, and you'll also enjoy the fact that this will do three jobs in one. Three jobs in one, and we tell you that this goes in four categories of the home. One should be in the kitchen, one should be in the craft room, one should be in the garage, one should be in the garden. I've also had people say to me they put it in their tackle box. So if you have fishermen out there, it's wonderful for that. We're going to start with you saw me do the clam packing. We're going to do our great, um, what do we call these? The pipe cleaners. Pipe cleaners. Wow, I lost my train of thought of what they were. So you've got that metal insert in there, okay? Uh, we'll do the clam packing again to show you how great this goes through the clam packing and that quickly. 
So any anything with opening packaging is going to open up that quickly. If you want to do a little DIY, you can actually get, instead of using an X-Acto knife, you can actually get in there and cut with that precision. This one of those self-stick uh, tiles. Tiles for okay. it, yep. And uh, is it time for the wheel of wire? We'll do that. So the wheel of wire, we've got our little weed whacking wire. Right oh, there. a weed whacking wire. This is weird weed whacking wire. If it's not clamp packing, you know, we have what's called zip ties. Zip ties. On everything, so great for that. We've got some wire that you can actually uh, work with. This is actually rusted wire. We've got some cable wire that's got copper in it. We've got extension wire. This is again just to show strength. And notice I'm using the same one over and over again. And we're going to do this. And then just for, ad for added little effect, I'm going to open this up. All right. I did all of that. Go slow now, with that can there, the Mr. most important thing is that every time I go like this, all the burn marks I would have made with the metal should have made little divots. If I go right here and show you this, this paper of this magazine, you can cut through this all the way across and not have a single burn mark along the whole edge. After doing the same shears with all those hard materials, that's what makes this different. Surgical stainless steel. Kitchen approved. We now, love. Mark Charles, over 500 sets are now gone. When I say set, you're getting two pair of shears for that one price of $22.50. And if you use the Q card on any item, all, any item, one more time, David, any item all month, five easy payments on your Q card. This is your yellow. I have six dozen left. Uh, eggplant, $3.50. Here's spice, $3.50. In the emerald, available. Blue, very popular. Black, then aquamarine. And finally, we have it for you in the red, and red is also popular. 600 pair are, are sets are now gone. You're getting two pair in this set. Now, when you buy cut flowers in the supermarket, Mark Charles taught me this. Yep. When you come home, you should snip off the ends because how long before they close up again? Seven seconds. The average stem will start closing itself up, which means it will not drink the water, which means it will die. So, one of the things that you should do is right before fill the water up, the vase with the water, put the, put plant the little food, packet of the yep, powder in there. Go under running water at best. That's the best thing to do, and snip them and put them right in because you got seven seconds before they start closing up and stop drinking the water. Then your flowers will last a lot longer. Get them right down okay. the water, and now they're happy again. They're they drinking. Are. So you can be delicate with this. We keep talking about all the strength, but I can actually go in here and actually do that to a strawberry. Remember, these are food grade safe, so prep with these. If you have anything inside like a recipe, you don't have to use a knife and a cutting board. You can actually cut if it fits inside the shears. Like think of celery sticks, carrot sticks, any kind of herbs, the green onions you just saw. These are food grade safe. Don't use those orange handled um, scissors because those are craft scissors. They shouldn't go with food because they interact. This will cut through crab legs. This will cut through the backs of lobsters, rotisserie chickens. It'll actually cut drumsticks in half. That's how strong these are. Okay, we just sold out of a color. Yellow is now gone, so I'm going to grab those and hand these to John. Here we are. Thank you, sir. Now, they also come with these little blade covers. Yep. And I think this is smart because, I'm um, sorry, guys. Here we go. So, if you are wanting to have that extra little protection from the blade, remember there's a blade on the outside yeah. of these shears. Right now, it's covered with a little printed right tape. See it right there. Pop and, it right and in. Please here. note that it's not a knife sharp blade like a, you know, it's, gonna, it's not a chef's knife blade edge. It's just got a small, smaller sharpened edge just to cut through all those boxes for exactly. you. Exactly. Because so, you know what was happening, David? People were taking the old shears and stabbing their box and opening them, and it, was, it wasn't sharp enough. So that was really the request from the customer saying, there you go. Could we make it a little easier to open up packages? And that's why we added that to this. I one. love that. So what we've got is 1,200 gone. Yellow is now sold out. This is eggplant, 280. Spice, 330. Then the emerald. Then we've got blue, very popular. Then the black, then aquamarine, and finally red. And red is also popular. You're seeing 2250 tonight, but if you use your Q card for the entire month of March, uh, month, uh, one more time. Well, one more time. Charles. Start at oh. the beginning. It's okay. and it's the first first airing first. For the hours. entire <laughs> month of March, if you use Slowly. your Q card, you will get five easy payments on any item you order except for gift cards. How about that? All well right. done. Oh, well, you know, it only took two tries. It, yeah, it was, it was a little practice you needed. That's well, it. it. Was just a little bit too much, you know, yeah. cold in Chicago. Got yeah, a uh, little, little cold in Chicago. Oh, I don't know. Minus two. And um, some. There's some hardy folk that live out there. I'm yeah. like, boom. <laughs> We landed here. It was 37 degrees. I was like, "Oh, it's well, mommy, let's, let's have a picnic." I said the same thing when I got off the plane last I was night. Like, it's crazy. So, what we're talking about is a fantastic opportunity for you to pick this up tonight and get this great price. 
Don't forget, you're going to get not one pair, but two for this price. So we're really excited that we can do all this for you at a time when everyone is looking to do those jobs around the house, breaking down boxes for the recycle day. Today was my recycle day pickup. Yep. I was putting lots of boxes out last night as I was putting trash out uh, when I got home from Chicago. So this is K45657. We'll invite everyone to stay on the line. Mark Charles, I know you're coming back later with a few more items. Yes. Stacy's got one new with ones. you. Couple new ones. And I've got uh, one with you coming up as well. Very exciting. All right. So K45657, let's talk to the lady in green. You know, some people say it's not easy being green, but you make it look simple. <laughs> You're such a good guy. Thanks, David. Hey, um, okay, so we remember we asked that trivia question off the top of the show. We wanted to know, do you know the answer to uh, this question? The average American ate approximately how many pounds of chicken in 2018? 219 pounds, you really think so? Well, guess what? Nope. We didn't eat that much chicken. It wasn't fried, I guess, David. It wasn't fried chicken. No. How about 93 and a half pounds, my friends? According to the National Chicken Council, the average American ate an estimated 93 and a half pounds of chicken last year. <laughs> oh my gosh. Almost as good as the turkey. And oh. don't, nope. Wait, did Zip. you say turkey? Nope, nope. Didn't say it. Come on! <laughs> That was specifically for our producer, Sean. Okay, so, <laughs> and me, of course. We are live streaming the entire show on David's Facebook page. Please check us out there because that's where we host our chat, where we make a great time during the show, catching up with foodie friends, asking great questions about the products that you see here. So definitely check it out if you haven't done so. Also on his Facebook page, you should see our foodie photo of the week. This is from Annette P. Look at that, that's bruschetta. Grilled chicken zoodle bowl. That's a bowl life right there. Bruschetta grilled chicken done with zoodles in a bowl. Done. And that it sure is. All right, David. All right, it's time for a hot pick. And hot picks are those star products, those best sellers every day on QVC. When you hear the cool music and see those great graphics, you know you're about to see one of our very best products of the day. And just a couple of days ago, I was reading comments in my hotel in Chicago while I was there for the Houseware Show. And one of our foodies said, Hey, David, when is Enstrom's Toffee coming back to QVC? And I thought to myself, I didn't know for sure. But I was thinking certainly we'd have it back before Easter. Well, guess what? It's back right now. And it's available for you tonight, brand new today. We're awfully excited to welcome Doug Simmons back to QVC. It's a great pleasure to have you here. David, how fun to be back. This company has been in business since 1960, if my memory serves That's me. That's exactly right. And right. we're excited about this. What we're also excited about bringing you tonight is two pounds of chocolate almond toffee slabs. Slabs. And these are amazing. But they're also packaged in the first time we've ever done an Easter box. Our specialty Easter boxes just for QVC. We're so excited to be here with these new boxes and uh, our delicious toffee in either milk or dark chocolate. You know, David, we're, we're kosher. That's nice. We're gluten free. Also good. And we're absolutely delicious. Well, I, I agree on all points, <laughs> particularly the last one you made there. You know, people ask me all the time, David, what's one of your favorite snacks that you all sell at QVC? And we sell lots of different kinds of snacks, both sweet and savory. But I always say if it's a sweet snack, Instrums, one of my most favorites, and you sell this in lots of different forms. But I would also tell you tonight, you're getting this on two easy payments. If you're paying with a Q card, I'm going to ask my producer Chuck to see if he can uh, round up that little small one that we sometimes show on the air. I'm talking about the small one that's this big. Um, and we're going to, I'll make this available to you. We can either ship it now. Okay, full disclosure, Doug. The reason this one looks like it has a little rabbit bite out of it, uh -huh. I might have gotten into the box. Did you get in here there. early? Well, yeah. I wasn't looking. I did not bite it. <laughs> I broke it off. But that little missing chunk right there is safely tucked right in here. And I don't mean in the apron, I mean in my tummy. Yeah, I do. That's right. All right. Hey, can I tell you, we're delivering this either now or April the 1st. Both of these will arrive before Christmas. 200 sets are already gone. Now, if you want dark chocolate, I have 900 that can ship now and 900 that can ship on 4 1. If you want to go around on milk chocolate and no auto delivery. Now, Doug, when these come, they come. One of the reasons I was able to snitch a little piece right. here is because they're easy to break. Yes, our toffee is, you know, we make toffee at altitude. So we get this nice, light, fluffy cook, and it just breaks effortlessly and into just delicious chunks of heaven. Heaven, heaven is what I like to toffee. say, too. This yes. is butter toffee. Yes. Wrapped around roasted almonds. Dunked in chocolate and then sprinkled with 
crushed almonds. Freshly crushed almonds on the oh, outside. Oh, my word. And, we, you know, we've done this for four generations, David, and both of my kids are in the business. My sons are in. And yeah. They represent our fourth generation of candy, of candy craftsmen. Well, and here's a little sneak peek here, inside the factory. Here, here we are making some toffee in the copper kettles. And there, it, we put the whole almonds in there. Then we pour it out on, on water-cooled tables. And you can see we're spreading it out to about the thickness of an almond. And then it, when it's cool enough just to flip over, we'll, we'll turn it over, give it a quick roll, and then we pour delicious milk or dark chocolate over and spread it, just slather it in, in chocolate. And then there, well, there's there, the there crushed, almonds. crushed almonds. We turn it over. We do the other side. So it's 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 a little more flexible when it's when it, it's, it's still, still warm. It's still warm. It's over 300 degrees when we pour it out on those tables. Okay, Doug, go ahead. Be honest with us. Do you sometimes take a little hot piece off oh, the table and eat some of it David, warm? David, there is nothing like a hot piece of toffee coming off the table. You're just going to have to come and see us sometime so you yes. can try it. Yes. <laughs> Fire up the chopper, Stacy. We're heading to Colorado. All right. Let's get a little bite. Even though it's not warm, it's awfully right. delicious. And I will tell you, you can choose either milk or dark. Delivery now or 4 one. We're, re we're very, very busy. In fact, right. 600 sets are already gone. I can't wait a moment more. You know, David. Mm. Uh, what a perfect way mm. to dress up your Easter buffet and treat your family mm -hmm. to some of the best confection mm -hmm. on the planet. Mm -hmm. You know, so. Mm. <laughs> All right, Doug. It's time for the first happy uh, dance of the night. Yes. There it is. We love Woo! the happy dance. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yeah. I love, love this toffee. Yep. Oh, my word. You know, so <laughs> fresh creamery butter, pure cane sugar whole California almonds, and then delicious milk or dark chocolate. Now, our, our milk chocolate is 39% cacao, and it's our signature milk, and it goes extremely well with the toffee and is the most popular. Mm. But the dark chocolate, it's a 61% cacao, so it's not, it's not too strong. Yeah. But if, for those of you that like a little dark chocolate, this, the, the dark chocolate just gives you a little stronger chocolate bite, and it's absolutely delicious with our toffee. So let me update you on what I have remaining because this is going quickly. If you want to deliver now, I have 700 dark and 1,000 milk chocolate. If you want it Whoa. delivered May April 1st, 800 dark chocolate and 1,100 in the dark chocolate. I beg your pardon, milk chocolate. Let's say that again for, uh, for one. 800 dark chocolate. 1100 milk delivering 4 1. Now, Doug, if we get this home and we want to freeze it, can we do that? Absolutely, Dave. You, you can keep it frozen for six or eight months. Okay. Frozen uh, up to about a month in the fridge and really a, a week or two at room temperature because it's a fresh dairy confection and you really want to treat it like you would a pound of butter because there's a lot of there's butter. There's a lot of butter, a lot butter, in, of there, butter exactly. in here. Here's what happens when you lift that lid, that Easter lid off the box. There's a second box inside. Reach in here and grab the little flap here and just pull him open. And inside, of course, is a little Instrums note. And then the, the slabs of the toffee. This unbelievable, look at the size of this. Look at this. How are you doing? <laughs> it's the size of Colorado, How's I believe. How's everybody feeling right now? It kind of looks like the shape of Colorado or it could look like the shape of Pennsylvania. There you for, go. For, for that matter. Oh, look, there's a little bite sized piece. Oh, wow. Don't know how that happened. You know, Serendipitous, I suppose. And so those large slabs, Dave, and it's just so easy to break it up and, and, mm -hmm. and, and dress up your mm -hmm. Easter buffet. You know, in mm -hmm. this little leaflet, it really just says, there's nothing but love in here. Mm. And butter. <laughs> or maybe for the love of butter. Yeah. Mm. yeah. 1,500 are now spoken for. If you're paying with a cue card tonight, you know, this one, <laughs> you can put it on not too easy payments, but five. How does, pretty great. how does it fit in your wallet? I carry it in a wheelbarrow. <laughs> I do indeed. But uh, I, actually, there's a trailer on the back of my car. I just neatly uh, tuck it in there. But this is what's really exciting because you're going to be able to use that cue card and put this on five easy payments tonight because every item you pay for with your cue card, you ordinarily get three pays. Through the end of March, you're going to get five pay, which is really exciting. So we hope you'll utilize that cue card. And if you don't have one yet, easy to apply. Search cue card on QVC.com and apply online, or call one of our operators. We'll take your application right over the phone. Now, Doug, you were going to say? I was just going to say. I just hope you love these these new Easter boxes. I do. I love and them about as much as I love the coffee funny. inside. We actually uh, bought a printer, so we print these in house, and we designed these specifically for QVC. It's the first time mm. ever that our traditional slab almond toffee has been available in an Easter package, mm. and so we're very pleased to offer this today. It's a great value, so good. and it's the finest. 
nicest toffee that that you'll ever put in your mouth and it's just we're just so happy to be here on so here Kitchen. is your update if you want it delivered now in the dark 500 left milk chocolate delivered now 700 left april 1st dark chocolate 600 left and milk chocolate 800 left 2,000 sets are now gone. I will tell you, one of my most favorite treats we sell at QVC in the sweet category. I'm not allowed to say my most favorite because that's like picking a favorite child, so I can't do that. <laughs> but what I will say that this ranks right in my top five. And the fact that it's in this show doesn't happen by accident because our planners know that I love this product. <laughs> and so they're always nice to put a, 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 pro a product in the show that I really, really love. This is M62707. You're getting all of this chocolate. In fact, it's a total of two pounds, correct? So a pound absolutely, in each box? Absolutely, yep, pound in each box. And you know, David, a lot of people will take the crumbs or even break up a little toffee and put it on their Easter desserts. Sprinkle, on your, sprinkle on your breakfast sugar? On, yeah, a little bit on your whipped cream, on your, on your hot chocolate. Now you're you know, and, and just, you know, so there's just lots of ways to enjoy almond toffee. What if I took toffee. some chunks and I put it into my hot coffee and let it dissolve? Oh, it might be a toffee latte. Huh, toffee <laughs> latte. <laughs> could be good, could be hmm. good. And, I yeah, think I'm yeah. ready. Yeah. <laughs> I think I might try that in the morning. Yeah, um, I might have to just uh, bar, bar a piece of this and carry it home in, in, my, in, my, uh, in my briefcase. This is M62707. What was that, Sean? 2,300 are now gone. We're now half gone in what we brought in for the show tonight. Oh, that's wonderful. This is very exciting. One of our foodies posted on my Facebook page just in the last couple of days while I was away in Chicago. David Wins the Instrum's coming back. I hope you're watching tonight because it's here. This is M62707. I also want to let you know that if you ever want to look at the items that we have on any particular show for In the Kitchen with David, our search term on QVC.com is Happy Dance. So if you go to our search bar and you type in Happy Dance, then it'll take you right to the In the Kitchen with David page and it'll, there's a little button there that says Shop the Show. Just click on it anytime you like. Prior to a show, either Sundays or Wednesdays, you'll be able to see what's going to be in the show and you can start ordering ahead of time, which is always nice. So search Happy Dance on QVC.com and you'll find us. Which is always fun. Wonderful. And so, hopefully you'll find some Enstrom toffee there. Well, if we have any left, <laughs> because as I mentioned, it's already over half gone, well over half gone. So here's our story. If you want it delivered now, in the dark, dark chocolate, I have 400 left. In the milk, fewer than 500. Oh, if wow. you want it April 1st, dark chocolate, 400 left. Milk chocolate, 700 left. And I want to show you again what happens. And since I already took a piece out of this one, I'll open yes. a new box. There you go. So you're getting two boxes when you order either milk or dark. You get the Easter decoration that was done just for QVC. And then inside is a second box. I'll reach in here and open the second flap. Inside is the little message from Doug's family. Thank you. There you go. And then no two slabs will be alike. And you might even find a little breakage <laughs> where you can have a little snack. Stacy, I believe this one is dark chocolate. Oh, 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 here's a little dark chocolate for Stacy Lou. Can I just tell you in the chat? They're calling you guys the purple almond eaters. Oh. <laughs> like the purple people eaters. Look at us, young man. Yeah. Almond eaters. I, this was not planned. <laughs> it I thought I would wear this because it's kind of an Easter color. And full here I am. No, no, full disclosure. Right. I was going to wear my green apron tonight in honor of the emerald green Le Creuset exclusive yeah. color yeah. that I helped choose. And it all sold out. So right before the show, I told Stacy, I'm going to change into purple. And then I kept my hearing, you're in purple too. That's fun. <laughs> so this is really exciting. What we're talking about is M62707. You may choose two pounds of the dark or two pounds of the milk. And we started with 4,800. And here's what I have left. If you want to deliver now in the dark chocolate, 300. Milk chocolate now, 400. Dark chocolate in uh, April 1st, 350. And the milk chocolate April 1st, 600 remaining. Don't dare hang up. <laughs> Remember, if you're using that Q card, you can get five easy payments on this toffee. Wow. We're offering two with any card you use, that's but use great. your Q card, you'll get five yep. easy payments. And that's uh, on any item you buy except for gift cards. Uh, Mr. Doug, give your family our best, won't you? Thank you, David. Make more toffee. We're going to need oh, it. We'll keep doing it. We got it. Thank you <laughs> Thank so much. Thank you so much. We're going to check in with our Stacey, who's giving us a sneak peek of today's special value. Oh, yeah. Coming up in about 10 minutes, something brand new. The world has never seen before, not just here at QVC, a new shape from Le Creuset. We are giving you a four and a quarter quart multifunction ov uh, oven with a baker lid. So essentially two pieces for the price of one. Again, it's a round shape, but with this baker lid, it is so cool. We already sold out of two colors. Here's the thing, this retails for $425. 
With free shipping and handling and our today's special value price, we are $210 less. If you want the flame color, if that's what you collect, I have a dozen left. So just on that mention, please pick up the phone if that's the color that you want because it may not make it uh, for 10 minutes. But look at all those wonderful things you can create. Two baking vessels for essentially the price of one. That's pretty awesome. Okay, so uh, here's something that was extremely popular when we had it on earlier today. 3,000 sets sold. It is our lock and lock. And what I love about this, this is our nestable pantry set. This is about 50 cups storage for all your pantry and let's say household needs. It doesn't matter where you use it. We have it for the first time back in stock this year because it sold out in its debut. We have seven new colors, some of them going very quickly because it was popular earlier. And we have it for the first day on two easy payments of just $10.50. Patty Kramer Hi, brings us lock nice and lock. To be here. When our girl Chris Prime is I not know. here, by the way, <laughs> check Chris Prime out on Instagram. She has been posting all of her vacation yes, photos. She has I'm been. just a little bit jealous of this girl. Yes. <laughs> And a lot of the foodies have found her. Yep. And they're watching tonight. And they're watching tonight because they were hoping they were going to get something great from Lock yes. and Lock. And I think this nestable pantry set is something that they're really going to love. Mm -hmm. It doesn't take up a lot of space, and let's show them mm -hmm. the, what they're going to get. And I'm, I made the tower, so it's kind of tall for us. So this one right here is a three cup. Okay. Then you're going to get an eight cup. Then you're going to get a 15 cup, and wow. the big one on the bottom mm. is 24 cups. And we stepped it up a little bit on this one, Stacy. We put measurements in cups right on the front, which well, that's is different. Which is a yeah, bit different for us. Is this, the, is this the first that you've done something like that? Um, yes, it is. So, which is great. And and then all of them right here nest down with their lids, so you don't have to worry about it. So it's easy to get the size you want. All right, K47535 is your item number. Let's do colors. Up on top, I have, yep, the jade green. Beautiful. That's and gorgeous. The new golden sand up on top. <laughs> if you want the jade green, I have 200 available to go, go around. Okay. But in the golden sand, 150, and then that is it. Again, it was popular earlier <laughs> uh, today on another show. Here is the copper color. Mm -hmm. Next to that is the clear. 800 available in the clear. That's the only one where you'll see the blue silicone seal um, on that one. Then we have this red. beautiful red. Next to that is the plumberry. Plum I have 150 left in the, oh, I'm sorry, 550 left in the plumberry. Then we have that gorgeous canary, canary yellow. yellow. Mm -hmm. Love it. 300 left in the canary yellow. Next to that, blue. Blue. And that's translucent. And then the other color is the aquamarine, which is the new color. And only 700 left of the aquamarine. Please, if you want to get your order in now, the quickest way to do so is go to qvc.com or use your apps on your phone or tablets because we are extremely busy on the phone. This is $21 for essentially, I was trying to do the math, about 50, <laughs> 50 cups I of storage. Did you too? Okay, that's good. <laughs> 50 cups of storage for all your needs. First of all, this guy. Three cups. three cups. Looks are so deceiving. Looks are deceiving, and I want to just show you. You just saw me open it. It's three cups, and I just have my salad in here, and I'm just going to kind of take it out. So this is a whole plate of salad for the three cups. So really, that's what we love about this. You know, you don't have to worry about the sizes, and you want to relate. That's three cups right there. I don't want to touch with my fingers. So that's three cups, a plate of salad, and it all came out of this container. Yeah, awesome. And you could have put your salad dressing right in there and shook it right up. And shake it. That's what I right. always do with my marinades. Mm -hmm. I just use my lock and lock because yeah. it's airtight, watertight. Yes. In fact, we had a foodie in the chat just mention tonight, she dropped um, one of her lock and locks with leftovers yeah. in it upside down in her fridge. Mm -hmm. She said nothing spilled out. Yeah. So she said, crisis averted. <laughs> she said she sold on the brand just for that case. Look at what you can do. I with have these to sizes. show this. This is genius. So the, the two sugars in one. The in two sugars. So this is a brown sugar right here and I'm going to just spin it right here. And on the other side, I have the regular sugar. Mm -hmm. And if you're looking and saying, why did I leave it in the packages? I left it in the packages just kind of to show you. And right here is the uh, five pound bag of flour. And you can see, I could take it out of there. And if I took it out of there, I would only have probably filled half the container. Uh, okay, we're, we're just losing colors. colors. Golden sand <laughs> gone. And our display here of Jade Green. Jade Green is gone, gone too. I'm not gonna try and okay, then we'll have to move down. All right, let's quickly go through what colors we do have because 4,000 have been spoken for today. <laughs> All right, up here you're seeing now uh, a collection of the red. red. You'll see it down here, but only 800 left in the red. Copper, this is the color that I collect in my house. Here is the clear, 650 left in the clear. I talked about 800 left in the red. Plumberry. 
450. The canary yellow, 200 remaining, and then that'll be gone. And these newer colors match back to the today's they, value. That's we why we bought them. Had. That, yep, they match back to that. There's the blue next to the yellow, and the blue is really popular. That translucent blue, the people are loving that. And, well, they're loving it tonight, right <laughs> now too. And then the aquamarine. 650 left in so, the aquamarine. Let me just show you the canary yellow first because you said there's not that many left. So this one right here is the 15 cup and in here I have two things of the green leaf lettuce. Wow. And don't wash the lettuce. All I did was get a paper towel, dry it off and put it right in here. Patty, going back to, uh, to talking about watertight, uh, airtight, why this woman was mm -hmm. so happy that she didn't make a mess of her refrigerator when she dropped her lock and yep. lock. What is the difference than maybe what we find at our store with other plastic yeah. storage? So it's easy to open one handed with lock and lock, and inside every single seal is the um, silicone seal that's airtight and watertight. And this was what sets us really apart from everybody else. You can microwave in these because they're BPA free. You can freeze in these too, so no worries when you microwave just put the lid on like that and it's easy to open and close like I said one handed if you have problems with your hands mm -hmm. no worries and we'll actually talk about these this is now this right here is one of those whole bags of animal crackers and you don't have to worry about it if you go ahead and drop it and you can see like I'm purposely holding it up in the air nothing's going to happen mm -hmm. with it and it's going to stay fresh until you Oh, I, I crashed my cookies, it, but it, other than that, it stays it, fresh. It really keeps your food fresher mm -hmm. longer, which is really, really nice. 4,700 now spoken for. Again, if you have a color, please do not wait on this. It's extremely popular. Yeah. And let's think it's outside summer. of the box. You don't right? want a store like this because you know what? It's going to be summer soon, and the bugs and everything, you cannot steal in these type of containers, or you're going to close pin it, and you can't see what's in there. Mm -hmm. So that's why you don't want to store in that. And then, what about this to put it in your cooler? So this is the uh, pasta salad that I bought in the store. This is two of the five pound ones and you can see the juice goes to the bottom and you don't have to worry about it. You can just shake it up like that and it can all drain down and you can mix it up to serve it. And what I love about these pieces is they can go right in your cooler. Yep. Pasta and salad what, for a party. That's I know. what that is right there. It is. <laughs> and, but you can use it all around the house. And then to talk to you about the berries. This is the whole container of the blueberries and a whole container of the strawberries. And that's only the eight cup. Mm -hmm. And we love about these because it's like this is a, this is a whole thing of the cookies in the little containers. You got the, all the sleeves yeah. from, from, yeah. uh, from uh -huh. the container. Yeah. I love this. Let's go through colors again. Sure. Remember, they are nestable, so they don't take up a lot of space if they're not being used. But let's face it, so many different yeah. uses. More than 5,000 orders placed on the day. Here's what we have remaining because we sold out of two colors just earlier. Here is our copper. We're good in the copper. If you want the clear, I have 450 remaining. Remember, this is the first day on two easy payments of $10.50. 550 in the red. Plumberry, I have 300, and that is it. Canary yellow, four dozen <laughs> remaining. Do not wait. The blue, popular, available, and the aquamarine, 550. Grab it now because it sold out in its debut, and it took us this long to get back in it's stock. It's been about five months since it's been back. It's an <laughs> awesome set. And again, remember, it now has the measurements on yes. the lock and lock, so that's something new and different. K47535. Patty Kramer. Stacy, thank you. All right. I'm going to go check out what Chris is doing now. Yeah, see what she's <laughs> posting. Now. She told me she would post tonight for the foodies. All right. Sounds good. In the meantime, I think we've waited long enough. A brand new today's special value from one of our favorite brands. Oh, boy, is it ever. And boy, have they outdone themselves. And you have responded in huge numbers today. 10,800 of you have dialed in since last night when we kicked off this brand new colorful two-in-one vessel from Le Creuset. And we're talking about an amazing buy, unbelievable value, but colors are shrinking quickly because we've already had some sell out and one more is about to go. It's our very best value of the day and it starts right now. So you're wondering what this is all about. It's a two-in-one vessel where you've got a wonderful Dutch oven down below, and then the lid is actually a separate vessel because it could be a regular skillet on its own or neatly and efficiently fits right on top to seal this up and create that Dutch oven. This is our two-in-one from Le Creuset, and we're talking about an amazing value tonight and unbelievable color choices. But as we come back to me for a moment, let me just say a couple of things. 
Look, Rose has been on QVC now for almost five years. You should also know that this is a brand new shape, not just for this show, but for uh, for all of history when it comes to Le Creuset. They made this vessel, and it's so exciting that we're able to debut it for you. I should also let you know that this is on five easy payments, oven safe to 500 degrees, made in France since 1925. Now, let me take you through the colors, and I want to love on white for a moment because white is a color we don't do much of. I have seven dozen left in the white that can ship right now. And then it will go to an advanced order. Now, don't get nervous about the advanced order because it's only a couple of weeks from now. We're going to ship advanced orders on March 23rd. But we don't carry much white in Le Creuset. We get tons of requests for it, and I've got seven dozen left that can ship right now. This is the color I collect and will be ordering tonight. This is cerise. Now, cerise is, of course, the French word for cherry. And you're going to love this color, and I know many of you do and collect it. But if you want this delivered now, I have fewer than 500 left that can ship right now, and it's been most popular. This is Cassis, that gorgeous, grapey, eggplanty purple. I have seven dozen left that can ship right now. If you're looking for something to really work with your stainless steel appliances, may I suggest Oyster? 300 left that can ship right now, and this oyster is what Stacy collects in her very modern contemporary home, and she loves it on her in, on her kitchen stove. Marseille continues to be one of our most popular today. 300 left that can ship right now. This, of course, named after the southern port city of France, Marseille. Then I've got it for you in a place we all wish we were about now, the Caribbean, and I've got 300 left that ships on March 23rd. When those 300 are left, we'll take Caribbean off the table because there is no more after the advanced order sells out. And if you want flame, well, I'm afraid it's gone. It has just sold out. And we sold out of what we could ship immediately and in the advanced order. Flame, of course, that iconic color, the first color ever at Le Creuset. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. So what we're going to let you know now is that we started our day with nine colors. And I now have Caribbean, Marseille, the oyster. This is cassis. Very popular is my color, the cerise. That's cassis. This is cerise. This is white. And here's your value story. If you were to go to retail, and when I say retail, I mean lecrosay.com, to try to buy this same item, that's the only other place you're going to find it currently, you're going to pay $425. We are $195 and two pennies less. But wait, it gets better. We're also free shipping and handling. So if you add to your savings the free shipping and handling, what it would have cost right. to ship it, we're $210.74 less. Wow. Let me say that again $210 and change less. And did I mention that it's on five easy payments? Well, if I didn't, I should have. And if I did, I'll repeat myself. Five easy payments of $46. 400 already gone in this show. My great pleasure to reintroduce Chef Nate Collier to you, the man that makes Le Creuset sing on QVC. David, it's good to see it's you, so sir. It's so great to be here. And you know what? I have to tell you something. I was going to say I've missed being here with you, but you just said you'd rather be in the Caribbean instead of here cooking with me. So well, I, only if you and I could both oh, cook perfect. in the Caribbean. You know, we'll go. We'll do a live show from there next time. How well, about that? let's take an idea. Now you're talking. <laughs> let's all cook on the beach. Right. Hey, would the crew like to go to the Caribbean in the dead of winter? Yes. 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 We all would. So, Chef, you just took how big a pot roast out of here? That is um, just under five pounds, probably four and three quarter pounds pot roast. So, what you did is you left all that flavor, those flavor bits, right. in the bottom there, and you added in your fresh veg and your and your fresh uh, herbs. Right. Season these a little bit, and right. you're going to sweat these out a little bit. Yeah. We are. We're going to let them sweat. I just want to show something here. This this lid is cool. We had this to the side. You could look that beautiful sear we got on this chuck roast in the Dutch oven base. This is the secret to the deep, rich, flavorful stews that you need. If you've ever had a thin, gray, watery stew, they didn't develop the sear enough. And the reason it didn't develop is because you weren't retaining the heat like cast iron does. Thank mm -hmm. you, sir. I appreciate that. Get a little stir. And so first we developed the brown flavor all because of the heat retention of cast iron getting that sear on there. And then, of course, I'm using the lid as double duty while I um, pull out my pot roast, just like we did with those chicken thighs earlier. You've got the vegetables going. The second secret to getting that rich, flavorful um, base to your stew, you got to get the flavor off the enamel. Now, look what we're doing here. We're actually deglazing. And when Chef drops that, I believe you said, is this hard cider? Uh, this now we've gone to beer, but we want that St. Patrick's Day theme. So you could use your favorite dark beer, but of course, any liquid wine, chicken stock, it even smells water, really good. citrus juice. And look. look what's happening here, folks. All, all of that flavor is off the bottom. I we're not, not going to dare pour that out. Absolutely not. Because all that's flavor, and we're going to leave that in the bottom of the pan because that's going to help flavor our sauce. 
or more importantly, our gravy when it's all said and done, right? Absolutely right, David. So that enamel is what allows the flavor to release. The sand enamel allows it to release. It allows you also to see what's going on in the bottom of the pan. Mm. So you can tell when you're developing the flavor. You can tell when you've There's released it. nicer than fresh thyme. Oh, I love oh. that smell. And again, this is not complicated food here. It's 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 a it's a cheap cut of meat that we're developing flavor on. Yeah. We're releasing that flavor, and then we're going to turn it into the most tender pot roast you've ever had. So before you clap that lid on, let right. me ask you two questions. One, okay. what's the capacity of the lower the lower vessel? Four and a quarter quart. Four and a quarter, and the and then the top. The top is two. Two and a quarter quart. It's so for a total of uh, six and a half. Six and a See half that quarts. Math I did? See, they're fast. Yes, exactly. Fast. Uh, if you use them separately, you'll get a full six and a half um, quarts of space. If you're using it as a traditional Dutch oven, you've got four and a half quarts of usable space in the bottom. And, four and a quarter quart. Excuse me, four and a quarter quart. Yeah. Correct. And so this is beautiful because. The lid is so functional, but it doesn't sacrifice anything that our normal cast iron lids um, do. That precision lip right here that we always manufacture in the perfect circle, this is what traps the steam. This is what traps the moisture, and it still locks in the same way all of our cast iron lids do. So you're not sacrificing any of that performance. Right on top, it's going to heat from the top. It's mm. going to create this lovely flavor bath in there, a little bit of convection. And I'm going to go to the oven and pull one out to show you just how deliciously tender this Can I help with the oven door? That would be lovely, sir. Happy to do that. Thank you. All right, looks like we may need to retrieve before we, before we put okay. that one inside. We'll pull this out. And again, these handles are wide enough to easily grip when you put them in and out of the oven, so don't worry about that. Easy to maneuver whether you're using them together or you're using the lid on its own or the base on its own. And we're going to walk this back right over here. So we'll lift this lid and get ready for goodness. Get ready for comfort food bliss. And look how amazing that is. Beautiful flavor in there, David. I'm going to ask you while I go back to the oven, just shred, do a little... shred that up a little bit and show everybody how beautiful oh my. that is. Hello. Now, this was a chuck roast that went in, correct? Exactly. Now, chuck roast, when it's, when it's you know, Raw is pretty tough, mm -hmm. and you have to cook it low and slow, and you need to cook it in an environment where it will really, absolutely, become this tender. Now we'll come in nice and close on this bite, because I want you to see just how beautifully tender that meat is. Coming right beside you. How very gorgeous hard. this is! Look at that. Isn't that lovely? If that doesn't make you hungry, your eyes are closed. Open them up. We'll wait. <laughs> All right, come on now, and then. Um, I think I may have a little taste. You should absolutely Just a little have bite. a taste of that. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Pretty good. Oh, look, there's a little on that part. Uh, don't lose mm -hmm. a little bite. Uh huh. The only thing left. What, what's that? Is the happy dance. That's right. That's, That's it. That's right, David. Oh my <laughs> word. <laughs> And mm. so good and so easy. Even though this cooked low and slow, it took some time in the oven. All you're doing is searing with that heat retention of cast iron, yeah. releasing flavor with the enamel, and locking the moisture in with the lid. That's why Laker State cast iron is so delicious. You know what that flavor is? That's that. Sunday dinner at my house oh, growing yeah. up. Absolutely. Mom would do beef pot roast two times a month because she got paid every other week. Wow. And we'd have beef pot roast on right. payday Sunday. Wow. And it was always great. I love that. It was my favorite. I love that. All right. Can I tell you? 11,200 of these are now gone for the day. 700 during in the kitchen with David. And we started our day with nine colors. I now have one, two, six left. So three have already sold out completely on the day, including that exclusive emerald that we we're so excited about earlier in the day. It is gone. So I have it for you in white. I have three dozen left that can ship right now. Then that moves to an advanced order of March 23rd. You don't have to wait long on this uh, advanced order because we're going to ship later this month on the 23rd. So another couple weeks. Here it is in the cerise. I have 450 left that can ship out now, and then we'll move to an advanced order there. This is Cassis. I have four dozen left in Cassis that can ship out right now. If you're after the oyster, 230 that can ship out right now. This is Marseille, 275 that can ship now, and finally the Caribbean, 250 left that ship March 23rd. But when those are gone, Caribbean will come off the table. And out of the nine colors we began the day with, there will only be five. Wow! So be sure and get yours now. Taking a look at our value. Go to retail to buy this identical piece. You're going to pay $425. So right out of the gate, we're a hundred, we're over $195 less. That's unbelievable. And then when you add in the amount you would have paid if you were paying shipping, but you're not because it's free, we're now at over $210 less. Five easy payments and free shipping and handling. This is a big, big deal. I'd like you to see where the magic happens, and it's been happening in the same small village of France. 
since 1925. 1925, David, and we do it the same way still. That the black sand, that's what the molds are made of. Each one is individually made, individually broken, truly one of a kind pieces. 15 different pairs of craftsmen's hand touch every single piece. And this is really what sets our cookware apart. That enameling process is proprietary. It's been developed for almost 100 years. You can see the multiple, multiple coats of enamel going on. It's not just one coat, it's not just paint, and it's baked at unbelievable temperatures, David, that fuse that enamel to the cast iron. That's what provides the durability, the beautiful color, the reliability and of course the easy clean and easy maintenance and there's me put to work packing orange boxes and the generations that are there I, can, I totally get behind that they love what they do so much that i love the product that comes out of there i love the food that we cook with it i love teaching people how to cook with it i love cooking with you david i mean it just makes the food that much easier and that much more delicious one day we have to visit the factory i i heard that we should do that david i think it would be amazing <laughs> they would have to pry me out of there those poor french people were like could you get the tall american right. out of here please <laughs> all right let's take a look at scallop potatoes that's right and we cook these in the skillet lid and i don't want you to for a moment think that this lid isn't functional on its own because it is. And you're going to have a tremendous amount of capacity. In fact, that is, I believe, two and a quarter quarts. Two and a quarter quart, David. So just over 10 inches diameter of cooking space. And Look you can at this see gorgeous food. The beautiful cheese layer on top, that creamy interior. And again. Oh, wait, what is that cheese? I, I, that looks a little GBD to it me. It does look GBD, David. How what did it, I not notice that? What does GBD stand mm. for, Chef? Golden Brown Delicious, David. <laughs> and look, I also want to show in here. I always credit you with oh, that phrase. Thank you. All of that cheese and everything just wiping away from the side. Side. This dripped over a little bit, which I don't mind at all on my table showing how the cookware actually gets used. But don't fret because that is going to clean right up just with a swipe of the spoon. I'm already getting all of that beautiful melted on cheese right hey, off of there. Can I tell you that we are very busy on our phone lines? We'd love to hear from you if you are a Le Creuset fan. Our testimonial line is open at 1 800 395 1601. Call us and tell us all about. What you love about this enamel cast iron cookware, this generational cookware, that is going to be the kind of cookware that you pass down to new generations of cooks in your family. You know, I always say that Le Creuset is going to be around long after we're all gone because it's one of those situations where cast iron endures. And when it's enamel cast like this, it looks great, it cooks beautifully. The results that you get, the comfort food this will yield for you and your family and friends, will be memorable and legendary. Won't you be a part of this exciting, this exciting group of people, collectors who bring this cookware home, who don't just bring it home to look at the color, they bring it home to cook great food inside. We've got more colors to show you, and we started our day with nine. There are now only six remaining, and they're getting more limited all the time in what we can ship now. 11,500 order for the day, and over 1,000 chef just during in the kitchen wow. with David. I'm gonna make my way around here, excuse me, cause you're busy cooking. And you're at the deep fryer, and I want to, don't want to do anything to interrupt that. All right. Because I'm hoping to eat what you're cooking. Oh, nearly. you should. All right. So, what we're talking about is the white. Now, I have two dozen left in white that can ship right now. Then we'll go to an advanced order, and when those are gone, we'll take white off the table. White is a color we don't do often from Le Creuset. It was a direct customer request, and we're delivering tonight. Here's your white. If you are a fan of cerise, which is the French word for cherry, I have 350 left that can ship right now. This is the one I need to order tonight because it's the color I collect in my kitchen. Here it is in cassis. Two dozen left in the cassis that I can ship to you right now. Here's the oyster, and I hope Stacy got her order in because this is what she collects. And how many we can ship now? 170. And this is the color that I know many of you will love if you have stainless steel appliances in your kitchen. Here's Marseille. I have 220 that can ship right now, but if you want the Caribbean, I now have fewer than 200 that can ship out on March 23rd. When the fewer than 200 left in the Caribbean are gone, we'll take Caribbean off the table. Remember, you're also getting 12 recipe cards with this, including chef's chicken thighs with the mint gremolata. That's, that's the recipe we're making tonight. But every one of the recipes inside come with a beautiful color photo. Uh, yeah, this is a beautiful sausage croissant overnight breakfast casserole. How good does that look? Delicious. Oh. I'm all about it. Everything bagel, focaccia bread. Hello. Polenta and mushrooms. There's the Braves chicken with the spring vegetables and the mint gremolata. This is slow cooked green beans and basil breadcrumbs. Oh, doesn't that sound good? Yum, right? And then Italian beef ragu. 
I'm all about these little recipes. I'm going to be all about them when I get mine home. So don't miss out on this. Take a look at our value story reminding you that if you went to retail to buy this identical piece, and the only place you'd find it would be LeCrosse.com. Correct. You're going to be paying $425. So right out of the gate, our price, Chef, is already over $195 wow. less. Do the math. It's $195 and two pennies less. Then if you add in the free shipping and handling, we're over $210 unbelievable. less. So let that just wrap around your brain for a moment. Anybody else that would try to buy this at LeCrosse.com would pay $425. You're paying $210 less. Okay, you've heard me say this before. You go to a store because there's an item you've had your, your eye on. And when you get there, they say, well, not only do we have the item you're looking for, but it's on sale today. And you're like, well, that's my lucky day. That's great. I'm thinking to myself, 20 bucks, good day, 30 bucks yeah. off. How about $210 off? What? I would be, after they had to revive me, I would go to and get my credit card <laughs> and get busy to the register. So this is what it's all about. You hear about this Le Creuset cookware, you hear about the enamel cast, and you want to be able to cook in it, but you're thinking, wow, some of those prices are just a little bit out of my reach. Tonight, we put it within your grasp. We've also put it on five easy payments to make it even easier to budget. Won't you take the chance tonight, the opportunity tonight, to pamper yourself and do good things for your family? Because the first time I cooked in a Le Creuset piece, I felt different. The food tasted different because I realized I was cooking in something that has stood the test of time and will continue to stand the test of time long after we're gone and we pass this down to other generations of cooks in our family. So join the fun. Join the family. Tonight's your night for Le Creuset. So let me tell you about two colors that we are shipping out now that are now incredibly limited. If you want the cassis, I have fewer than 12 that can ship out right now. And if you want white, I have fewer than 12 that can ship out right now. I th uh, oh, if you want cerise, 300 can ship now. Cassis, fewer than 12. Oyster, 100 that can ship wow. right now. We are getting super busy, you guys. Marseille, 190 that can ship right now, named after the southern port city of France, right. Marseille. And if you want Caribbean, oh my word. A moment ago, I told you I had 200 of these. Yeah. Now I've got fewer than 150 wow. of these. And these are shipping March 23rd, but when those are gone, this comes off the gone. table. Because we brought in a quantity that could ship immediately. Then we had advanced orders on every color. Right. When the advanced order quantity sells out, we take a color off the table. We started the day, Chef, with nine colors. I now have six. That means three of those nine colors went to the advanced order, then all the advanced orders sold Correct. out. Correct. And that's about to happen with Caribbean. We're about to sell out of the advanced order in Caribbean, and when we do, that'll come off the table. But you still have a chance to get a few left, so grab them while you can. What was that, Sean? 11,800 for the day, and in this show, 1,300 wow. are now gone. Wow. Oh, we just now moved to advanced order in Cassis and in white. So what I'm going to do is move these down just a hair. So our advanced orders are all together, okay? And I apologize for hanging with the colors. I know you want to see what Chef is cooking. We'll it's get back right. to it, I promise. But let me just tell you again so everyone's clear in case you're just tuning in. Started the day with nine colors. I now have six. Oh, you're right. Sorry. So it's these three that are advanced orders. So nine colors to begin with, three have sold out completely. If you want Caribbean, 120 left, they can ship March 23rd. Cassis is now in uh, advanced orders, shipping March 23rd. White is now shipping March 23rd. Still shipping immediately is Marseille, 120 left. Oyster is shipping right away. And Cerise is shipping right away. 250 in the Cerise. So, whew, let's come over here, join Chef Nate, and welcome Melinda out in California. Hi, Hi Melinda. Melinda. Good evening. Good evening. How are you this evening? Well, I'm surrounded by friends and one of my most favorite brands. I'm a happy guy tonight. Oh, I love La Crusade. And you're one of the few men my husband's not jealous of because I watch you all the time, and so does he. <laughs> well, and he knows I'm a whole country away from you. So, there you go. All well, right. My, my mother just passed, and she was just an, a great big fan of yours. And we used to go and compare notes on the TV when we were watching your show. She would be watching back there, and I'd be watching out here, and oh. we'd be Melinda, comparing notes and everything. Oh, that's so dear, Melinda. Uh, first of all, we're very sorry for your loss. What was what was Mom's first name? Isla. 
I'll, uh, well, you know what? We bless her memory tonight. We absolutely do. And we're so thrilled to meet you. Did, did Allah, like you, enjoy Le Creuset? She liked La Crusade, but it was a little too heavy for her because she was 90. Oh, bless her. Understand it. Oh, my. Yes, ma'am. But we always cooked with cast iron, and then when this came out, I, I ended up with um, La Crusade, and I probably got about 10 or 12 pieces of it now. Wow. It's easy to get excited about it. Want to add more to your collection, isn't it? Yes. Oh, Absolutely. my goodness. Absolutely. Well, maybe she didn't cook a lot in it, but I bet she loved that food you made in it, didn't she? That's true. Oh, yes. Yeah. She loved her food. Oh, that's so exciting. I'm so, so glad to hear about that. And I'm thrilled that you are such a fan of this brand. Did you pick up today's special value as well? Absolutely. Wow. Oyster. What? You got the oyster. Oh, wow. that oyster is so pretty, Melinda. Yes, I love it. It goes with my other oyster ones. Well, Perfect. and you know what? What's really interesting, you know, this whole, this whole effect here is called ombre. Where it's darker here, gets a little lighter in the middle, a little lighter here, and goes back to that darker color in the top. Do you like that? Yes, it's, very much so. It's really <laughs> sharp. It gives it dimension. Yes, it That's does. That's a great word for it. Absolutely. Well, Melinda, we are so tickled to meet you tonight. And again, sorry for your loss, but you know what? I think Allah is, is looking down right now and saying, look, my baby girl's on national TV talking to David. <laughs> Well, it was a pleasure to talk to you both, and thank you for bringing it back, and God bless you both. God bless you thank as well, you and, and all the best to you and your family. Thank you. You're so welcome, dear. Be well. Uh -oh. Thank you, you uh, too. Oh, thanks, Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thanks. Wow. We are, you know, this, these kinds of phone calls remind me that we are one great big family of foodies. Absolutely right. And everybody, no matter where they live, you know, there's a lot of crazy news that happens all the time. There is. Day in and day out. And I was just coming back yesterday from the Chicago House Race Show, and I was in the shuttle going from the airport to get my car. And a, lady, a couple of ladies were just coming home as well, and one of them turned around and she recognized me. And she said, David, do you know what I watch more than anything these days? I said, what's that? She said, QVC. Wow. I said, well, that's interesting. I'm, I'm glad that you're watching. She said, no, David, you don't understand. I don't watch the news anymore mm -hmm. because as soon as something gets political or crazy, I just turn it over to QVC. Right. Because you guys are always friendly, fun, optimistic, and I never have to hear bad news. It's true. So we're glad you're joining us. So if you are watching tonight because you're a little sick of all the other business, welcome on in. We're a friendly bunch. And we're all having right. some fun. We are having fun and we're cooking. That's right. All right. So here's the story, Glories. If you are shopping or have been shopping, you're one of 12,000 people since midnight who've ordered this, this today's special value. 1,600 during In the Kitchen with David. And if you want Cerise, 150 left that I can ship right now. Oyster? Oh, it's now shipping March 23rd. That's in advanced orders. 700 to go around. Okay. All right. So if you want, uh, Cerise, we're shipping uh, now. 150 left. Uh, Marseille, we're shipping now. 115 left. Oyster, we're shipping March 23rd. I have 700 left. White, we're shipping March 23rd. 1,500 left. 1,300. Cassis for shipping March 23rd, 220. But if you want Caribbean, I have two dozen left. Chuck, to be on standby. Because when two dozen of, of the Caribbean are gone, we're going to hand it off. Now, here's our value. Whew. Buckle up, kids. If you are looking for a value, we have delivered one big time. $425 is what you'd pay at lookrusade.com. Right out of the gate, we're over $195 less, right? And then if you add in the free shipping and handling, we're $210.74 less, okay? We're then going to put it on five easy payments and, of course, give you that free shipping and handling. So tonight, you've got an opportunity to bring home the color that makes your heart and your kitchen smile. But let's also talk about cleanup on this, Chef, because I think for a lot of folks, if they've never used Le Creuset before, this right. is enameled cast iron Correct. inside and outside. That's right. Talk to us about cleanup, and I'll keep an eye on your chips. So perfect, thank you. And you saw those scalloped potatoes that came out with all the baked on cheese. You can see here in this footage, that's just a wet towel wiping. Here's just soap, warm water, and any scrubby sponge or a scrub daddy or something I use scrub along daddy. it, and yeah. just one swipe, and you can see the enamel immediately looks brand new. There's no staining involved. You can soak it. The exposed rim you see here is not raw cast iron, David, that has a ground coat of enamel already on it. So you don't have to worry about anything rusting or anything oxidizing. This can uh, be soaked overnight. It's dishwasher safe. But honestly, David, I don't usually put my cast iron in the dishwasher. It's too big. My little girls at home fill up the dishwasher almost on a daily basis anyway, so there's no room. <laughs> 
But you just take a, a dish brush or a sponge and scrub it out, maybe some hot water and soap on a soak, and everything is going to come off of it. Well, and you know what else I want to tell you? Is that while you're seeing this beautiful Le Creuset piece on air tonight, we have hundreds of items on QVC.com from this brand. And if you're using that Q card on anything you're shopping for on air or online for, for between now and the end of March, you've got five easy payments, right? Right. But let me update you on colors and bring you back to Cerise. Cerise is shipping immediately, but I have fewer than 100 left that can ship out right now. And this Cerise is what I collect. I'm in love with it. Here it is in the Marseille. Seven dozen left that can ship right now. Here is Oyster, now shipping March 23rd. Fewer than 700. White, shipping March 23rd. 1300. Cassis sh uh, shipping March 23rd. 200 left. And if you want a Caribbean, I'm afraid it's gone. Wow. Chuck, my producer, is coming out here to get it. Come all the way out here, Chuck. <laughs> so everybody can see. Oh, now look at that camera with the light on it. Hey. <laughs> Chuck would wave, but his hands are full. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you. So now we started our day with nine colors, and wow. then there were five. Wow. Okay. These five remain. Let's take a look at that value story, reminding you, Chef, that this is extraordinary at your website, which is currently the only other place to buy this. That's correct. $425. A lot. Okay. So what we're going to do right out of the gate is bring that price down $195 and two pennies less. Then we're going to throw in free shipping and handling right. because everything is shipped by size and weight. Right. These are not lightweight vessels. They're not. So they're going to be, uh, it's going to be a pretty big amount. We're going to add to your $195, the free shipping. Now you're $210 less delivered to your door. To the front door. To the front doorstep. You don't even have to carry this to the car. You don't. Unless you're going to bring it up to grandma's house. That's true. Well, that might be the only time you carry it. Past the front door. Uh, anyway, we're looking at oven safe to 500 degrees. We're also talking about working, and we've got a graphic that talks about what stovetops this works on. Basically, every Everything. stovetop, including your campfire. I mean, good grief, you go camping with this vessel, you can cook over a campfire if you had a way to hoist it up over the flames. That's right. <laughs> I wouldn't suggest holding it over the flames, it might get a little toasty. But what I will tell you is if you've got regular gas, electric, ceramic stovetop, the radiant ring, induction, because remember, this is cast iron. All it has to do is adhere to a magnet to work on right. induction. It works in your regular oven. Now, I'm going to be full disclosure here. Yes, you can put this in your dishwasher, but it's a heavy piece. And it really might be a little too heavy for your dishwasher. I most certainly wouldn't put it on the top rack. No. And if you did put it, put it on the bottom rack. But you know what? Cleanup is so easy. I get my scrub daddy and a little bio cleaner sometimes. Super easy. Shoo, 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 shoo. Right. I'm done. Now, you and I were both in, were just in Chicago. That's right. Something we love about Chicago is deep dish pizza. And do you know what they cook their deep dish pizza in in Chicago? Cast iron. Cast iron pizza pans. And you know why? Because they want even heat distribution, because that thicker crust on Chicago deep dish needs to be toasty brown all the way around. It's a crispier crust. Right. And it's got loads of sauce and then cheese. And I, had, I went to Gino's East and had meat lovers. Delicious. Deep dish. Oh. Yummy. And, and David, this again is easy. You can make your own dough. You can buy almost any supermarket has the pre made dough now. And just with the cast iron gives you that beautiful texture of the crust that we would have seen in Chicago. And you can replicate that at home. I mean, there is something to be said about going to the city where it was invented and having it there, but why not have some at home too? Well, we might have had a golden ale beverage with it when we were in Chicago. Oh. Maybe. Just, I mean, we weren't just, driving. Just one. We weren't driving. That's right. So, you know. But I'll tell you what, it is an amazing piece of cookware, and we're awfully excited about this night. Can I tell you now that for the day, well over 12,000 are gone during this show alone. Wow. 2,000 wow. of these are now gone. One final update, Chef, and then we're going to come back and see you toward the latter part of the show for one more look at this before we wrap up the day. Now, in Cerise, delivering immediately. Oh, my word. I've got uh, a dozen and a half that can ship right now. Wow. So what is that? 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. All right, carry the one. 16. Eight. All right, 16 left I can ship out right now. That's why I'm in television. Can't do math. Here's the Marseille. Fewer than four dozen. The uh, oyster shipping out on March 23rd, 630. The white shipping out March 23rd, 1250. And finally, the Cassis shipping March 23rd, 175. Again, wow. one value story to remind you. At retail, $425. We're over $195 less. Throw in the free shipping and handling. We are $210.74 left. And Chef just made, is that cherry rhubarb crumble? This actually is a strawberry ginger 
streusel, and it's one of the recipes in that book. The, it's, there's fresh and candied ginger in there. It's so delicious. You should get a taste of this in a second. But look how easily that comes right off the enamel. Is it is it like it, lava? It's probably hot, but you can give a little little bit of a. Um, I can get just a little, little just tiny a little taste. taste. I love it. It's not too sweet. It's a perfect way to use extra summer berries. And, and my daughter's at home. We can't get enough of berries, so I'm always looking for ways mm. to use them. Is this recipe included? It absolutely is. <laughs> Good, right? Mmm. That's nicely done, All right. Chef. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> All right. Um, you guys, are we now in advanced orders on everything? Okay, we're advanced orders in every color but Marseille, and I have two dozen left in Marseille, and then it's going to advanced orders as well. Huge day, my friends. We've got one more look at this. Oh, I'm talking about QVC2. Yes. Okay, is it 9 o'clock yet? Yeah, it is. A little past. So every night at 9 o'clock, we kick something off on QVC2 called The Big Deal. You see it right here. You know, we have the Today's Special Value on Main Channel. Their value of the day is called The Big Deal. And tonight, it's from Joan Rivers, the Metallic Glamour 30-inch Double Ball Tassel Necklace. I remember back in my early days at QVC when I sold jewelry and worked with Joan, Joan loved the longer necklaces. She liked them because they pulled the look down, and she felt like the longer necklaces were slimming. And I understand they're also pretty trendy. Now, it's been a long time since I presented jewelry, so forgive me if I'm off base here. But I think that's part of the allure of a longer necklace. Stacy, would you agree? David, you are spot on, my friend. They do. They're slimming. I love the longer necklaces, and that's a pretty one from Joan Rivers. Okay, guess what? More brand new coming at you. How about our dessert of the month from Juniors? This is awesome. It's going to knock your socks off. It's 18 of the mini cheesecakes from Juniors in four different flavors, one of them brand spanking new. So what you're going to have here is you're going to have three of the carrot cake cheesecakes. Here in the middle is your brand new flavor, strawberry shortcake. You're going to get six of those. You're going to get six of the strawberry swirl you know and love. And then the other flavor, yes, it's on a, it's on a little dish so I can eat it right away. <laughs> the chocolate swirl. Okay, Judy, this one has your name on it, sweetheart. 18, those four flavors. We have it. It's a hot pick. Brand new, our dessert of the month. So popular already. Okay, David, take it away. All right, we're looking forward to those Junior's Easter minis. But right now, we're going to grow vegetables on your patio. That's right, you heard me correctly. Two different kinds of tomatoes, one type of cucumbers, and all from our friends at Roberta's. Eric Wallin is back with us. It's good to see you, sir. Great to be here with Always you, David. a pleasure to have you back. Thank you, and thank I you. love these container plants that you bring to our foodies on In the Kitchen with David. They're so easy. Well, they are so easy. And the nice thing about this is you're going to get two plants that yield these. And yes. these are called Sweet and Neat Yellow Cherry Tomatoes. So you'll get two plants that grow these. Just like little yellow candy. Exactly. <laughs> but they're good for you. Like, they almost look mm -hmm. like gumballs. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to get a plant, two plants that make these beautiful cucumbers. Uh, Yes, these are the pedicure cucumbers. They grow straight about eight inches, and you get loads and loads of cucumbers. And then two plants that grow. These are the uh, summer last tomato. It is bigger than the cherry. See the difference in the size? Yeah. They call it a cocktail tomato, but it is just as sweet as these cherries. Actually, it was even rated sweeter than the cherries. So look here, you're getting two of the cucumbers, two of the summer last tomatoes, mm -hmm. and two of the sweet. And, and neat. neat. Yes. We do not ship these until it's safe to plant in your area. Yes, there is a growing guide that comes with each one. Oh, yeah. And since we introduced this, over 14,000 sets of this ordered. Really? I only have 4,800 left to go around I think tonight. We only, yeah, we haven't aired it once or twice. And if you're going to buy this on auto delivery tonight, here's what's going to happen you're going to get your shipment now or when it's safe to plant in your part of the country. And then we'll do it next spring of 2020. That's great because you never know, you never know if you're going to catch us. Last year we had one with eggplants and uh, sweet peppers. There's so, about the tomato there because uh, I'm yeah, afraid yeah, yeah. we missed a little bit of that. Okay. And I want them to see how juicy these they, are. They are very, very juicy. Look at that. Where and they it? are so sweet. Oh, there we, where's Mike? Where are you at home? There We're we right go. there. <laughs> I had to move some things. That's All right. okay. Look at that. I want you guys to look. Now, just scrape the, those, those cut pieces away. Yeah, push those away. And right there is what I want you to see. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Kill there me. We go. <laughs> no, no. All right. Look so, at that. Look at that. That's what I'm after. Yes. Right there. And that is juicy and that is sweet. And I need you to taste a little bit. Oh, well, I'll taste a lot of that. <laughs> it, so we've got this, the summer last. And they call them summer last because they last all summer. Also, 
the plant stays good all summer. And one thing that a lot of people don't understand. Ooh, let me hit these with a little salt. Oh, salt and pepper. There you go. Mm -hmm. They don't know is that what, the more leaves that are on your tomato plants, the more sugar they're going to produce, and love the sweeter salt. they are. I love salt and pepper mm -hmm. on my tomato. Mmm, it's a big burst. Isn't that nice? Of juice. Mm -hmm. Oh man, is that good? The, and Fresh and delightful. And this means I can go out to my patio, back porch, the deck. So vegetal, and pick yeah. Fresh tomatoes. Pick them off. Vegetalis bred these to be in containers. That's one thing because you don't have to go out and you don't have to rototill and you don't have to weed. You just get loads of produce. But they bred them to produce lots, David. Just as much as those six to eight foot tall tomatoes, right. you're going to get on these short one to two foot tomato plants. Well, can I tell you that these are very popular, already going quickly. 14,000 orders since we first debuted them. I have 4,500 remaining. What you should also know is that these are on four easy payments, but that easy pay goes away end of day today. If you're using your Q card tonight, you can turn four pay into five pay. We're allowing Q card customers to do five pay through the end of the month on any item they order. That's great. So, yeah. do your, your, your perfect summer garden salad. If you're doing caprese or you're doing whatever you love, mm -hmm. these are going to be your starter pieces and they're growing right in containers, designed for containers. In fact, do best in containers. They will grow in your, in your vegetable garden if you want to, but they are designed for containers. In, in the UK, where they don't have a lot of space, put them on your patio, on your deck, even inside a sunny room in a window, they will grow and produce just like this. But not only stay in small and producing lots, David, but they're designed, they're hybridized to produce faster. So you get your tomatoes in 30 days. That's great. Not 60, 65, 70. Cucumbers, about a week later, about 40 days. Okay. You'll be eating cucumbers. Here's one of those. I put two in this basket. So if we plant these, say, we get uh, the latest, probably April, first week of May, some parts of the country, yeah. the coldest parts of the country. Uh -huh. So you're looking at uh, either May or June. June tomatoes. June tomatoes. Yes. How's that sound? Fresh Everybody June else is tomatoes. waiting until August. And you're wow. picking it in June. And you're picking them from container pots on your back porch. You're not tilling up the ground. You're not going out and having to worry about that. In my neighborhood, they don't allow vegetable garden or vegetables to be grown in the yard oh. because it attracts deer. And so they say if you're going to have any kind of vegetables growing in your on your property, you have to put them on in containers on your back porch. Well, or this is perfect for that because if you it's put great. a regular tomato plant in a pot like this, it's going to grow really big. The root system is going to get overcrowded. You're going to have to water it every day, and it's just not manageable. These are designed to grow one to two foot tall, but produce just as much as those big guys. Oh, it's so great. Don't miss out on this. These are going quickly. Lots and lots of us are loving this idea of being able to cook, the, or, or grow rather, and mm -hmm. then cook, or whatever you're going to do with them. Uh, these three vegetables. Now, you're going to get the first. These are called sweet and neat. Sweet and neat. Sweet and neat little, uh, little uh, Yellow candy cherries, tom yes. yeah, to tomatoes. Then you've got these cucumber pedicues. Uh -huh. They're eight inches, and you get loads of them. If my sister's watching right now. I'm sure her mouth is watering. She loves cucumbers. And then, of course, we've got these summer, summer last. last tomatoes mm -hmm. designed to last, last all summer. All summer, and your plant will look good all summer. Like I said, these leaves that stay good. And a lot of tomatoes, David, when they start to ripen, the leaves all turn brown. And your tomato looks really ugly. This plant keeps its leaves and it keeps producing the sugar for your tomatoes. And pick them off when it's warm out. So, less than a month ago, we debuted this item. Mm -hmm. And now over 15,000 have been ordered. And I have 3,800 remaining. These are going very quickly. And imagine getting when you're when it's safe to plant let's take a look at our zone map guys sure because this zone map will let you know when your item will ship to you because we will not ship until it's safe to plant but do you realize that we're already now shipping to some of the warmest parts of the country yes the 18th we start shipping down to florida and southern california or soon we'll start shipping yes, yeah yes. exactly and then into april may uh by the by the third week in may everybody shipped isn't that crazy? All right, so look, David, you like to your point, 5th, 520. If we ship to the coldest part of the country in, Maine. in 30 days by 620, before July, you'll be having tomatoes. So just before 4th of July, you're going to have a bumper crop of tomatoes. That's right. And a week later, you'll have cucumbers. Yeah. 15,000 now gone and 3,500 remain. These are going quickly. I want to taste the sweet and neat. Oh, yes. These are little guys. Mm. And are these, did you say they're sweeter by nature? Cherries are always sweeter and by nature. Okay. High sugar content. Mmm. Mmm. It's good. Really huh? good. It?
they told me, Eric, they said, these are going to produce it's tons, like candy. but who cares if, how much they produce if they don't <laughs> taste good, right? Oh, I love them. So they increase the sugar content. I don't know how they do it, but it, I do know it's not GMO. Woo! It's all done it's all old fashioned nice. way. And what would you want, what we want you to remember, you're getting that growing guy, but we also have something very special at Roberta's. It's a gotta grow guarantee. Tell us about yes, that. Yes, because everything has to grow. So what we do with this collection is we're going to give you a 90 day warranty on it. You're going to know in 90 days whether you like it or not. If you, if you have any issues, give us a call and we'll take care of you. Well, enjoy these great vegetables. And Eric, oh, uh, I understand you're going to be back with I, me from Orange and Down Home with David. Yes, I've got something new for you tomorrow. All right, looking forward to it. Thank and you, I think David. We're going to see you on Sunday, aren't we? As well, we have a big day on Sunday. We do. Yes, oh, it's yes. our gardening event. Uh huh. Okay, 16,000 now gone for the for the month, and I have a fewer than 3,000 left to go around. We've been busy in this show. Thank, Thank you, you, sir. Appreciate you. All right, so we go from the vegetables to dessert, and that's always a good place to find yourself. And we're talking about juniors, and we're talking about another hot pick, one of our star products of the day, one of our best sellers. And we've got it for you tonight. These are the Junior's Easter Mini Cheesecake. So we've got some new flavors, some things you're going to love for the springtime. And we've got Alan Rosen here to tell us all about them. Remember, three easy payments on your credit card. It's our dessert of the month, which kicked off earlier today. 1,500 sets already gone, young man. Wow. That's, that's amazing. Lot. You got to remember, each one of these is 18 individual cakes, David. Yeah. You're going to get six of our strawberry swirl Easter cheesecakes with the pastel colored chips. You're going to get three of our carrot cake cheesecakes, three chocolate swirl cheesecakes, and six brand new strawberry shortcake cheesecakes. In this assortment, David, David they're all quarter pound cheesecakes. So you're literally getting four and a half pounds Love of cheesecake, it. but you're getting 18 individual servings, so you're not going to waste a bite. And we're going to start with America's favorite cheesecake. That, of course, is the cheesecake with the strawberry swirl and the Easter sprinkles. Yep, if we can get a shot. Of this, you can see strawberry swirled throughout. But folks, if you've never had Junior's cheesecake before, it's supposed to be creamy and smooth and stick to your fork good, just like that. Cream cheese, fresh eggs, sugar, touch of vanilla, swirled with fresh strawberries. You're going to get six of these. Again, look at this side. Look at all that fresh strawberry. Look at all puree. that filling. You know what I love about you and your bakers? You are not stingy with the strawberry. We, we almost try not to measure, David, <laughs> because we want people never to be disappointed. All right, let me so you're going to get six there. of those. And don't forget their ship dates for these if you want it closer to Easter time or right Thank away. Thank you for reminding Sorry. me because I was completely consumed with having a bite. Let me stop here for a moment because I've got a job to do. Hello. All right. Um, we're shipping now or April the 15th. Right, which will be right in time for that Easter holiday. True story. Now, if you want it now, we have only a thousand for the immediate ship. A few more to go around for April 15th. All will arrive prior to Easter. And we have an auto delivery with two shipments. So you can get your first shipment now or to April 15th. And then your next shipment comes in holiday of December, December this year. And then I'm guessing that the Easter sprinkles turn to Christmas sprinkles. Correct. That's the only difference. Mm. So here you have uh, angel food cake on the bottom, right. strawberry infused into the cheesecake. So we take some strawberry filling. We put it right into the cheesecake. You may find a, a lone strawberry or two. Then we have a whipped cream topping. So it's like a strawberry shortcake, David, but an individual size. We've never done this before. First time. We've done it in a bigger cake, but never in a small one. Wait till you find this. Well, let me try, try this, this first one. I, oh, mm -hmm. that's your first bite? I think you had a couple already. I may have had a few I others. Thanks did. for wrapping me out there. Sorry. All right. Mm. I want you to save room. All right. Oh, of course. Not that you need room. Here, I'll take that oh, one for I got a hollow leg. Who are you kidding? Here. Oh, thanks. Okay. I set you up. You're a good man. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, so this is the strawberry shortcake. You're going to get six of those. So you cannot do all your holiday mm. entertaining. Mm. That's really good. Thank you. Oh, I like that a lot. It's nice and light and refreshing. Right. It's perfect. So you have great flavors for Easter here because you have the Easter swirl. You also have this carrot cake cheesecake, and you can save those strawberry shortcakes if you're inclined for your summer entertaining. Because they'll freeze up to six months. Exactly. Just keep these in your freezer for six months, folks. No need to defrost overnight like the large cakes. Now we have all the ingredients in our big carrot cake cheesecake, but in small, okay? Quarter pound servings. Carrots in that, in that mixture. You can actually see the carrots right there, David. Look at that. Fresh carrots, Little raisins, bits of carrot. walnuts, pineapple, apple juice. Hey, Stacey, you'll be able to eat this. It has nuts and twigs in it. New York, <laughs> New York style cheesecake. And then we have a blend of buttercream and cream cheese frosting on top, David. We used to have it all be all cream cheese, but we thought maybe that was a little too cheesy, pardon the pun. So now you get a little bit of both. I always tease uh, Stacy because she, she loves to eat lots of um, 
very healthy organic things. Well, I call them nuts and twigs. There's, there's nuts in here. There's raisins. There's carrots. She um, said you mean vegetables. Pineapple. Yes, there's I pineapple. Do. There's apple sauce. There's a, there's a veritable fruit basket in there. <laughs> right, there is. Vegetable in here and the carrot, huh? Yeah, there's nuts carrots and, twigs. and, nuts and there's twigs, fruits. Darling. Nuts and twigs just for you. Mm-hmm. That's good carrot. Wow. Wow. rabbit noise. Mm. Oh, this little... blows away. Regular carrot cheese, uh, regular carrot cake. I agree. Oh my God. The flavor of the carrot is so, it, well, it's authentic because I know yeah, you use we, authentic ingredients. We literally ingredients. grind carrots. There's a funny story. I was once selling a carrot cake here years ago and I went back into the green room after I said, order more carrots. And someone looked at me and goes, use carrots? I said, well, what do you think is supposed to be in carrot cake? <laughs> what do you think goes in carrot cake? Pretend mm. carrots? Mm. Real carrots. You will like nut, nuts and twigs too if you eat this. Oh, I'll have some. Okay. I know you will. All right. I'll Next up, about it. we have a chocolate swirl cheesecake. 85% chocolate, so not too much swirl, oh, but chocolate. just enough. It's almost like, I described it earlier, it's like a cheesecake chocolate bar. Well, that doesn't sound disappointing at all. No, it does doesn't. It? So I got to hand this. You know, there's a very tall man standing next to me. Waiting for this. I know, I, don't, I, I want to show this to people, but I also want to feed the big uh -huh, guy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Sorry. There you go, my man. Yes, you don't want me to get hangry. I want to show mm. people how it comes, David, while you take that last bite. Mm. All right, I've tasted all of them now. You have. Well, I didn't taste the carrot cake, but by proxy, I tasted it through Stacy. So, happy dance! There it is, all of them. All right, now let's start to take a look at how they come right. packaged. The reason people love this so much, Dave, is because you're getting 18 quarter pound cheesecakes, four and a half pounds worth of cake, sure. individual servings. Keep these in your freezer for up to six months. No need to defrost overnight. Just pop one out when company comes over, put it on your favorite cake plate, and in 30 to 45 minutes, you have a beautiful dessert just like we showed you right here. Again, you can use some of this for your holiday entertaining, some of it for your barbecues, in your freezer for up to six months. If you do open up the box though, just make sure you wrap up the whole box. In so that plastic way, wrap. Right, so you don't get any flavors from the rest of your exactly freezer. Exactly right. You heard that before, I've huh, once or twice. Hey, can I tell you that this is the kind of thing that is perfect for portion control. For the day now, we've had over 2,000 ordered. That means 500 during In the Kitchen with David. If you want it delivered now, I have 800 left. If you want to deliver it on 415, a few more to go around. But remember, there's also an auto delivery opportunity. If you go with auto delivery, you'll get your first shipment either now or April 15th. And your second shipment, Alan, will come in December in time Correct. for holiday. And the only thing we do is change out the pastel colored chips for a green and red chip. If you take a shot right down there in front, we have it for really, you. Really, really perfect. These freeze beautifully up to six months. So definitely uh, order these and shop with confidence. My mom orders your little mini cheesecakes every year at Christmas time for her Christmas party. Right. But I think about she and her her girlfriends. They have a uh, she has a group of girlfriends that call themselves the Golden Girls, and they get together once a month at one another's house and they play cards. So whoever hosts Has either does lunch or dessert. Well, in this case, the dessert's already taken care of. And you don't even need a serving. You don't even need a knife. No. To cut it, unless, I mean, some people do like to share these. You know, if they're a household of two, they might decide to share one. David's saying don't I'm not share. Sharing but again, look at this. The same as our large cakes, but in quarter pound servings, strawberry throughout, cream cheese, fresh eggs, sugar, heavy cream, a touch of vanilla, oh. all that strawberry puree. And, and then all you have that, that sweet goodness. And you have that pastel colored top. Really perfect for the Easter really holiday. Perfect. And even if you don't want to serve for the holiday, it's still a strawberry cheesecake, which, as you know, David, is the most popular flavor to mix into cheesecake. To mix with cheesecake. And I'm going to tell you, coming up a little later in the show, we have the Ristelli Prime Rib for Easter. What a great meal. So let that be your savory centerpiece of the meal and let juniors do the desserts. If, would it be helpful this Easter if we could check desserts off your to do list? Would that be helpful if you only had them uh, to work on the dinner and the sides? And, and, yeah. and by the way, if you're only having a small group, six people, you have enough dessert. If you're having 18 people, you have enough dessert. Well, you know you what you're not putting in your refrigerator after it's over? A half-eaten cheesecake. What do I do with this? Right. right? That's that. Look yeah. at that, David. I just cut into that one. You can see there's a whole strawberry inside of there. Okay. So oh, sometimes. That make me mad. Oops, sorry, I dropped it. But sometimes you will find one or more. It's well, like a treasure hunt. Is there a $20 bill in there? Look at that. Okay. So that just shows you, David, what we're, how we're making this. The reason it's infused and, and strawberry flavor. Because it's real strawberry. There's strawberries in there. So you're not going to get one in every bite, but that's how we make this cheesecake look pink mm. and like it's ready for dressed mm. up Reese's. Because so it's pink because there's strawberry in there. Right. Oh my word. You want the strawberry, strawberry, David? I got this strawberry. Yeah, you got one? Mm. You want another one? Mm-hmm. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> It's an embarrassment of riches. All right, everybody, get your cheesecakes. That's what this is all about. We do a dessert of the month, hoping that it will last all month. 
But this is the first day it's been on the air. You were on earlier today. Yes. And between that airing and this one, over two, th how many, Sean? No? Over 2,300 ordered in one day. And 2,300 sets. Right. And remember, each one, David, are individually baked. Each one of these cakes is baked in a water bath, just like our large cakes. Each one of ha has to be frosted. And can I say that we have fewer than 600 that can ship right now? Yeah, that the, they're going the, quickly. The reason that happened, David, is we just can't make these quick enough, and we just started. They actually asked me for more today, so we're going to make some more on Saturday. And because Sunday. it's been so popular. Because it was so popular this yeah, morning, yeah, yeah. exactly. Well, between but, that airing and this one, now over 2,300 for the day, and we're getting busier. Now, I didn't taste the carrot cake earlier. Okay, well, you're going to taste now. But look at the two raisins. When I cut it, the two raisins just came off on my knife right in the middle. Golden raisins. Because what? Golden raisin. Because what's in there, David, is what's in there: carrots, raisins, pineapple, applesauce. Little little nutmeg. Mm. Stacy, I like the nuts and twigs. <laughs> it's the first fruit and vegetable he's had all day. All day. Oh, no, he just had tomatoes. No, I did have tomatoes. I love tomatoes. And tomato, technically a fruit. Yes. Cucumbers though a vegetable, right? Yes. Yes. Right? I don't know. But not in cheesecake. No, yeah, don't put cucumber in cheesecake. That'll get a little weird. I don't know. Tell Stacy about it. She might like it. But again, brand new. You're going to get six of that strawberry swirl that you love so much. You're going to get six of this strawberry shortcake. New York style cheesecake infused with strawberries. You have that cream on top. So creamy. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. Yeah. And the kids are going to love this one, by the way. It's just it, light and refreshing and lovely. Listen, is that sponge cake on the bottom? Yes, it is. Yeah. Oh, that's perfect. Just, me, just what the doctor ordered for, for strawberry shortcake, right? One more time. I want to just show you. You're oh, please. Get 18. Just like this, folks. Straight from your freezer. Beautiful. No waste. Take what you want when you want it. So, we're going to encourage everyone to stay on the line. We are busy, busy, busy. $63.74, but look more importantly at the Easy Pay. Three of them. If you're using your cue card tonight, it's five. So, certainly uh, consider that. This is M62803. Mr. Rosen, always a pleasure, nice sir. Nice to see you, David. Nice to have you Thank back. you. All right, we're going to just remind you that every single day we have products we call the star products of the day. They are our hot picks. And if you're looking for those, just search hot picks on QVC.com. We'll get you all squared away. And you can check them all out, shop for them right on our website. And it's always lots of fun. Let me also encourage you to follow me on Instagram at David Venable QVC. That's David Venable QVC with the blue check mark. There's only one of me on Instagram. Anybody else that doesn't have the blue check mark? Not me. Uh, but I just posted some cool Insta stories for today's special value and a quick little look at colors. But I think even some of the colors I showed you before the last hit of the today's special value are gone. And now already we moved into advanced orders on every color remaining. So check out my Instagram at David Venable QVC. Follow Stacy at Stacy QVC. And you'll be able to see all the cool things she posts and the fun things she does for step by step cooking with Stacy Monday nights on Q2 at 6 p.m. Now it's time to talk Lennox. 62 piece 1810 stainless steel flatware, service for eight. If you want service for 16, buy two sets. I have two patterns to show you. And this is Ellie King. First, let me say Hello. hi to her. Hi, friend. Nice hey. to see you. Good to be here. Um, Ellie is a busy wife and mom. She has, I believe, three boys at home. I do. Plus a, a, plus a husband. That means yes. four. Yeah. And is there a dog? There's a dog. Okay, five. You <laughs> got five boys. Fish. And some fish. Okay, you got like seven boys <laughs> to take care of at home. So she's a busy lady. And she's outnumbered pretty substantially. Yes. But I've got, a, I've got a sneaking good idea you run that household, so that's a good thing. Hey, let's talk about fantastic flatware. Good for your five boys or for anybody who Absolutely. wants it for a special occasion or everyday flatware. That's the beauty of Lennox. Let's take a look at our two patterns, and I'd love it if you would, please, ma'am, okay. to describe these for us. All right, so first up, we have our Balden. I love this because it's a really sleek, modern look. I love the wide handle, the rounding at the end. And then we have our Somerville. This is a really special piece. I love the little swirling detail that we have that goes up the handle. And notice that at the base of the handle, it's wide. And as it goes up the utensil, it starts to taper. So you're getting two completely different looks here. I feel like we have something to suit everybody's taste. Well, and you're also going to love the value on this. At your website at Lennox.com. This same set of flatware, all 62 pieces, would be $401 and wait for it, 76 cents. All right? We're going to check in at, uh, no, I beg your pardon, $525. <laughs> yes, that's right. We're $401 and 76 cents less. That's it. That's the savings. Yeah. Hello. Sorry about that. This is a good story because you win and big in this story. We're, four, we're over $401 less. I know. And wow. we're five easy payments of $24.65. 
and it's the only day this month at this price. I love it. If you would please, ma'am, let's yes. walk through what's included in this setup. Again, service for eight. Okay, so this is our Somerville pattern that we're going to be looking at. You're getting eight of your dinner forks. That's your little bit larger fork. You're also getting eight of your salad or dessert forks. And for my three boys, this is the perfect fork for their mouth every dinner time. Right down the center, you're getting eight of your dinner knives. You're also getting eight of your play spoons. These spoons are great for soup, cereal, eating your ice cream. Up above that, you're getting eight of your teaspoons. These are the spoons that we use for our pudding, our applesauce. I throw these in the boys' lunches every day. Now up here, this is what I call the bonus level. These are not your typical pieces you're going to get in a flatware set. You're getting eight of your long-handled beverage spoons. Not only great for mixing drinks or eating parfaits, but what about getting the olives out of the jar or that little bit of jelly that's left at the bottom? Then you're also getting David's favorite. I eight. love these. <laughs> you do. You're getting eight sporks. This is your spoon fork combination. So if you want to scoop and stab at something love like it. a cobbler or chili, these are great for that. See, up until now, you had to go to the Colonel to get those. Yeah, you did. <laughs> and anymore. they're plastic. <laughs> yeah. I enjoy the Colonel's 11 herbs and spices. I'm not going to lie to you. I do. <laughs> and if you look closely under the seat of my front seat of my car, you'll see a few crumbs. Yeah, you will. All right. <laughs> Full disclosure. But <laughs> let's also talk about our hostess pieces because yes. this helps to round out the set. It sure does. These are so important. You're getting your meat fork, serving spoon, slotted spoon, cake server, gravy ladle, and then this is your cold meat fork. But honestly, you could use that for serving any type of meat that you want. Well, this is such a treat to have all the pieces match. And when you're entertaining, maybe for Easter, we're looking ahead to the next yes. big holiday, Mother's Day right around the corner. Maybe you're going to have some folks over for a graduation party in June. Right. You've got high school and colleges graduating. This is going to be exciting for you. Now, let's also remind you, five easy payments on your credit card and our two, our two new patterns again, please. Right. We have our, the first one we're going to look at is that Balden. It's very sleek. It's elegant, very modern and clean. Then we have our Somerville. It has a really artistic flair to it. I love the little lines we see that are engraved through it. And as I mentioned before, the bottom of that handle is wide. As it moves up, it begins to taper, which also adds to that artistic look of Somerville. Now, let's also tell you that both patterns are popular. You've got five easy payments. And at Linux.com, this same set is $525. Is That's that what you're right. Excited? That's right. Over $401 less is what we're talking about. And five easy payments on that credit card tonight. So certainly think about this for everyday flatware because this goes in the dishwasher beautifully, right? Oh, yes. I'm so glad you mentioned that because we want this to be practical. We know you're using your spoons, your knives, and forks every day. I also want you to hear it's a sturdy stuff. That's right. And it's because it's 1810 stainless steel. That's the best that you can get. Yeah, and you're talking about something that is really going to stand up to the test of time. I love these larger serving pieces, one pierced, one solid. So That's when right. you're serving something with liquid, like say uh, uh, green beans cooked in, you know, in in water, absolutely, that kind of thing. You you got a, a wonderful cold meat fork, or maybe this is the fork you'll put on that Easter ham that you're baking. Yes. I can almost smell it now. And oh, then I, I can also wait. taste it the next morning when those buttermilk biscuits are baking. <gasps> mm. And you take that extra piece of ham from Easter dinner and you slide it between that freshly mm. baked buttermilk biscuit and you clap that lid together and it's like a good time breakfast sandwich. Ooh. That's what that is right there. Maybe a little cheese and some mustard up on there. Oh, and an egg. Got a frying egg on Let's it. get some egg up in it too. Because <laughs> just for Ellie, let's get some egg up in it. Yes. All right, so see, I just get all wrapped up, wrap up with the food. Yeah. Five easy payments on your credit card. I think I'm in the right job. This is H217770, and we want to show you the difference between what we call American sizing and continental sizing. Right, so our Linux 1810 on the bottom, that is continental sizing. You can see the difference. And then what I love to show too, notice the difference between the luster and shine. The one on the top is the old one I used to use. The you know what the one on top is? <laughs> what? College cafeteria knife. I had a feeling that was coming. You're right. And if we were going to try to cut a tough piece of meat with this, it just might bend. Yeah, forget about it. And then I love this. Look at the difference in the width. There you can really see the difference with the Linux 1810 stainless steel. That's why you heard me tap that on the tabletop and you could hear the heft. 
you could really appreciate the thickness and the substantial quality of this Absolutely. stainless steel. Absolutely. And again, Allie, this is 1810 stainless steel. It's right. built to last. It is built to last. And what the 1810 means is that 18% is chromium, which gives it that strength that you need. The 10% is that nickel that gives it that beautiful luster and shine. I always tell people when you put your flatware on the table, especially that knife or maybe your big tablespoon, look down in it, you're going to see a reflection. You could put your lipstick on using your spoon. Well, let me also tell you, I have seen my mother put on her lipstick holding a table knife. I have <laughs> We've all done it. True story. And I, right now she's shaking her head at the TV <laughs> saying, David, don't do it. Don't do it. She'd hold it. <laughs> It works. I know. She's like right in there. She probably didn't make that face, though. No, no she probably did not. didn't. Boy, she's going to cut me out the wheel. Oh. All right, so let me tell you this. Uh, we are very excited about the two pattern choices. If you would, please, ma'am, walk us through these. Sure. We have our Balden, which is our really modern, sleek, um, elegant flatware with that nice rounded bottom. And then we have our Somerville, which has a little more of an artistic look to it has those beautiful engraved lines. Both of these showcase that 1810 so well. At Linux, we have something we love to say. We say people feast with their eyes first. Mm -hmm. So when they sit at the table, they're gonna look at the dinnerware, the flatware, and how the food's presented, then they dig in. And I promise you, you will feel so good when you have your Linux 1810 out, whether it's for a fancy dinner or just the girlfriends over for some muffins and coffee. If you would, please take us through the entire tabletop sure. because everything you see here is what you're getting. I'm, I'm moving this other knife just because we wanted to show the other pattern, but you're getting everything right. you see on this table when you make this order. Absolutely. So you're getting eight of your dinner forks. That's your little bit larger fork. You're also getting eight of your salad or dessert forks. Down the center here, you're getting eight of your dinner knives. You're also getting eight of your play spoons. That's your little bit bigger spoon. Eight of your teaspoons. Up here, you're getting eight of your long handled beverage spoons. You're also getting eight of your sporks, your spoon fork combination. And you're getting the serving pieces you need. Your meat fork, slotted spoon, slotted spoon, serving spoon, cake server, gravy ladle and your cold meat fork. It's just perfect. Don't miss out on this opportunity. We've got it all coming together for you at a really fantastic price and five easy payments. Miss Ellie, hang in there. So good to see you. Good to see you, my angel. Tell your family we said hi. I will. And keep all those boys in line. I'll try. All right. In the meantime, let's talk to another lady who's got a house full of boys at home she keeps in line, our Stacy. I sure do. David, coming up, we have a hot pick, and it is a great value because we've got a sale price on the KitchenAid mini stand mixer. But this isn't just mini. It sure is mighty. It can do actually five dozen cookies at a shot. Uh, it's an expiring offer. First of all, we reduced the shipping and handling. Love that. Look at these gorgeous colors. Uh, but at retail, this would be $419 and change. With our reduced shipping and handling, we're $157 less. And guess what? You get that favorite, most requested, most wanted attachment, the Flex Edge Beater, along with your mini. That's a powerhouse for sure. So full presentation with Tina Varelli coming up, who's going to make these awesome looking chocolate biscotti. Can't wait. Can't wait. Welcome back, everyone. It's In the Kitchen with David on this Wednesday night. We're glad that you are shopping with us. And if you're not shopping, we're just glad you're watching. Always nice to have you here. And we're a big, friendly bunch. And we hope you'll join us every Sunday at noon and Wednesday nights at 8. We've got a fantastic item now for anyone who has ever gone, oh, I've got to get out of the microwave. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it's hot. Where do I put it? Where do I put it? And you may not say all those things, but you think them when you're coming to the hot, from the microwave with a hot bowl of soup, for example, right? So what we're going to do from our friends at Architect, the same company that make those concave cutting boards, we're going to bring you this Architect set of four hot lift microwave helper and hot grip set. $22.50, not on easy pay tonight, but if you use that cue card, you can put it on five pay tonight. Five pay. And I've got great colors for you. Now, you're going to be able to order this set either in the red, Here's the blue, this is green, and black is most limited. Let's go over and introduce Mark Charles Masilli. He's our gadget guru for now 16 years. 18 years. 18 years is what I meant to say. <laughs> 
And here is something that is a classic problem. Yep. Take us through this. So basically, you have a bowl, whether it's reheating mac and cheese, whether it's getting some rice. Bowl this of soup is my bowl of soup, thing. a cup of uh, this will fit plates, bowls, serving pieces. What I love is you get you grab it. This is piping hot. You get complete balance. You bring it over, and what's important is it's wrapped in silicone. The silicone is 600 degrees safe. Never going to get overheated from you. You never any boil over will be caught in here. No splattering on the bottom of your plate. So you have a so clean if my, plate. So if my soup starts to boil in the microwave, then it'll it boil right there. Side, yep. It'll go right in that little area. And you area. can grab this clean. Look at this. You, they, and that's see, not hot. See that design right there? Warm, not hot. That's bubbling, hot, piping hot. I can grab this with full control. Look, no slipping, no sliding. This comes off. Now, this is piping hot, so I'm not going to touch it, but let's go to this bowl real quick. So that bowl is a soup bowl. This is a pasta bowl. Look at the way it sits. Now, I didn't put it in the microwave yet, but look how it sits underneath. What I love is there's that silicone lining. There's air in there that holes there in, on purpose, right? This is also important. This actually comes out. What happens is if you have a bowl of meatballs, this becomes a dome as a splatter guard. Splatter inside. guard. So now, Brilliant. Brilliant. hot coming out, splattering in, steaming your food. So you can use it either way. And then we give you the pot mitts because these are trivets, flat trivets. Remember, 600 degrees safe, dishwasher safe, everything, BPA free, silicone. I can go into the oven and grab my croissant. My croissant. I can pull the rack with this. I can pull this. I can use the two trivets as the two pieces as trivets. I'm gonna grab See that right piece. there? And I've used those pieces. So everything is silicone, no burning, no hurt. And we love the bowl because I can grab it with my bare hands. So in this pack up, you're gonna get two of the bowls with the silicone liners. You get two bowls and a set of two of the little mitts slash yep. trivets. Yep. Here are your color choices. This is red. Here is your blue. Don't forget green. And most limited is black. Now, these are $22.50 with no easy pay offer today, unless, Chuck, we're using that big old cue card. Might it be close by, sir? Think you can arrange that for me? You are going to love using your cue card on this tonight because, you know, Mark Charles, ordinarily with cue card, how many easy pays do we get? Uh, I thought it was like three. Three. Yeah. So today? For the entire month of March, oh, the anything whole? you buy for the whole month of March yeah. on your cue card, five. <laughs> now, the only exception is gift cards. So if you're buying this tonight with your cue card, you can pop this on five easy payments. How are you doing? Yeah, right? Look at the size of this. Now, this is shrimp and it, rice. Yeah, in a, in a glass bowl. Look at the size of it. So what I love about this, and I'll bring this over here. Look at the size of that bowl and that bowl. It fits everything. It becomes a balance on top. So whether it's this, and I'm going to just, because this is piping hot, I'm just going to take this off to show you what's underneath there. I can take a bigger plate like this and steam it inside the oven there. Remember, I could use the silicone things to actually steam on top of that. Then I'm going to just take this off, this is cold, and show you that I can put another rice bowl in there. Did you ever think about reheating two of the coffees? You have two coffees. See, that's my big thing in the morning. Okay. Stacy gave me an insulated mug for Christmas. I need yeah. to use that for my coffee in the morning because after about 15 minutes, my coffee goes cold. And I'm taking it back to the microwave. Because what happens is I, I, I brew it hot out of my Keurig, and then I sit down and start doing email. Yeah. And then about 15 minutes later, I'm distracted. Dave. I realize, oh, and I go to find my coffee, and it's cold. How about this? Which way are we going? How oh. many times have you been asked for melted butter? I've done this a thousand or times. Or when I'm baking, and I okay. need melted butter. I don't know if we can see this from above, guys, but two things are happening here. It inevitably goes all over. You see all the splattering? That's all mm -hmm. in a silicone. Mm -hmm. So now that's going to be, you, get, you melted the butter for the baked goods, mm -hmm. splattering's inside of there, and you're not letting this hot, hot glass bowl you know the, the hot potato with the glass bowl? That's and not bad at all. No, I wouldn't think it would be. <laughs> so this is one of the wonderful things when you need quick melted butter. And how many times have we done it and have made a mess inside the microwave. So it's cleaning up the mess, wow. no hot, and I'm able to pull this for the recipe. Okay? And for the record, I did not double dip. You did not. I Look wanted to, but pasta. it didn't. Pasta. It doesn't matter on the plate you have. You don't need any special plate. This is a universal. I can grab it from all the angles. It's 360, this is the silhouette and you grab it and now you can pull it out without touching the hot plate at all times. How great is that? Okay. I'll put it up. When you are, I'm sorry, Marshall, excuse me. <laughs> Thanks. Okay. When you are making your purchase tonight, I want to remind you, you're, you're going to receive two of the bowl holders with the silicone liners and a set of the oven mitts, okay? That also double as trivets. This is red, most popular. Here's blue. Here's your green. 
and black is most limited. $22.50 and no easy pay unless you're using this. If you're using your cue card on any item you buy between now and the end of March, on air or online, you don't get three easy pays as you normally do, you get five. And the only exception is gift cards. Don't have a cue card yet? It's very easy to apply. Go to QVC.com, search cue card, and apply online, or call one of our friendly operators. They'll take your application right over the phone. So once you're approved, start shopping and enjoy your five easy payments through the end of March. And now 500 sets, Mark Charles, are gone. Again, being able to use it in any which way you need. If you need to steam, I just steamed. Look at all the steam that happened there. No splattering, no steam. This is silicone 600 degrees, BPA free, ready to go. So that's the insert that's either used as just a bowl holder, but if you want to use it as a cover to steam your food, you could do that. I just want to real quick show you what's happening underneath. See, I took it out, and it's piping hot. I can actually grab that silhouette from the side, and you can see that this is complete control and being able to pull this around. Nothing's going to slip on you, and you don't need a special bowl or plate. This works on large bowls, serving bowls, any kind of microwave safe uh, dishes, of course, you want to make sure you check that. Any of the glass bowls you have or mixing bowls have to be microwave safe. And don't forget, you get these two great flat trivet also grippers for things like going into the oven. If you ever got to grab the rack, you can do that securely. And here's my today's special value. With your holiday Fully loaded, ham. okay? Grabbing this with all control, okay? There it is, the last day piece. As we wrap up, I will tell you that we are very, very busy. Over 500 of these gone, Sean, is that right? And Mark Charles is coming back with another great item, so stay tuned for that. I Mark am. Charles, we'll see you shortly. We're going to take a short break. When we come back, we've got the KitchenAid Stand Mixer Mini, which we're pretty excited about. We also have another look at today's special value, and now all five of the remaining colors are all in advanced orders. All delivering March the 23rd. I've got to get busy over my cerise. Stacy's going to be along with some great items as well. We've got a lot more happening in the last couple of hours of In the Kitchen with David. Don't go away, there's lots more to come. You can make anything happen. In my life, there are no no's. Just how can I? I strive to make things that make people's lives better. There's nothing more rewarding than knowing that you have really helped others and changed people's lives. That's why I love what I do. Join Lori on QVC. Step up your style with Martha Stewart's knit denim jeans with zipper accents. Don't miss it starting Friday at midnight Eastern on QVC. What if there was a place where you could find some of the best food QVC has to offer, some of the best wine QVC has to offer, and after that, some of the best deals? Today's special values, QVC2 big deals, maybe even stealing the steal. Wine and Dine with Rick, Friday at 6 p.m. and Rick's Weekend Preview at 7 p.m. on QVC2. Get financial tips and advice with the help of expert Susie Orman. See you Saturday at 2 p.m. Eastern on QVC. You know what we have coming up, Tina? Chocolate croissant from Authentic Gourmet. Mm -hmm. So good. Yum. Little minis. Stacy's going to present these later. Might have to swoop in like a pterodactyl and get some. Me too. All right. <coughs> Time for KitchenAid, you guys. Just at the International Home and Houseware Show. KitchenAid's booth is the size of a small island nation. <laughs> you go to the what they call Lakeside at the, at the McCormick Place in Chicago, and they have this giant KitchenAid city. I felt like I was in the land where stand mixers were born. It's like heaven. It is like heaven. That voice you hear, come over here, my pretty. <laughs> this is Tina V. I call her Tina V. This is Tina Varelli. I'm David V. She's Tina V. No <laughs> relation. And we're excited because we've got the KitchenAid stand mixer mini. Yes. This is exciting. Mm -hmm. I'm also told that we've got a sell price on this. It goes away end of day today. Mm. And these are amazing. These colors are gorgeous. They're yes. different than the other colors. They are. They're so pretty. There's still great capacity and power with this mixer. That's right. The power hub is the same. Yes. Which is pretty exciting. And there's a glass bowl. I know. So if you'll excuse me, my dear, I'm going to run down front for our colors and I'm going to come and join you and we're going to see what you're making. That's great. All right. Thank you. So we're going to make our way over. And show you what you're getting. First, you're getting this uh, glass bowl, which I believe is three and a half quarts. Is it that is. right? That's right. Three and a half quarts with a pour spout and a handle. Here is my handle. Here is my spout. <laughs> then we've got it for you with a little dough hook. Now these are all the mini size attachments, right? That's right. These work only on the mini. That's correct. Here's your flex edge beater and your wire whip. This color is so pretty. It's called frosted pearl. Gorgeous. 
150. Wow. All I have left. This one is called Sugar Pearl. <laughs> I love Sugar Pearl. <laughs> and 360 left in the, Stacy, say it with me, Sugar Pearl. Mm -hmm. And then I've got it for you in Starry, Starry Night. Oh, I love the singing. Paint your color, in this case, onyx with little diamond flecks. Love it. Not blue and gray. All right, then Sea Shimmer. Gorgeous. I'm in love with that, that color. That is so pretty. That just makes my heart smile. Mm -hmm. I love it. Only 300 of those go around. And think of the nicest, yummiest, crunchiest, sweetest candy apple. Love it. This is called Candy Apple Red. Only 550 to go around. Doesn't that look like the, the, the glassy exterior of a candy apple? It does. Mm. Mm. Remember, price and easy pay all go away end of day. We've got this on six pay and a super low price. Here's our value story. If you went to retail to buy this same pack up, Almost $420, Tina. We're about $150 less. Wow. And with the reduced shipping and handling, we're $157.12 pennies less. And on six pay, and we're going to deliver it right to your door. Let's talk about this mini because for a lot of people who have never purchased a mini, they're wondering can this do the big jobs and the heavy jobs? Right. That some of the bigger mixers will do. It totally can, and let me explain why. So it is 25% lighter. 20% smaller overall, but under the hood here, there is a special DC motor. So it is able to give you the same power that you get in your regular tilt head stand mixer, but in this more compact size. And you might hear that it sounds a little bit different. That DC motor is super strong, powerful, lightweight, and a little bit more quiet. My darling, are you making chocolate biscuits? Yes, look at these. Well, I we have to say that looks delightful. I know. It's that Dutch processed cocoa. And the reason I'm making this biscotti is I wanted to show you just how thick this batter is. So this is just a regular biscotti recipe. You can use all your regular recipes. You don't mm. need any kind of special recipes. And with that DC motor, you also get a soft start. So what that means is when you add a whole bunch of dry ingredients, you may say, oh, that bowl's a little bit smaller. Our ingredient's going to come flying out of it. Right. Well, you have a soft start. You also have a special stir speed that is actually a half speed. So when I start with all that flour in the bowl, there's nothing flying out because we have that great control, that great power. So you're not giving up anything. It is still that metal construction, everything you know and love about your KitchenAid stand mixer, but in a smaller, more compact size that is lighter and easier for you to handle. May I say, Tina V, that already over 100 of these are gone. And wow. do you know what color is in the lead? The Care to guess? Sugar Pearl Silver. Well, Sugar Pearl Silver is a fun one to say, <laughs> but not the one in the lead. Sea Shimmer. Oh, gorgeous. Let me take you through colors again real gorgeous. quickly, then we'll talk value. Reminding you, this price and its easy pay will all disappear end of day today. Which is why you want to be on the line for yours right now. This one is called Frosted Pearl. It's our most limited, fewer than 150. I want you to think where meringue meets marshmallow. Mm -hmm. That's the color we're talking about. It has a beautiful pearlescence. Uh, yeah, it has that little pearlescence that you see in like a meringue when it when before it bakes, right? Then we've got this one. This is Sugar Pearl. Yes, it is. <laughs> I think that was uh, Stacy's nickname in, in high school, Sugar Pearl. <laughs> and then Starry Night, we have 250 in the Sugar Pearl, 350. In Starry Night, 330. Most popular is Sea Shimmer. The Sea Shimmer is that, is that baby blue, fewer than 300 to go around there. And second most popular is Candy Apple Red, 530 of those available. Now, six easy payments and reduced shipping and handling. Here's how your value story breaks down. And remember, your price and easy pay will go away end of day today. At retail right now, this same pack up with the flex edge beater, the glass bowl, the dough hook, and the wire whip. About $420 at retail. We are $149.37 less. We'll call that $150 less, okay? And with the reduced shipping and handling, we're over $157 less. Wow. Delivered to your door. This is a good deal. I'm sorry, this is a screaming good deal. It is screaming. Notice I'm not screaming. 
Because <laughs> I'm whispering to get your attention. All right. Hey, can I tell you that we are very, very busy. Lots of you choosing your color now. Mm -hmm. Tell us more about the Mini and its power. Right. So, like I said, under the hood here is a special motor. It's lightweight. It's compact. It's a DC motor. So that is able to give us the same power from your other tilt head stand mixers in this more compact size. And it just, you get that same planetary mixing action. Just all that same performance that you would receive in your larger stand mixers, but in this great compact size. Whether you're downsizing, whether you just want something a little bit lighter. It is that tilt head design which, which makes it super easy to get that access to the bowl and that beautiful result that you get. Look at this beautiful cinnamon raisin dough kneading beautifully. Gorgeous, gorgeous. There's cinnamon in there and raisins. Yes. Just beautiful. So you can do all the same recipes that you can do with your other stand mixers in this more compact size. I just love it. Now, I saw on your Instagram today you were making doggy treats. We were. So let me show you how to put that bowl on. This bowl has a pour spout, it has a handle, and it has these great measurements on the side. This is microwave. Dishwasher, refrigerator, and freezer safe. To put it on, you just put it in and give it a twist. To put your beater on, you want to follow that keyhole shape, and the keyhole is going to go over the pin here. So just slide it on and give it a twist. This beater is coated. If it's white, it's a metal beater that's coated. When it's coated, that means that it's going to release the food more easily. It also makes it dishwasher safe. So all the beaters, except the whisk, you can put right in. The dishwasher. Now, what, what went in first? So, that is um, Greek yogurt okay. and an egg. Oh, mixed with an egg. We're going to pretend the egg's in there. Okay, okay. noted. <laughs> noted. <laughs> it is in the recipe. So, I'm going to mix the Greek yogurt and the pretend egg there with some oats. And that is going to mix together. What I like to do at home is I'll let this sit for a couple minutes and the oats are going to absorb some of that moisture from there. And the egg helps to bind it. Together. It does. Yeah. Then we're going to add some whole wheat flour. You can add any kind of flour that your dog can handle. Here we're doing whole wheat and then some cheddar cheese. And we're well, going to like cheddar cheese. We're going to okay. use some beef broth as our liquid. You could use any kind of liquid that you want. So this mixer has 10 speeds like the other KitchenAid stand mixers and you see that beautiful planetary mixing action where the beater is moving in one direction around the bowl while it's revolving in the other direction to get that awesome mixing capability. So, you want this to be a stiff dough because you're going to roll these out and then cut them into whatever shape is going to work for your dog. Now, what's, what's the liquid? Is that beef broth? It's beef broth. Interesting. And they're very good. I taste all the pet treats that I make because they're all good human ingredients. Well, remember, they're human ingredients. You know, you're just feeding them to your puppy dog. It's not like eating dog food out of the can. And that is just about perfect. You don't want it Unless to be. Unless there's a snowstorm, you can't get to the grocery store. <laughs> Um, and notice also a little tip here, David. You can lock it in the upper position. I don't think I knew that. So seriously, you can. So, so you can lock it in the upright position so it doesn't flop down on you. Exactly. So if you're like trying to scrape off a tough dough or, or dealing with blades. the beaters, you know, you can lock it in the That's upper smart. and in the lower position. Hey, can I tell you now? We have taken orders for. 175 in this show. I'm sorry, I keep ducking because I think that camera's right above my head. It's a little taller than I realized. All right, so this is your frosted pearl. 130 to go around. This is sugar pearl. 320. Notice how I got a little southern when I said yes. that. Yes. Starry night is the black with a little flex in there. 330 there. Sea shimmer, which I'm in love with. So pretty. 275. And candy apple, very popular as well. About 510 of those to go around. So we're very, very busy. Lots of people making their choice tonight. And let me also tell you if you have never taken poached chicken and used your KitchenAid to shred it up, well, you're working too hard. Take a look here. <laughs> So I'm using that flex edge beater and poached chicken. You want the chicken to be moist and warm, and it's going to do all that shredding for you. So you don't have to get in there with two forks anymore and shred that chicken. That's a tedious job. This makes quick work. You can do this with chicken, you can do this with beef, and you can do this with pork. I start off on a low speed, and then I just increase as it goes. And look how great it's doing that job. Nothing is flying out of the bowl. We're Nice and controlled because we have all those great speeds. And when you're done, 
tilt it back. You can lock it in the upper position. Take that beater off, take the bowl off, and you're good to go. Let me show you how to put another bowl on here. Just place it until it falls into place. There's some little tabs down there. Now this and comes just, with just the one bowl, right? It does come with the one bowl. Tighten it up. Put on your beater. Now we're going to make a yummy dip, and we're going to put that chicken in it. It's a barbecue bacon chicken dip. It is so good. Is that what's in your little slow cooker? It right is. Here? If you want it to have a taste, it well, smells phenomenal. Okay. <laughs> Twist if your you arm. I, mean, I, I just want to be polite here and taste your dip. <laughs> I've had this actually before, and it's delightful. It is very, very good. The only, the only problem was the last time I had it, it was hot like lava. Oh. So I think this time it's a little cooler. There you go. Oh, it smells so it good. It does smell good. And you can bake it in the oven so or. So this has shredded chicken, shredded cheese, chicken. barbecue sauce. Mm hmm. It looks like bacon. That's right. Brown sugar. I started here with the cream cheese and the sour cream. And then we have a little bit of hot sauce. Add as much as you like some lime juice. Mmm. Miss Some Tina. chives or green really onions. Really good. Isn't that good? Oh, wonderful. Some brown oh. sugar. So good. Some bacon. And is see. Is this recipe on your Facebook page? The link to it is on my Facebook page. That's right. And your Facebook page is? Tina Varelli with a V like Venable, mm -hmm. KitchenAid on QVC. Does the cheese go in now? Yes. Let's okay. put All the of cheese it? in. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like the way you think. All right. And then we're going to mix that up. Oh my goodness. So stand mixers are so great, not just for baking, but for all kinds of savory items as well. And don't forget that this stand mixer has that same power hub that has been in every stand mixer since 1919, because we are celebrating our 100th anniversary. And look at that spinning around. We're going to show you a really cool attachment coming up here in a little bit. But you can plug in over 12 different attachments there and get so much use out of your stand mixer investment. I love your recipe because it's not super spicy. I know you could make it spicy you if you could. put more hot sauce That's in there right. and maybe uh, held back on the brown sugar. But um, boy, is that nice. Isn't that good? Really, really delicious. Okay. You know what just took over as the lead is the most popular? Sugar pearl. Not sugar pearl. I know you love sugar <laughs> pearl, but it's not sugar pearl. Uh, candy apple red is now number one. Oh, beautiful. So why don't we start on the far end, Judy, with candy apple red? Because that looks like a glassy, gorgeous candied apple, doesn't it? Uh, we have fewer than 500 in the candy apple red. Most popular. Next to that is the second most popular. It's called sea shimmer. You know how the sun late in the day shimmers on the ocean oh, and catches wow. the foamy peaks and kind of shimmers and shines? That's what that looks like to me. Particularly if you're up on like a high rise looking down on the water in late afternoon when the sun's really flat on the water. Gorgeous. Not that I spend a lot of time at the beach. Maybe a little. Uh, here it is in the black. Starry night is what I meant to say. And then your favorite, sugar pearl. <laughs> uh huh. Sugar pearl. Do our chatters like sugar pearl? They do. <laughs> Stacy's like, did he say my nickname in high school was sugar pearl? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. <laughs> this one is called frosted pearl. 120. Here's your value story. Go to retail to buy this same pack up. You're going to pay $419.35 or $150 less. And then with the reduced shipping and handling, $157 less. Right. This is still every bit as powerful. Do you have questions? Please. Come in, come in, come in. If the camera can just go behind you or you yes. walk behind you, we they'd set love up to a see little the comparison of the of the mini next to the five quart right behind you. Oh yes. Yeah, thank you. Right back here. Can we shoot been that guys? Asking for that visual. And you know what, Tina, if yep. you'll just take a step toward me. Yes. Toward me. There we go. And so this one on the left is what is what size? So we have the five quart artisan is the white mixer. Yeah. And the Starry Night black color, that is the Mighty Mini, the three and a half quart artisan. And that's the comparison between it. Thank you, Stacy. That's great. Because our chatters are wondering could they yes. see it? Okay, a side by side comparison. Perfect. Okay. So as we get ready to wrap up on this, I will tell you that we've now taken orders for 300 of these are gone. And price goes away end of day. So we'll easy pay. And Tina, we're going to go over and do our little sheet cutter demo. Oh, good. But not before I get another little bit of your dip for the road, oh. because it's delightful. Stacy, you gonna come get some chicken dip? Oh uh, yeah, you know she is. All right, sugar pearl, be right over get some dip. <laughs> you and I need to head over here because we're gonna talk about the sheet cutter. Sounds okay, good. Okay, here we go. All right. All right, my dear. All right, so making our way all the way over while I enjoy some chicken dip. Chicken dip. Chicken dip. 
I think that was my nickname in high school, Chicken Dip. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about the KitchenAid sheet cutter attachment with the noodle blade. That's right. This is something that's really exciting. We're all three, awfully thrilled to bring this into you. We've got it available for you. You know, at retail, this is one hundred and twenty-two dollars ninety-seven cents. Call that one hundred and twenty-three bucks. We are eighty-seven ninety-eight. This is a really, really good deal. We have presented this idea before, but tell us about it again. Okay, so this is such a cool attachment. It's called the sheet cutter attachment. So it is a beautiful metal attachment that is going to attach to any stand mixer, including the mini that we just showed you. Then you're going to get three different blade accessories. They're all labeled, oops, out of the way there. Over here on the side, this is the thin blade. You're going to get a thin, a thick, and the brand new noodle blade. So what you do is you have the attachment on your stand mixer, and I'll show you how to attach all of this. You're going to just drape over your cutter, and there's a magnetic um, attachment there. Then you're going to release the handle, and it's almost like magic. Should I go out this way? We are going to cut this honey crisp apple, and it just kind of, you know, peels or cuts a one giant sheet of honey crisp apple and there's all kinds this is of one apple recipes that you can do with this oh my word tina look at that this is one apple let me go this way this is one apple isn't that crazy <laughs> i think this is such a neat tool and this is a delightful apple isn't it mm. good crispy mm. and yummy oh, it's nice mm -hmm. look at that I Now we're done. <laughs> I open grocery stores this way too. <laughs> All right, let's talk to you about what it can do and we'll take a look here. Okay, so that. here are some recipes, and you can get all these recipes right on the product page on QVC.com. So you can make zucchini manicotti, spinach and mushroom mini tarts, creamy white bean and sausage with zucchini noodles with that new noodle blade. How about avocado crab rolls? Golden beet and quinoa salad. We're going to make golden beet noodles soon. A breakfast burrito, zucchini club wrap, apple blossom tarts, and rainbow spring rolls with daikon radish. Ooh. So, besides those cool recipes, there are some really nice little simple ones that you can do. So, maybe when the kids or the grandkids come over or after school, spread some peanut butter or some peanut butter sauce on your apple sheet. And then sprinkle down some granola crunchies on there. Perfect. And then you're gonna wrap those up. You could fill these with whipped cream, drizzle them with chocolate sauce for a quick dessert. And look at all you do is roll them up. And you've got little and you have delightful snacks. A little yummy quick snack. And look at that with the skin on there. Doesn't that just look like a pretty little rose? You know what you could also do is smear a little layer of vanilla yogurt in there. Ooh, Wouldn't that be nice? That's a good idea. And that would keep it nice, uh, you know, nice and healthy. Uh, now, let's take a look down front because this is going to it. Now, you've seen the sheet cutter <laughs> before, but this is also including the noodle. The noodle The noodle cutter. attachment. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. So we have the thick and thin sheet cutter and the noodle cutter. You get all three. Then the mechanism that fits right in the um, power hub, even on that brand new mini you just bought. That's right. right. And then you get the box that is going to store it. I've got actually the box in my hand, and I can, if this was not sealed, is he sealed? No. All right, here we go. All so right. Here's what they look like inside, and so this becomes your storage box. Everything fits in. It has a little magnetic closure, and there's even a pouch for your use and care guide up oh, at the top there. Up at the top. So it's a beautiful box, great and sleek. It just slips right in your pantry or on a shelf. Isn't yeah, that nice? Okay, so uh, what's next, my dear? So now I'm going to show you how to use the great new noodle blade. So this is a golden beat that I have here. So you just drape your cutter over top. All right, it has a magnetic closure. Then you're going to release, let me make sure my plate's underneath there, and you're going to see how it's going to cut. So if it's a little oblong, first it'll cut some small pieces, and then once it's all even, it'll cut these sheets. And look at the beautiful, gorgeous, it's, Not clever. it's like a fettuccine noodle with beets. So you could make a salad with that. You could cook them for just a little bit in a pan and make a beautiful pasta dish with them. I piled these on a sheet tray and popped them in the oven roasted at 400, them. roasted them till they were a little bit crispy. I ate two beets 
in about 10 minutes with those beet strings. That's they were delicious. Sounds marvelous. I'm, I'm, I'm in love with beets. I love beets. So let me show you how it works. So this is what the arm attachment looks like. So you just want to take the cover off your um, power hub and then you just fit it in. So there's a square peg here that we need to fit into the square hole. So once you get that fit in, you want to tighten up the arm on that. And then we're going to show you how to fit a zucchini. So here I have a zucchini, mm -hmm. and this is your skewer, and we provide you with a little measurement mark. So from the round end to this first measurement mark, that is how long you're going to cut it. Where's my knife? Oh, there it is. Sorry, my dear. All right. There we go. So we're just going to cut off the end there, okay? And then you're going to put in the black skewer. And you just want to put that in till it's nice and tight. Now, with softer foods that have a softer center, like cucumbers and zucchinis, we're also going to use this special gray adapter. So you just want to line that up. Okay. Okay. And then you're going to insert it and twist on this little key here. Then your skewer goes in the end, and there are videos online that can help you with this, and it's all explained in your book as well. It's so easy. It is so easy. So we're all attached. You want to use speed two, and here we're going to use the thick blade. Is it a slower <laughs> speed for softer things? Um, pretty much speed two for everything, everything is what I've been using. Okay, great. Okay? And then when you're ready to go, you just release this, and it's really, you know, one-handed operation. So. First, it's going to peel off any kind of the odd shape. So here I'm using the thick cutter, and I like to use this to make a zucchini lasagna. Oh, that would be lovely. So look at the thickness of that and the beautiful cut that you get from that. So what I make with this is I cut them in sheets that are going to fit my grill pan. And then I grill them, and then you could really make enchiladas, you could make burritos. So then you're going to layer them in your lasagna pan, layer on your beautiful noodles, and they're so sturdy. You would think that they would fall apart, but they really don't. And I never liked zucchini before, but I really, really enjoy it. It really doesn't taste that much different than noodles because it's so light and tender. Oh, that's so nice. So you just keep layering those marinara. on. Bake them up, and you make a beautiful grilled zucchini sheet lasagna. As we wrap up on this, I'll tell you it's K48137. It's also five, uh, three easy payments on your credit card. Use your Q card tonight, and it's five. Tina, we're going to see you on Sunday. Yes. Looking forward to having you back. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, we're going to check in with Stacy, who has an excellent idea. Oh. I sure do. How about making poached eggs easier, making omelets easier, or just harder soft boiled eggs without a big pot, lots of water, and a big mess, right? Coming up from Yes, Yes, Chef, something brand new for you. It is our stainless steel egg cooker and poacher. This color is copper. This is the one that I am bringing home. It looks beautiful. Here's the thing. A one day only price. It's less than $20. We love that, but only today. Otherwise, it goes back up closer to $25. Two easy payments, dishwasher safe. It holds up to six eggs, and literally, you turn it on and it can cook your eggs faster. You don't have to do a thing. You just place them in there, boom, they're done. Poached, hard, soft boiled, you name it, you got it. Quick and easy from Yes Chef. But now, let's do it again. It's so popular, it's so awesome. Our new dish from Le Creuset, our today's special value. All right, our final look of the day at our very best value of the day. And I don't want you to blink because you might miss it. This is very exciting. We've got something very special for you from Le Creuset. It's been wildly popular. It's our very best value of the day. And the final look starts right now. Beg your pardon. I thought there were two looks tonight. There's one more coming up, but it depends on how many are left here. That's true too, because it could just all disappear. We are excited to bring you our very best value of the day, and we're awfully excited that we can tell you that since launch we have taken orders for 13,500 of these, and during in the kitchen with David, 3,000 have been ordered. All colors are now delivering in advanced orders. 
and they will deliver on, or the remaining colors, I should say, will deliver on March the 23rd. So here's what I have remaining, and Cerise. Okay, so here's the story for the whole day. We brought in 16,000 for the entire day. If you want Cerise, 700 left, okay? If you want Marseille, 500 left. These are all shipping on March 23rd. If you want Oyster, which is what Stacy collects, 350 all I have left. And here's the white, fewer than 1,200. And finally, the Cassis, I have fewer than 100. When those 100 Cassis are gone, we will take this off the table and it will join the other colors that have already sold out. Now, what does your value story look like? If you went to retail, and the only other place to buy this is at lookrase.com, we're looking at. $425. Our price right out of the gate is over $195 less. Then we're going to be, uh, we're going to give you free shipping and handling, so that brings you to over $210 less wow. delivered to your door. And this vessel is what I like to call a two-in-one because it's got that four and a quarter quart base or vessel on the bottom, and then the lid is another two and a quarter quarts. So you're looking now at six and a half quarts total. Now this lid is also a skillet. It's also a baker. It's also a roaster. Or it's just a quick trivet if you want to turn it upside down and put the other dish on top of it. So when it's used as a lid, it locks all that moisture inside. And with cast iron, we're talking about even heat distribution and beautiful results. Now, I need to remind you that since launch, we've taken orders for 13,500. We started the day with only 16,000 of these, and we've already sold 13,500. Not a lot left to go around. And the remaining colors, Cerise, Marseille, Oyster, White, and Cassis, are all delivering in advanced orders in, on uh, March 23rd. And if you want this Cassis now, seven dozen left to go around. About 84 of those left. Let's come over and meet Chef Nate Collier. He is our representative from Le Creuset, leads our Le Creuset David, team. Good to have you great back. Great to see you again. What is this deliciousness you're cooking over here? So, David, we're making an Italian flavored beef ragu. This is one of the recipes that's included in our 12 oh, recipe booklet. Right here. Yep. And so, you know, I love this piece because you said, David, it's a two in one. It's so versatile. There's so many things you can do with it. But the hallmark of cooking in cast iron really I'm looking is for your ragu. developing a beautiful brown flavor, releasing that into the stew, and then creating a nice, tender, Ooh. slow cooked meal. And Here there's that beef ragu right there. And so a number of things have to happen when you want to do this, David. First, you have to develop rich, brown flavor. So you can see these uh, beef cubes. We've got that beautiful flavor. And again, you can see it on the bottom of the pan. You can see it on the meat. That's not burned on there, David. That is flavor ready to get rich into your stew. And it so it smells amazing. That is the first thing that you need to do. Then and we're gonna drop these veg in here. Here's another thing I love about this lid. Because there's not a knob on it, it sits flat on your countertop. So I put my uh, meat, what I would call mise en place, but my other prepped ingredients mm -hmm. right in here so I don't need another plate. The lid's sitting there. We're gonna go in just with some fresh herbs, some onions and carrots and celery for some sweetness. And we're gonna get that stirred around. Now, David, if you wouldn't mind, grab I that orange pitcher of the red wine. Oh, sorry. No worries. There we are. And let's see what happens when you get that right into the pan. I'm gonna stop for a moment and let you do a little scraping. Right. Because what we're doing here is deglazing the pot. We're releasing all those little bits of flavor off the bottom of the pan, creating this beautiful additional layer of flavor, all from that beautiful caramelized beef, so that you get that wonderful finish. You and want all this, Chef? Absolutely. And you can see now, all of that has come off of the bottom. We released it. Another thing I love about our proprietary sand enamel, that light sand color allows you to see what you're doing. So you see the flavor developed. You see it release from there. So you know mm. you're building this rich, it delicious stew. It smells so good. We're going to go just with a little bit of crushed tomatoes in there. We've also had some garlic um, in there and some salt and pepper as well. What else do you have going on here? Do you so, want some of this? Um, that is going to be when we pull it out and garnish it, actually, David. Ooh, nice, so we've nice, just nice. got this beautiful, rich, beefy flavor, tomato, red wine. Get that with a little more pepper. Oh, love it. A little, uh, little kick. And then 
Here's the thing, even though this is a two-in-one lid, David, we don't sacrifice any performance of our traditional Dutch oven, no. which is to say you want to lock that moisture in, you want to heat from the top, you want to create that gentle convection cooking environment, and this little precision lip right here around the side, it's the hallmark of all of our lids. That's what locks in the moisture, that's what locks in the flavor, and that's what allows it to have its own little ragu jacuzzi in there, gentle <laughs> cooking, it's beautiful. Ragu jacuzzi. Jacuzzi. I'm going to, mm -hmm. I should trademark that or something. I, well, that and Golden Brown Delicious. That's right. <laughs> something like that. And so we're going to take this, we're going to put it in the oven. It's going to go low and slow, and you're going to see how beautifully tender this comes out because of the gentle cooking of this cast Chef, iron. can I tell you that 3,200 now ordered during In the Kitchen wow, with David. That's amazing. That brings us for the day, Sean Town. 13,500 are now gone for the day. Okay, we're going into the oven. I'm guessing we we're going in and out. Yep. Absolutely right. So, this has been slow cooking away. Do I also spy with my little eyes? Oh, you weren't supposed to see that. That was going to be a surprise for you, David. We're well, going to come back to that in just okay, a second. Okay, I didn't see it. Yes, I did. It might be four and a quarter quarts full of mac and cheese. Well, I'm going right to wreck there. it. That's what I'm going to do. In that beautiful white color, too. It's just, um, it, it's so lovely on everything. And here you go. And feast your eyes you can see on this. this. David, let's get you a spoon. Now, does that beef start to break down as it braises? It does, but then we go back and actually shred it in the pot. I was going to say, it, it looks too perfect. For we, you. we shred it, it in the pot, and that's part of the recipe. It's so tender and delicious, and it all becomes part of the it sauce. It smells amazing. Doesn't it? And what is this veg? I'm seeing the little cubes here. So um, there's garlic, there's onion, a uh, little bit of carrot too that we had uh, uh, chopped a little bit smaller than the demo that you saw. And that adds just a, a hint of sweetness to it when it nice. all cooks down together. This smells amazing. And we're going to serve a little bit of that up so you can see the other thing that we have going on here with the lid, David, just some broccoli rabe, garlic. Salt and pepper, little red pepper flakes in the lid to go alongside this. I love bitter greens with some Italian flavor. We're gonna add just a touch of white wine to that to let it steam up. And you can see mm. how we're using the versatility so of the lid. When this ragu's done, you can pop that lid off, it will stay warm. Quickly saute the broccoli robin here with all those garlic bits and red pepper down and on the bottom. And notice also that Chef is cooking over medium heat. One thing that people realize with cast iron is you don't have to go screaming hot. Exactly. With cast iron because it's going to evenly distribute the heat and give you beautiful results. One thing would happen if this pan were too hot and those that minced garlic was in there, oh, burn. that garlic would burn in a hot second. So this is going to be perfect. You're going to love that it's so easy. And you're going to love that it's so, so delightful. Are you serving this ragu over a polenta? That's absolutely right. And you can see how easily that came right out of the pan, David. Mm. So, some nice texture. You could do this right over noodles. You could do it, I mean, you could do it over anything. You could do it over I a shoe and it would taste good. Yeah, right? right. I always say my, if I cook my shoes in butter, they taste good too. Right. Um, that's great. Now, I've got to come to the test kitchens and try this. You should absolutely is, come down. We should come and down try. and like wreck it. And, David, it's just, it's so beautiful because it shows the traditional use of cast iron for that slow and low stew where you develop the flavor, release the flavor from the enamel, and lock it in with the lid. Mm. But also easy everyday vegetables just right in the lid. How is that? It's amazing. And the beef is perfectly tender. The flavors have all married beautifully. Wow, is that good. And it is. And you know, even, even though it takes a while to cook and break down in the oven, it, it, it's not hard to do, David. It's searing meat. It's adding liquid and some veg in there, and you develop that flavor. And you, the key to it again is releasing that flavor from the enamel. Now, I will tell you, we began our day with 16,000 of these today's wow. special values. If you want cerise, I have 630 to go around, and that's been our most popular color in this show tonight, and a lot of you are making your purchase. Remember, every color that I'm about to show you will ship in advanced orders on March the 23rd, but when they're gone, they're gone for good. We started the day with nine colors. We have five remaining. One of the five is getting super limited. Now we're getting into Marseille. I have 450 left that can ship out on March 23rd. This is the oyster. 300 all I have left. White has been a color that you have consistently requested. And we have worked hard to bring it in for you today, and I have fewer than 1,100 remaining. And finally, in this cassis, I have six dozen remaining in the wow. cassis. Cassis is a deep eggplanty purple color. Isn't that pretty? We wanted to show you that the enamel on the inside of all your Le Creuset pieces is this proprietary sand enamel color. And we've got a little factory footage to show you how these pieces come to life. 
Chef, if you, if you narrate for us. Absolutely, David. So you can see we're at the factory. That's the black sand. That's what our molds are made of. Individual molds. Each one is broken, so they truly are one of a kind. 15 different pairs of craftsmen's hands touch each and every piece that comes through the factory. This is what really sets us apart. There's the enamel going on in multiple, multiple coats. You can see the beautiful ombre effect going on with the darker color over the lighter color. And it comes out of this enameling line and it goes into this furnace that cooks at the most unbelievably high temperatures. And that melts the enamel into the cast iron. That was it the emerald green that fused, sold out earlier that's today. That's absolutely right. And it fuses together to create the beautiful color, the easy maintenance, the durability. And here's the payoff right here because it's multi generations cooking this. I love it so much. We have so much fun when we go there. We have so much fun when we cook in this cookware. It, it's really beautiful. All right, Chef, I'm not taking any more chances. Okay. I have my QVC app oh, open. Gosh. <laughs> I love Stacey it. Stacy brought me my phone. <laughs> and I'm going to order the cerise right now. Because I'm worried it's going to sell out. All right. I hope Stacy already ordered ordered her oyster too. I hope she did because it's going quickly too. So I'm tapping on the today's special value in the QVC app, which is a frown, uh, free download at your app store. Hello, how you doing? Uh, all right. And now I'm looking waiting for the colors to pop up. Wi-Fi is a little slow in the building. Just hang with me. No, not Cassis. I want red. I was sorry, Cerise rather. My Cerise. No, no sound out. Oh wait, there it is. Bang, Cerise. Add to cart. View the cart. That's easy. I'm checking out. Hold, please. It's checking my. Uh huh. Okay, I'm in. Continue. 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 Payment method. Hang on. I'll be right with you. All right. Chosen. Continue. And submit order. Thank you for shopping with QVC. Done. All right. That was easy, David. That fast. You can order a product on the QVC <laughs> app, and that's right. a free download. I did that just to show you how quickly you can order on right. the app. Plus, I was afraid you are going to beat me to the rest of the Cerise. <laughs> All right. We brought in over 16,000 of these. If you want Cerise, I have 550 left. Actually, it was 551, and I got mine. Okay, fantastic. Marseille, 400 left in the Marseille. In Oyster, 250. Here's the white. 1100 and if you want cassis, I have fewer than four dozen, and then Lisa Marie's going to come and take it away. Sad but true. All right. Here's your value story. If you were to go to retail to buy this same piece, you'd be looking at $425. We are $195 That's a lot. less. Then with the free shipping and handling, we're $210.74 less. And we include the 12 recipes, including that Italian beef ragu, which I'm going to make, by the way. You should, that David. Was amazing. It's so good. I mean, you almost need a fork to eat that. It's so chunky. And, and I love it, David, because you can make this ahead of time. If you got people coming over, I love braises and stews because you can do it ahead of time and you don't have to worry about jumping in and out of the kitchen when your company's there. It's the best yeah. part because when I entertain, I worry that I'm in the kitchen too much and not, you know, in, in the living room enjoying, you know, cocktails and appetizers. I hear that quite a bit myself too, David. Yeah, exactly. I think we all struggle with that. So this is fantastic. We're deep frying in this because cast iron is a beautiful vessel that holds temperature. Absolutely is. So now I can drop those fries in. You taught me once upon a time that double frying right. re results in the crispiest fries. It really does. So if you're frying from fresh and you cut the potatoes, you're going to fry them once at a little bit of a lower temperature to cook them through to become super tender. Then you're going to take them out and raise it a little bit to crisp them, crisp them up. But even just as simple as a bag of crinkle cuts in here are mm. going to get so beautifully golden brown delicious because the oil temperature, David, that is the key to everything when you're deep frying. You want to maintain the oil temperature because if you don't, see how the bubbles are coming out? Yep. That's steam releasing. That means oil is not getting into the food. And I'll also tell you the reason we don't double fry frozen French fries is because here's a little story you may or may not know. Frozen French fries are already, already. par fried. That's right. So when you get them, there's a reason why they get a little extra crispy. Right. Because they're already par fried before they're packaged, or well, they're frozen uh, and packaged. It's like a supermarket shortcut just for you, right? That's what I'm yeah. talking about. Look at this golden brown delicious right here. These are ones that we've already fried up, and look how golden brown right. and perfect they are. And I'm going to show you something else we're going to do with those in a little bit. When these come to oh, get beautifully kind of golden brown, they might go in the oven again a second time, David. Mm -hmm. um, I, well, I think I see what you're doing. Yes, I do. It's okay. beautiful. Okay, let's let's just we're going to go ahead and do it. We're going to let the we're, cat out of the bag. We're going to let the cat out of the bag. We we're going to do cheese, cheese bacon fries. That's right. You could do right. this 
with nachos, you could do it with tater tots, David. You could do this with a lot of different things right in here. And here's the beautiful thing. I love oh, this. Chef, one thing I'll just help oh. you all with here. We're gonna we're gonna definitely I put think some more cheese on there. You're a little stingy oh, with yeah. the cheese there. I mean, I love you like a brother. Come on now. <laughs> I wanted to put you to work, David. All so right, I left that's them fair enough. I'm you. here to serve. All right, no problem. So you can see we're coming out with these. We fried these in the base. We've got the lid to the same vessel here. So we're using both at the same, well, not at the same time, but we're using both for the can same dish. Can you hand me dish. your bacon there? Absolutely. I figure you're just going to. Well, we know maybe a little more. It. You know. Are Delicious. we going to do scallions when it comes out? Yeah, yeah, we yeah. will definitely do that. Because they'll, they'll burn in the oven. And so this will melt. It will come right off. The cast iron will keep it warm when you bring it to the table, the same way when you get kind of the nachos on the sizzle platter at the Mexican restaurant. So beautiful. Yeah, just let's get it all. All let's of go it. For it. Let's all go and for and it. Look up a piece of bacon, too. Right. How's that looking, kids? Boom. Delicious. Yeah. Right? So you can see this right here. We're going to go into the oven with oh, it. Oh, and you know what I might do when that comes out of the oven? What's that? Drizzle some ranch dressing oh, on the top. Oh, now you're talking. Uh huh. And then sprinkle the scallions on. And then don't talk to me for about 30 minutes because <laughs> I'm going to be occupied. <clears throat> all right. We're talking about, oh, okay, we've got another update for you, Chef, as you pop those in. I'm listening. We brought over 16,000 in for the day. In the Cerise, 430 left, and then they're gone. Okay, Marseille, 360. When those are gone, this color will come off the table. In Oyster, 180, all I have left. In the white, 1,100, but if you wanted Cassis, I'm sorry to tell you, it has sold oh, out. Oh, wow. All right, here, my friend. Thank Good you. Good thing you got that uh, app order in, David. Well, I bought the Cerise. Oh, sorry. Because that's the color I collect. But I'll tell you what, we started our day with nine colors, and then there were four. Five colors are gone, okay? And we are getting now limited in what we have left, and all these four colors are shipping in advanced order. Well, over 14,000 sold for the day, 3,800 during In the Kitchen with David. Wow, wow. We have 2,000 left, and then it's over. We will put a big old sold out button on the screen, and we're going to send <laughs> Chef Nate home so he can get himself a golden ale beverage to celebrate. That's right. All right. Or a couple. Maybe a couple. I think That's you've right. earned it, my friend. So this is fantastic. Don't miss out on this. We're frying more fries, which is never a bad thing. Stacy's particularly excited. Oh, I forgot how much she loves French she fries. Well, it's her how, desert island. I don't know food. how I could forget that because I'm also a sucker for salty fried snacks. My wife. Huge sweet tooth. Of course, both my daughters have a huge sweet tooth as well. But I, for sure, desert island food. Stacy, I'm with you. French yeah. fries, potato chips. We call it desert island because if you could only have one food on a desert island, what would it be? Stacy's is French fries. Right. Mine is mac and cheese, and that's a good segue. Let's take uh, a look at let's this. Take a look at this. You David. did four and a quarter quarts that's of mac right. and cheese. We did, and this is still a little bit hot. So I'm going to grab a towel down here so I can show you, David. Again, something simple as mac and cheese in this beautiful white color looks so stunning when you set it on your table. But you can see here how this pulls away from the side. Nothing is sticking to the side. Everything's coming away from the side. You don't have to worry about cleaning the burnt on cheese in there, David. It's going to all release from there. You get the crispy bits around the side and the gooey bits mm -hmm. in the middle. I'd ask you what your favorite is, but I'm sure the answer is both. All of it. Okay. Take a bite and see what you think. Oh, my goodness. I didn't happen. To, I didn't happen to have a fork uh, handy, but I did. Oh, of course. I don't know how that happened. Never go anywhere with that one. I, I have it in my, in my <laughs> hip pocket. Mmm. Mmm. And you baked this uncovered, Chef. We did. And what's nice about that, when you do that, you get the little crispy on top. Do I have cheese out here? <laughs> Lower. Oh, look at that! It was gonna be a snack for the drive home. Oh. Okay, apparently not. Um, all right, so crispy on the top. Creamy on the bottom. Right. That's a little, that's a, just a little slice of heaven right and there. Here's the other thing, David. You could do mac and cheese so many different ways. If you wanted to make your own bechamel, your own cheese sauce in here, you could make the roux, uh, pour in the milk, stir it together, stir in your cheese, make that delicious thick cheese sauce right in the vessel, and then just toss your cooked noodles with it right into the oven and get that nice crispy brown top on it. Oh, it's good. Delicious. It's really, really good. I need to let you know that we are getting limited now in what we have remaining. And we brought in over 16,000 for the day. Now, if you want the Cerise, 350, all we have left. Okay, in the Marseille, 300, all we have left. In Oyster, 115, all we have left. That's actually now the most limited, isn't it? So let's move him to the end. So 115 left in Oyster. In the um, white, fewer than 1,100. And that's all we have, just these four. 
Oh, look, I've got a little red, white, and blue action going on. How about that? Swap that out so it's red, white, and blue. Look at that. There we go. Little Americana action. I love it. Or the French flag. Hey, there you go. See there? Two countries working together. That's I right. love that. I love that too. All right, I think we all love that. All right, so let's talk to you about value. $425 at retail. The only other place to buy this is at lookrisay.com. We've got it tonight for over $195 less. You're also going to love that we can do this for you um, with five easy payments and free shipping and handling. Add in the free shipping, Chef, and we're now at $210 less. Wow. This is pretty extraordinary. 4,000 now gone in this show, and I have only 1,800 left for the whole day. We may not see a third presentation wow. in this show. This is now going very quickly. And if we do have a third presentation, we might be down to just one color. Wow. How about that? How I don't think that? in my career I've done that before. Well, we'll make it work. Oh, no, it'll yeah. work. Oh, we're, we're going to be here until they're all gone. You can be sure. Hey, I'll tell you what, we're super excited we got this for you. Did you bake in this? We did. And so, David, uh, are you a baker in terms I, of I bread do and like stuff? to bake. I don't think I'm as good a baker as I am a, a savory cook. I would say the same thing. I'm, I would not consider myself a baker, but I always bake bread in cast iron if I'm going to bake it at all because it's so easy. Any True. bread dough recipe, I prefer the no need recipes because they're so easy. You go into a screaming hot Dutch oven, you put the lid on, you get that, what I was calling earlier, that poof, which is, we would call dough spring, where you raise up and you get the nice bubbles in it. And then you take the lid I off. I love it when you get all chefy. Well, I mean, why not? And <laughs> you take the lid off and then it browns. You get this beautiful brown crust on here. Your house smells delicious. Your friends are going to think you're a professional. You get these beautiful country bowls. Look at that beautiful golden brown delicious on the bottom. Mm. And it releases right from here with nothing. You don't oil it. A hot, the dough right into the hot pan seals that immediately. Nice. Nice. And then we'll take the bread. We'll slice it up. We'll do something as simple as grilled cheese in the lid. You know, I mean, I and want you to remember. In the base. Yeah, this is an everyday cooking vessel because remember, the lid turns into its own skillet. Right. So if you want to be able to use that to do grilled cheese sandwiches in the afternoon when the kids get off the school bus, right? Or if you're making yourself a quick lunch, that will be the same skillet you use in the evening to brown your pork chops. Right. Right. Absolutely. Before you pop them into the oven and finish them off right. there. This is what makes this vessel so versatile. And when you're making a lot of those cold weather dishes, I'd love to think that we're done with winter. I don't think so. But I don't think we are at all. <laughs> I mean, it was super cold. I think the high today was 23 degrees wow. here in Westchester. The high. Thanks. What? Okay. So, what we're talking about is an opportunity for you to continue making those soups and stews and chilies, chicken and dumplings, all the things that we love, the gooey, yummy mac and cheeses, or a whole plate of polenta that you're going to serve that beautiful beef ragu or serve right. with your pot roast. Absolutely. You can use the lid and the base separately. You can use them together. You can use them separately for the same dish. You can use one by itself for the other one by itself. There's so many different uses for it. And remember, you're getting not only that versatility, David, but you're getting the authentic, original enamel cast iron French cookware brand. And that is Le Creuset. Now, I know a lot of you are going to ask me about this tool that I'm using. This is called a spider. And I believe, Chef, do we have these available on .com? Uh, you know, I don't know the answer to that. We used to, but I cannot remember the I know stock we did situation. once upon a time. Yes. And, and I love it. It's an in indispensable. I use it for deep frying. I use it for getting uh, short pasta noodles out of the boiling water, blanching vegetables. You know what? If I'm ever cooking raviolis in, in simmering water, I use it to retrieve those. Yeah. Because those are whip and tear if you try to poke them with, with a fork. Yeah. So uh, definitely uh, invest in a, in a spider. And if you guys would like me to put together a kitchen essentials pack up of oh, utensils, wow. let me know on Facebook. That'd be a great idea. Because I'm always working with our buyers, like we did in Chicago, to find the kinds of gadgets you're looking for. So if you'd like me to put together David's kitchen essentials where it comes to gadgets, let me know. I'll put together a collection for you. And we'll offer it for purchase on QVC. All right, so I'm going to uh, get these fries out. And I know, Sean, we've got another update. Yes? Miss Stacy, do we? Do we have um, questions? No, I just saw fries. Oh, you're coming for fries. <laughs> hey, Stacy, I'm going to put you to work. Will you, will you step over there and grab some salt and hit these while they're still oh, moist? Without a doubt. Here you go. Oh, because the best, you go. the best thing to do is season up high when they're moist yeah. because the salt will adhere to the fries and you don't have to hit it with as much. Perfect. There's a couple more. Good job. 
And did you see those cheese fries, the bacon cheese fries you put I in the oven? I sure did. Did our foodies see those too? Oh, everybody was drooling. Still melting a little bit, David. Gonna We're going to get those out. Oh, Don't we'll give worry. to it. Don't you worry. I'm not worried. I know where everybody lives. Oh, you did black pepper too. Oh, I love pepper. Do pepper you want red there. pepper flakes? Yeah. On no, your fries? no, 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 no. Just like salt and pepper. Kind of clean. With my fries. There's probably ketchup here somewhere, too. Okay. Well, well if not, going. they're mine, right? Oh, of course they are. Woo! Thank you. Gentlemen. All right. I've got an update. Any questions from the chatters? Am I pretty good? Uh, everybody's loving it. They've grabbed their color. Everybody has a favorite. Did you see me order mine on the app? I did. They thought that was pretty clever. <laughs> I did it pretty fast, too. And I grabbed my oyster, so. Have oh, you ordered good. yours yet, hun? Yes. You ordered your oyster? Oh, yeah. I ordered it early. I knew. Oh, did you? Mm hmm. All right. Good deal. Table. All right. We started with over 16,000 total. If you want the cerise, I have 240 left. That is all. Okay. If you want the white, I have fewer than a thousand. If you want Marseille, 220. And if, oh my gosh, Stacy, you're lucky you ordered yours. Oyster just sold out. Oh, wow. All right. Thank you, sir. Good man, Kyle. Thank you. All right. So we're down to three colors. We're down to the, the good old red, white, and blue. Right. Two countries together, David. Two countries. The French flag is red, white, and blue. The American flag is red, white, and blue. I think this is a fitting way to finish off our today's special value as we salute both countries, correct? There you go. Let's take a look at our value story. If you were to go to retail, you'd pay a whopping $425 at lecrecet.com. We're going to do this tonight for you at $195 and two pennies less. And then we're going to give you free shipping and handling, which is going to take your savings to $210.74 less than the full price. That's delivered to your door. So for $210.74 or 74 cents less, we're going to deliver it to your door, put it on five easy payments, and of course, your shipping is absolutely free. We are now down into final quantities in only three remaining colors. We brought in $16,000 for the day. If you want cerise, which is my color, cerise is the French word for cherry, and that chair, that cerise now is fewer than 200 left. Now we'll give you a quick look here as we set up cameras because they were all ready to shoot demos, and I went back to colors, and they're quick. That Dan and that Mike, they're quick. This is the cerise. I have fewer than 200. If you want the white, I have fewer than 1,000. And if you want the Marseille, I have 200 left. So it's the good old red, white, and blue. That's what we are rounding out our day with. And these are all going quickly. I would also tell you that we are very excited that we can do all this for you at such a great price tonight and also do it with free shipping and handling. Reminding you that this would be $425 at retail. We are a full $195 and two pennies less. And with the free shipping, we're over $210 less than retail. Delivered my foodie friends to your door. And you know what? We get excited about value. We get excited about that. But you know what I get most excited about? I get excited about this food, Chef. Absolutely. I get excited about the kinds of dishes that our foodies will be able to prepare because now they have the perfect vessels. Correct. With an S because there are two vessels in this offer. That's absolutely right, David. And you know what else? I love, I'm excited about the food. I'm excited about people sharing the food, about sharing it with each other. I was saying earlier how I love to teach people to cook and cook with people. And we've learned a lot from my, you. My daughters, my wife, my family. It just, it brings a smile to my face and so does this. Sharing this cookware with you guys, sharing this food with you guys, it brings a smile to my face because I hope you can take some of it home to do this and feel confident in the yes, kitchen with this. I agree. Now I want you to see what, okay. You know what every Wednesday night was at my house growing up? Pork chop night. I love it. And mom would cook pork chops in a cast iron I'm skillet. Sure, she did cook and it in a cast iron. And you live down south, and I'm sure you have had this because uh, in the area where you live, lots of great restaurants that do good southern cooking. Oh, yeah. After mom finished cooking the pork chops, you know what she would cook in the pork fat? Hominy. Oh, yeah. Now, hominy is something, it's a corn, uh, it's a corn product. Right. And by itself, it doesn't have a lot of taste. Right. So you tend to cook it in something that will, where it can take on its flavor. Absolutely. So mom would cook it in the pork fat. I love that, David. And she'd salt it. I love that. And it was so good, served with pork chops. And here you're doing apples in thyme. And Delightful. So that hominy, the pozole, the green pork pozole stew, that's one of the recipes in our booklet, yes. uses hominy in it. For the same reason, it takes on the flavor of the pork and the green chili and the tomatillo in there. I love it. But here, again, we're showing 
This functions just like any other cast iron skillet, except for it's not raw cast iron. Yeah. You don't have to worry about seasoning it. You don't have to worry about cleaning it. And look at the beautiful golden brown sear we got on that. Beautiful flavor, but also the fat is nice and crispy on there. You get a beautiful texture. Very simple, salt, pepper, a little fruit. You could use peaches, some fresh herbs. And we're just gonna hit it with a little bit of white wine to get all that flavor off the bottom. And of course, David, in celebration of both of those red, white, and blue countries over there, you gotta finish it with a little pat of butter right on top. And I love that your little pat is generous. Come on. Come on not? now. <laughs> hey, we started with over 16,000. Now let's go back and do one final color tour before we wrap up. If you want the cerise, I have six dozen remain, six dozen? Oh, wow. When did that happen? Six dozen left in the cerise. I'm happy I bought mine. All right, so six dozen left. Uh, oh, and the Marseille, 150. And what about the white? We have fewer than a thousand. We will take one final brief look at the end of In the Kitchen with David, but don't dare hang up. Order yours now, particularly the most limited now is the Cerise, I think. Followed by the Marseille, and then finally the White. Whew, it's a busy day. We've got a one day only priced item coming up next, and a whole lot more. Chef Nate, hang out for one final look, a brief look. You are in the kitchen with David. Don't go away. Listen, cooking can be fun and easy, and it certainly doesn't have to take a lot of time to get a good meal on the table, especially when you've got the basics down. From the recipe to the table and all the prep work in between, it's Step by Step Cooking with Stacy Monday at 6 p.m. Eastern on QVC2. Kickstart your spring wardrobe with the perforated leather slide sandals from Earth Brands Footwear. Check it out starting Thursday at midnight on QVC. Friday, March 8th, marks the 44th International Women's Day. A global celebration of women who dream, dare, and do. Join our female hosts and entrepreneurs as they share their stories of inspiration and empowerment. And learn how you can help QVC support NEST, a global nonprofit committed to the social and economic advancement of women. International Women's Day, all day Friday on QVC. One day only price. I love these items because they're little bargains that just pop up in the middle of a show. And that's always cool because when you see a one day only priced item, you're looking at the lowest price you're going to see on that item for six months. You're also going to enjoy that item at that price only until the end of the day or until the item sells out, whichever comes first. So when you see them, jump on them because they're amazing. Does that mean eggs are ready? Mm -hmm. I'm hearing a little. That's our new buzzer. It's think? not a buzzer at all. It's no. music. We actually got rid of the buzzer because Mark Charles people wanted music. See here? That means the eggs are done. That's the new buzzer to the egg cooker. And How's just... about that? Do we like? I like a lot. So it's the egg cooker we know and love that does two poached eggs, does a beautiful job with um, uh, uh, omelet. Can't speak. And then it can do up to one to six eggs in soft, medium, or hard boiled eggs. When I lose my words, I just stop and say, sounds like. Sounds like. First word sounds like. First word sounds like. We're, we're playing uh, two syllables. Dictionary. Yeah, or, or, or charades or something. Charades, yeah. All right, so you're looking at the Yes Chef stainless steel egg cooker and poacher. Now, this will make soft, medium, and hard boiled eggs. Yes. It will also make poached eggs. Poached eggs. I think one of the most stressful things in the kitchen is trying to poach eggs. Yep. You have to get the water to the right temperature, then you have to start swirling it. And then when you swirl it, you have to crack the egg in it. And then you have to swirl the white as it begins to tail out and get it to swirl no, around the yolk. No swirling. It no. makes me it, it makes me a wreck. <laughs> it does crack two eggs. Add the water with the measuring cup that'll tell you right on there how to uh, what what height and amount of water you put in for that. Turn it on when that beautiful sound comes on, which is this one. I have to say, that's really cheerful. Isn't that wonderful? You have omelet ready to go, all done with steam and water on this great little thing. Now, remember, what I love about this new pretty sound, it's just like the old one in the sense that just because that's going off doesn't mean the cooking is continued. It stopped the perfect condition. It's just telling you, hey, hot and ready, come and get it. You do that, and you stop the buzzer, but it never 
overcooks. Let me take you to the colors. Do we have them on the ledge? Oh, all on the ledge for you. Oh, they're on the ledge. Perfect. Yep. Okay. So let's look down here, and the one that matches my apron tonight is called purple. Purple. That is also They're most limited. All metallic. Look at those and they're metallics. all metallic colors. We yep. actually met the manufacturer at the houseware show we that did. makes this product. We did. We did. And they are a great partner with us here they at are. PBC. Beside that, we've got it for you in the blue. From blue, we go right into the middle, and that's copper. Isn't that copper great? Looks really, really beautiful. Beside that, oh, my red lovers, my foodie reds are going to love this. This is that red, think of race car red, yes. ladies, your favorite red nail polish. And then on the end, have we ever offered a stainless before? We have once before. Once? Once before. And Keyword there is once. Once. Yeah. Correct. So we've got it in stainless steel on the end, and that's the most and popular choice. 400 of these are now gone, Mark Charles. This price only good until end of day today. And guys, can we locate my. Um, yes, thank you. Um, we're on two easy payments, but if you use a Q card tonight, Mark Charles, it's five. Five, all month. All month till the All end of the month. month. See there, you're a good student. I listened. All right, so let's take a look at this omelet because there's also an omelet pan included with it. Yes. So you can choose to make the omelet. You could choose to make the um, uh, the the poached eggs we talked about. Look at this. So we're gonna put this down here, serve that up. But let's actually build the omelet to show you how easy this is. What I want you to do is put in pre-cooked um, inside the pan. We're gonna put in pre-cooked uh, hams or bacon, some things like that. We're going to sausage. Sausage. We're going to add that. What we always say is to put the ingredients, and we give you instructions on this. And then I'm going to put some extra cheese in there. And then you fill this up. Put this on there. You can fill it up. Remember, you can use farm eggs. You can use egg whites. You can use whole eggs. Let's do an egg white omelet on this one. And what you do is there's no measuring. What I love about this, no measuring. You're just filling it to the top. Okay. Then what I did was I'm going to take my little measuring cup, and on one side it says omelet and poached, and the other side it says soft, medium, boiled. Okay. okay. Right there. You can see that right there. Okay. Soft, medium, boiled, and there's the poached and omelet. Okay, so I'm going to take some water, and I'm doing an omelet. So I'm going to fill up the omelet line. That much water, boom, which is basically like nothing when you look at this, is now going to steam this omelet. And the beauty is, we're going to put the lid back on and turn this on. I just turned that on by accident. There we go. Oh no, the, actually, the poached eggs I just did are done already. Look. Oh my. You just saw me put the poached eggs in. That was the music turning it on. I thought it was prematurely done. So now this will cook on there, okay? We're gonna talk about the eggs. What I love about this, you can do one, two, three, four, five, or six. You get the same results soft, medium, or hard boiled. Think about that. You can make one soft boiled egg at a time. You can make four medium boiled eggs. You could do six hard boiled eggs. That's the beauty behind this mechanism. It's all in this plate. This is a stainless steel heating plate. Here is your tray that you always put in there, but we put the stick can and we're going to do the eggs, okay? We put those in first, and they forgot to give me eggs, I think. Yes, they did, but okay. So who, what we're going to do is your stylist? Uh, Mitch. Um, hey, if, guys, if just ask Mitch for some eggs. Some eggs. Um, so what I'm going to show you is right here how to do it. Before you put the eggs in, you're going to take the cap off the end. You're going to pierce the egg on top. Okay, that piercing is very important because that's going to leave, you know, any pressure going on. So I'm going to put one. I'm going to move them over here, guys, and I'm going to pierce this one. Okay, there. And we're piercing these piercing so that these. the eggs don't so explode. Let's say I want to do two. Okay, then I'm going to take and decide how much I want to do these eggs. So let's say I want to do two soft-boiled eggs. So I'm going to fill it up to that line. That's it, soft-boiled. Okay, you'll see it much clearer in person. I promise you. You're going to drop that in there. So remember, I'm doing two soft boiled eggs. I'm going to put this here, lid on, turn this on. Let this heat up the plate, heat up the water, turn it to steam. When the steam water is evaporated, that means these are perfectly soft boiled eggs, and you will get these results every single time soft boiled eggs, one to six eggs at a time. Okay, so here are your colors again, reminding you that purple is the most limited. I have fewer than 900 purple to go around. Next to that is the blue. From blue, we take you into copper. From copper, we take you into red. And then our most popular tonight is the stainless steel. Now, reminding you, this price only good until end of day today and only while supplies last. It's 12, two easy payments on your credit card with any card you use, but if you use your Q card, this one. Whoa. Close up. Remember, Five easy payments. Now we're doing a very special easy pay offer between now and the end of March with Q card. If you use your Q card on any item you buy, on air and online, you'll not get three pay as you ordinarily get. For the month of March, you're going to get five pay. 
on any wow. item you order on air or online. The only exception will be gift cards. So if you want to put this on five pay tonight, just use your cue card. How awesome is that? How many are gone now, Sean? 1,500 of these love cookers this. So are gone. All the things we know and love, but we put stainless, we put a new bell on there. It just makes life easier. By the way, everything I talk about, don't worry about it. We give you a pictorial directions on everything. Actual color photos on everything I do. We give you four recipes to start with. Here's some recipes there. Okay? So don't worry. This little booklet is handy. Look, everything is done for you and ready to go so you know how to do every single thing I talked about. There's no fuss. It's easy. It makes life easy. This is a real great way to get more protein and eggs in your every lifestyle by having this little easy egg cook. You don't have to guess and time things. We were talking about soft boiled, by the way. When I was growing up with a French grandmother, uh, can we hear that for a second? Come on. That, that is a delightful sound. Is that what you've got to write now are lyrics to that song. You think? We'll leave you to that for a now, moment. Now, am I wrong, but does this sound like a little German cuckoo clock where they come out with a little hammer and hit the hit the bell? That's what I think of. Do I it think. again because I want to see you do that again. I think that's nice. <laughs> Very nice. That's what I got from that. It Sorry. could be. I actually went to the factory once where the cuckoo clocks are made. I think I remember you talking about that. And right before 12 noon, it was 5 to noon. Yeah. They made us all leave the factory. Why? Because they all go off at noon. <laughs> Put your earmuffs on. Cuckoo, cuckoo, cuckoo. <laughs> now amplify that by a million. Yeah. Out of the factory. I think it's when the workers took lunch. All right. So 2100 are now gone. All of these little inserts all go in the top rack of your dishwasher. Now, obviously, the machine has a plug, so you're just going to wipe it clean. But even this little dome goes in the dishwasher. Top rack only on all these pieces. This is stainless steel. Next to that is the red. Then the copper in the middle, then blue, and finally, most limited is the purple. Now, fewer than 800 oh, purple. Beautiful machine. 2,300 of these are gone, Mark Charles. This cooks up to half dozen eggs. Yeah? Up to half dozen eggs, but I need to stress this. If you wanted one medium boiled egg, it does one medium boiled egg. It does up to six at a time. So, just to show you the difference that this machine can do to precision, you can have soft boiled, you can have medium boiled, you can have Hard bullets. Look, another one's done. Remember, that sound doesn't mean that it's going to keep cooking until you turn it off. It's already done cooking. May I say this? Yes. The reason that these go off is because the watermark Charles added evaporated. evaporated. So I turn that off. So you're not having to worry I about left. when it shuts off. It'll shut off for you and okay. let you know All the that it's gone. done. It's been steamed to perfection. That's why the measuring cup is so important because the amount of water is going to evaporate differently and cook it longer. It'll evaporate longer if it's hard boiled, and soft boiled, of course, the least, and medium boiled. I'm fogging it up with the steam. I apologize for that. But that's what's the beauty behind that. So you can get the perfect eggs each time, one to six. Let's check on our omelets and our um, eggs. Your omelet and, and your, your poached eggs. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm lost for words today, I swear to you. Um, so there's my two poached eggs that you saw me put in there. I literally just cracked an egg, cracked an egg, added the water, turned this on. Once this was off, this, this tells me this is ready to go. And then let's look at that egg white omelet you saw me build right there. Look how beautiful that is. Fluffy and wonderful. It's not done completely yet. I think it's just a little bit more. And you know what you could also do right before these uh, finish cooking? You could you dust oh, yeah. them with a little black pepper, ground black pepper, a little salt if you like that on yes, your omelet. Yes, love that. Love that. That would be really nice. And if you wanted to pop a little extra cheese on there right before it finishes, yeah. that could melt that cheese for you. How many are gone now? 3,000 are gone. This price will go it's away. It's a great price for a metal. Yeah. Metal. It goes away end of day today or when the item sells out, whichever comes first. Put it on two pay with any credit card you use. Or five pay with your Q card. Mark Charles is coming back with one more item. Yeah. So stick around. We'll be back. Bye. But right now, is it time for prime rib? Mr. Rostelli is here it is. from Rostelli Meats. And we're awfully excited about this. And you are about to learn. I'm just going to tell you right off the top. You're going to learn in this presentation. Ray Rostelli's <clears throat> foolproof plan for cooking prime rib for any time, but particularly now for the Easter holiday coming up. Yes. And if you follow his easy directions, and they're included, they are. You're going to have a perfect prime rib every time. Every time, every Mr. Rostelli, welcome back, sir. I know you're a little you. under the weather That's tonight with okay. the cold. We appreciate you, <clears throat> you, you soldiering through. This is going to be shipped either now or April 8th, both in time for. Easter. Mm -hmm. Five easy payments on your credit card. There's even an auto delivery opportunity where we'll deliver your first shipment either now or 4 8, April 8th, and your second shipment will come in November prior to the holidays. Now, 
This comes along with the steak and prime rib seasoning, but it also comes along with your famous recipe for making this dish. Tell us first about the prime rib because this <clears throat> is the dish we look forward to. Yes, so let's let's really go right to the meat block because I think it's so important to understand what you're really getting. So this is a typical prime rib. Now this David with the bone and the fat on this, what you would typically buy, is over 10 pounds. But we really don't want you to buy fat and bone. So here's what we've done. We've taken all the fat off, oh we've my. taken all the bone off, and all we give you is the center cut. So this is what you're gonna roast. And look at the beautiful marbling inside of that rib. That is what I look at as a butcher for 42 years. When I see this type of marbling in here, I know I'm gonna have a really rich, really wonderfully tasting piece of meat. The other thing I love is that you left a little fat cap on top because that's gonna help with flavor. That is correct. Oh, so that fat cap is gonna render down into the prime rib and as it cooks, you're gonna come away with this melt in your mouth experience. That is so true. So. <clears throat> it's, and it's, what's critical about this prime rib is it's black Angus. It's been aged for 28 days, which is really, really important. Uh, and it's been a uh, you know it's been a, it's been a favorite at the butcher shop. You know when folks come into the butcher shop week in and week out, it's always about Ray. What's for dinner this week? What's the best thing? Well, we're, we've got the holidays coming up. We've got the Easter holidays. This happens to be that center piece on a lot of tables around the holidays. And the second question is. Well, how do I cook it to get it perfect all the time? Well, here's we're going to tell you now. This is Ray Rostelli's <clears throat> foolproof plan for roasting a prime rib. So tell us about this <clears throat> because it's so easy. Here so we go. It is really, really simple, and I'm going to uh, going to take you really right to the rib itself. So it looks like a cake because I've buttered it. Now all the recipe comes with it. It shows you exactly what to do, but all I want you to do is take this and butter. So you're going to take room temperature butter and what room are you mixing in butter. there? All I've got in here is some garlic, parsley, thyme, um, and rosemary, salt and pepper. And all okay. I'm doing is I'm covering the top, the bottom, I'm sorry, not the bottom, the tops and the sides of this entire rib. With now, this <clears> butter <throat> frosting. Yes. Now, while I'm doing that, I want to get my oven preheated to 500 degrees. So that sounds a little crazy, but David, what happens with 500 degree temperature? This butter is going to sear this rib and then it's going to slowly start to melt into this. So, the recipe is right on here as well. So, you're going to take this rib at 500 degrees, your oven's going to be on. You're going to put it in, but you're only going to put it in for 25 minutes. That's it. Now, what you're going to do at 25 minutes is you're going to shut your oven off. And you're going to leave the door shut for two hours. So what you're basically doing is you're mimicking what they typically do in a great steakhouse, slow and low. But that butter just begins to melt in. And let me show you what happens. Oh, I can't wait. Yes. This is going to be so fantastic. So this you covered with a mixture of room temperature softened butter mm -hmm. with parsley, sage, rosemary, thyme, garlic. That's it. Salt and pepper. That's it. And every could we use your steak? Uh, you, you can uh, use steak that seasoning? steak seasoning as well. But look at every rib is going to come out like this. I know, you know, people go to a to the to the great steakhouse and they get a what? great prime rib, but they can't get it to be like they get it at the steakhouse. Now you can, Mr. Estelle, You have to cut a little piece off that end for I'm me there. I'll give you this piece right, right here, here that little, David. Little piece of the deckel uh, there. Yes, there you go, sir. Oh my, yes, yes. So <clears> this was cooked. Your method. Yes. With the <clears throat> butter and the herbs on the crust, and then left in the oven for two hours, oven off, door closed. Oven off, and all those recipes. Here we go. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Okay. <laughs> Just gotta dry my hands. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. <clears throat> mm hmm. Super flavorful. Yes. Lots and lots <clears throat> of moisture. Great flavor of the butter. All the fresh herbs. The only thing left, the happy there dance. There it is. That's the prime rib happy dance. That is crazy. <clears throat> oh my word. Now, this recipe is included. It is. But remember, preheat your oven to 500 degrees. This is easy. 500 degrees, preheat your oven. Place the seasoned buttered roast on a cooking rack on a co or on a baking sheet in the oven. Cook it for 25 minutes at 500 degrees. Turn the oven off. Leave the door closed, leave the roast in the oven. Let it sit for two hours. Take it out, carve, and enjoy. That's how simple it is. We've taken all the mm. work out of it for you. We've made it simple. So if you've been intimidated by a prime rib roast in the past, don't be. It's so simple. This 
recipe I've been giving out for over 25 years in, my, in the butcher shop, and people come back every year for it. But I did something a little bit more for you this year that I think is really important because people do a lot of planning around the holidays. You want to plan for when your roast is going to be ready. So I'm providing this card inside there. And all you have to do is take a look at when you would like to have dinner. So, for example, if you'd like to have dinner at 6 o'clock in the evening, put your roast in at 325, turn the oven off at 350, at 550, pull it out of the oven, and at 6 o'clock you're ready to eat. So this card will be coming in every box and it'll give you a great cooking guide to tell you how it works. Now, Ray, we're shipping this either immediately <clears throat> or April 8th. And I would also tell you there's an auto delivery opportunity. And if you go with that, you'll get your first shipment now or April 8th, and your second shipment comes in November prior to the holidays. So you'll be ready to roll again. This is our food of the month for March. And already for the month, how many are gone now, Sean? 1,200 now gone for the month. And if you do this cooking method, it comes out a perfect, perfect medium rare? Yes, medium rare. So if you'd like to get a, your, your rib a little bit more, go from 25 minutes to 30 minutes. Now you're going to have a little bit more medium well. But look at how beautiful and juicy this rib is, David. And that's what and happens. And all that butter renders down into the roast. It does, All yes. the marbling <clears throat> renders down into the roast. And all this is going to make everyone at your Easter dinner table come and pat you on the back and say thank you yes, the, you, for you, one fantastic you, meal. You will be the star that day. Woo, no, no question. <laughs> all right. So we've got a little trivia for everyone before we go to a short break. And we're going to ask you, what is a nickname for the fleshy part of the tail of a chicken? I know. This is where the tail feathers grow. Is that called, wait for it, I gotta get a closer so I can read it. Is that called the Parsons nose or Pope's nose, the saddle, the back cope, or the comb of the chicken? Anybody have any guesses? Well, we're gonna reveal the answer on the other side of this short break. Stick around. You're the butcher, you should know this question. <laughs> we're back in moments. Yard and Garden Essentials. Find what you need to bring your outdoor space to life. Don't miss our garden guide. All easy pay offers Saturday and Sunday on QVC. Kickstart your spring wardrobe with the perforated leather slide sandals from Earth Brands Footwear. Check it out starting Thursday at midnight on QVC. What if there was a place where you could find some of the best food QVC has to offer, some of the best wine QVC has to offer, and after that, some of the best deals. Today's special values, QVC2 big deals, maybe even stealing the steal. Wine and Dine with Rick, Friday at 6 p.m. and Rick's Weekend Preview at 7 p.m. on QVC2. Spruce up your makeup routine with the Customer Favorites Collection from IT Cosmetics. Don't miss it Friday at 11 p.m. Eastern and throughout the day Saturday on QVC. So what is the nickname for the fleshy part of the tail of a chicken where the tail feathers grow? Is it the Parsons nose or Pope's nose, the saddle, the back cope, or the comb? The answer is Parsons nose or Pope's nose. It may be. According to thefoodreference.com, the fleshy part of the tail of a chicken is called the Parsons nose or Pope's nose. If you guessed that, you are correct. Right now, though, it's time to get Simply Clean with David, and we've got a fantastic tool to help you out in the kitchen. But you know what? You're seeing a traditional mop in that little graphic there. We're going to show you a mop that is pretty different than the mops you've used to you that you used to use, or maybe you grew up using. We're going to talk to you about a Clean Spin 360 microfiber mop. Comes with a collapsible bucket, system, and an extra mop head. Diana Irvine is one of our problem solution specialists. She's I back with us. Hi, friend. Problems, <laughs> nice to see you. You know, a, a big problem for me growing up when I got mopping duty at home mm -hmm. was having to. Ring the mop out. Yes. Because it's nasty. It. And you have to touch the yuck, right? Mm -hmm. What if we could find a mop that would ring so we'd be ready to roll? I would love it. Well, your spin mop does all, all that. All right. We've got some great colors. We also have a really good price on yes. this. <laughs> this is $19.98 for what? You're getting your mop. 
yeah. two mop heads, and the collapsible bucket. So all of this, this entire system to help you clean and revolutionize the mopping that you do in your home. Because as David mentioned, this one you don't have to touch, but yet it works so efficiently. This color is green. Mm -hmm. 500 left in the green. This one is gray. Yes. 900 left. Then I've got it for you in turquoise. This one is the coral. coral. And lilac. And finally, we have it in the lilac. Yes. Lilac is most limited, 400 to go around. Here's your value story, and then we're going to show you how this works. If you went to retail to buy this identical pack up, you could expect to pay $36.66. We are $16.68 less. Yes, we're on two easy payments, unless, of course, you're using your Q card today. Then it's five. Oh, nice. How about that? And we're going to do it all for you tonight because the price will go away at end of day today. Oh, wow. Miss Diana, how does this work? Well, I love this because it's simple and it's easy. It's adjustable. So whether you need a long handle, maybe David would need, I need a shorter handle. You get two of these very thirsty microfiber mop heads with the long absorbent fingers and then inside here, your short scrubby fingers. So what's nice is because this scrubs and absorbs, you're getting sort of all of that work done at one time rather than having to have multiples. Now you're getting this collapsible bucket, which is really revolutionary because the footprint gets to be very small when you're not using it. But it opens up. You can see it has a nice kickstand legs here. And then this side is your washer, this side is your dryer. So what you do is you unlock your mop. There's a little lock here. You unlock it so that it's loose, and then you're going to put it down into the washer to moisten it. This is getting that mop head wet. Now you can choose to use chemicals or you can just do it with water. I'm showing you here, but then what you're going to do is go into the dryer. So the spinner side is what actually dries out or reduces the moisture in the mop so that you have the perfect amount of moisture for your floors. And then lock it up, and then I say tilt it at an angle so that you're in mopping mode, and then you go to work absorbing and scrubbing. So this was sort of a thickened, puddeny, kind of nectary uh, liquid that I had on here. That was some paint and crayon. And notice also how it goes right along the baseboard. So if something is gross and kind of seeped towards the baseboards, you have the ability to do that. Now this is jelly and this is peanut butter and that's chocolate frosting. They're sticky. So what you're going to do is use the scrubbing fingers and this mop is moist so it's still got the moisture and the wetness in there to lift that stain but I haven't had to do any scrubbing with my hands. I've used the mop. Now if I want to go to get a clean mop again, I go back into my washer. Using the same mop head again, you can use chemicals or not. And then into the dryer and you've basically wrung out all the debris and yuck that was on the mop so that you have a nice clean fresh mop to work with for your next mess. 250 of these are already gone. This price is amazing. We're also able to do it for you tonight on easy pay on two easy payments. But if you use that cue card tonight, it's five easy payments. Don't miss out on this opportunity. We're really excited to be able to offer this to you tonight at such a great price. If you are dust mopping, you're going to be able to use this very easily. More and more people are moving to homes now with hardwood floors. Mm -hmm. Maybe you're buying an older home or you've got an older home and you're ripping up all that carpet and exposing that real hardwood down below. Because it was a time in history when everybody thought, well, you know, it was better to cover up hardwood floors with carpet. Or linoleum, too. We found when we redid our home, they, they covered up beautiful random with oak with like linoleum. So, oh, my word. Yeah, it's nice to have these great wood floors, but if something like this happens, you saw me pick up the hair, but maybe it's flour that spilled on your kitchen floor. Maybe it's creamer, or milk, or whatever happens to spill. What I'd say is moisten your mop. So right here in the washing side, again, this is like having your own washer and dryer, and then spin it out. And then for, for hardwood floors, I like to spin it out a good bit so there's not a lot of moisture because you don't want to leave any moisture on the floor. Then lock your mop and then first absorb the wet mess. So allow those thirsty fingers to absorb up the wet mess and then go to town on the dry stuff so that now You've cleaned the floor, you've picked up the mess, but you see, David, there's not a lot of wet left on there. That will dry very quickly and leave those great hardwood floors nice and spick and span. Well, and you have to remember, microfiber by its nature is super absorbent. Absolutely. So this is going to be the kind of thing that's going to get those wet messes up and mm -hmm. give you no problem after it's all said and done. I would tell you now we've taken orders for over 700 and I've got great colors for you. Let me remind you, we have this for you in green and you're getting all this for $19 and change. I have 400 left of the green, then the gray, 750 in that gray. Next to that is the turquoise, available and popular. Next to that is coral. And then finally, lilac, 
I have 280 left in that lilac color. Here's your value story. This price does go away end of show, which is also the end of day. So this is your opportunity to pick up this great value, but at retail you would pay $36.66. We've got it today for over $16.60 less. We also have two easy payments on your credit card of $9.99, unless of course you're using your Q card, then it's five pay, yeah. which is awesome. Here's a little videotape. Yeah, so what's nice is that you could just pop this open. It's such a small footprint to put your water in. By the way, there's a rubber plug on the side, so for emptying it, it's really easy. You pull the plug and let it run outside or in your tub or in a shower or wherever you have. But if you have hard floors in your house, you're going to love the fact that this comes with two microfiber mop heads that you can dry dust with it. You can pick up some of the worst messes. You can get in and around furniture easily. If your water heater or your dishwasher happens to overflow, now you have the ability to get out the mop and absorb up that mess really fast. Great for using in other rooms in the house as well. And there's that plug that you pull out. You can put the mop heads right in the washer, but we recommend you just let it air dry. But think about the hard floors you have. Nice compact size to pop it out when you need it. This is linoleum. You saw us do hardwood. Now tile. Do you have tile in your home? We have a whole bunch of gross messes that happened here, David. It seems like the peanut butter and jelly sandwich never falls. I read online right why. You why, know why is that? Tell me. If your pizza, your pizza falls sauce side down, your bread falls peanut butter side down, the whole reason is weight. You've got oh, more the, weight yeah, on the top sense. of pizza or bread that's been covered with jam or jelly. That's why when you drop it, it goes to the heavy side down, which is why the yuck always hits the floor first. <laughs> and of course, it's never something easy. That internet thing's going to catch on. <laughs> People are going to start using that thing, huh? So what's nice about this is, is that I'm about to actually, Girl, you got a water I got a going catastrophe on. happening here. So no problem though, because I'm not going to get out a bunch of paper towels. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm going to let the microfiber do its work, which is absorbing as you see here. I had applesauce, I have paint, I have jelly, I have peanut butter, I have crayon, I have marker. Notice how it's getting down into the, the grout between the tiles as well. And then see what happened over here? There was a spill. I'm going to take my mop and I'm going to let that moisture get all absorbed through those thirsty microfiber fingers and clean that up without having to fret, worry, waste paper towels, or get my hands dirty. I don't have to worry with the spin mop because now I'm going to take this mop, and you can see it's pretty nasty and dirty, and we're going to put it back in the washer. And again, if you want to use a, a chemical cleaner, you absolutely can. Or maybe if you like some kind of oil soap for your hard floors, you can put that in there too. And then spin it out so that all the moisture is minimized. And now you have the ability to go on with your next job. So, 2200 have now been ordered. This is $19.98. Yes, it's on two easy payments. Use your Q card tonight, it's on five. This is green, 200 left in the green. There's gray. 400 left in the gray. There's turquoise, most popular choice. Then the coral. And finally on the end is the lilac. Oh, lilac is gone. Oh, bye bye, lilac. All right, no more lilac. All right, here we go. I Stop. liked the lilac. So, David, I had a little mishap. Apparently, so did everybody here. else. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I had a little mishap here. My entire ice cream sundae spilled on the floor. You know, the only thing that is harder. Is when you dump mac and cheese on the floor. Yes, and that's really and, and you know what was what's great is because of the mostly because it breaks my heart. <laughs> because you'd be hungry after and you wouldn't want to eat it off the floor then I suppose no, no so we'd have to make new ones. Some mistake you make only once. <laughs> The five second rule doesn't yeah, work in doesn't that really instance. Apply. Yes, but let's see how much this has picked up. And that was thick liquid. So it doesn't have to just be water. It can be anything that is liquid and enough for the mop to absorb. But also you notice the hair it picked up. It picked up sprinkles. And now the floor looks pretty darn good, doesn't it? But it might be a little sticky. So what we're going to do is we're going to clean off this mop. If you want to use a cleaning solution, maybe in this case I might spray a little something down on the floor. But then I'm going to go back over it with my mop so that I can make sure that it's cleaned and sanitized. And that's what's nice. I haven't touched this mop head one time yet, but you've seen a whole series of gross messes on all these hard floors. And this was simple, easy, and effective. And when, it, when I'm all done, David, I'm going to close it up like this, put the mop right inside. You'll see there's a little notch here. Dump the water out, of course, and then just store it as a compact system. There's also a handle on that bucket, too. So if she needs to pick that up and carry it, we can do that, too. Now, how many? 2,800 are gone now. We have these for you in the following colors. Here's the green. 
100. All I have left in the green. Here's gray. 250 in the gray. Turquoise, the most popular. And then coral. And what's that? Coral's not far behind. 3,000 now gone. Price goes away, end of show. Everyone stay on the line here. Diana, thank you so much. Always My a pleasure. pleasure. Thank you for nice having me. Nice to have me. you back. Hey, would like to remind you that my cookbook, my latest cookbook is available. This is my third cookbook. What we're talking about is the Comfort Food Shortcuts. In the Kitchen with David cookbook, there are 110 recipes, all with supermarket shortcuts, all with 10 ingredients or less. It's $19.48. If you're using your uh, cue card tonight, you can put that on 5 pay. That's right. That's what I said, 5 pay. And every single recipe has a full page color photo. You all thought that Tara wasn't coming, did you? Well, I'm looking here. Oh, do I have any water left? I need to wet my whistle, Miss Tara. Mm hmm. Now I'm better. Oh, awesome. Hi, hello. Hi, darling. Yeah. How Tara are you? Tetcher is hello, back. Hello. You probably saw on my social media that Tara and I um, had so much fun. We found each other in Chicago at the house for show. Somehow we always seem to find each other. You know what? Good friends always do. Yes, they do. Hey, Tara's here tonight with yes. mugs. Yes. Spoons and coasters. Love. Mm. Oh, <laughs> and David's is empty now. And mine's empty now, so I'm going to go <laughs> looking for a refill. You tell us what we're going to get. Okay, so 14 ounces. Love the individual hand painted hand painting, David. Love the fact that we have two new colors today. This is one of them, our spring Fetty. Now we include our 14 ounce with that beautiful pedestal, oversized handle. The lid it is included, so that's your coaster for the bottom or your lid for the top. And we actually even do a little cutout, so you can put that adorable spoon right inside there. If you're picking up the old world, you have that beautiful <coughs> braiding that runs around the edges. If you're picking up uh, floral lace, then you have, of course, the beading. You're going to receive all four, all four stainless steel spoons with that beautiful accent that every Everything goes right in the dishwasher. And of course, it's our stoneware, which means it goes in the oven up to 500 degrees, the dishwasher, the fridge, the freezer, and of course, the microwave. These are the little engines that could in your kitchen. Hey, we are really excited too that at retail, these will be $54. Mm -hmm. We are $16.53 less. I have two new offerings for you today. In floral lace, I have spring. You do? And in Old World, I have spring fetti. Perfect. But I only have 200 left in the spring fetti. Good to know. Now, these I did do all the not colors come down front. box. No, these right? do not. They'll come in these a shipping box. These are our everyday. Yep. They'll come in a shipping these box. These are our everyday ones. Do you want to sneak this way? Beg your pardon? Do you want to go this way? Maybe I should. Okay. Because I know I'm never going to fit through that little small well, space. Well, me neither, but. Oh, yes, you will. Ugh, okay. See there, look at that, because <laughs> you're, you're tiny. <laughs> all right, so we're going to start, Miss Judy, for uh, ease. We'll start here. Gonna go across the bottom row to Tara, and then we'll jump up onto the second row and come back. So this is floral lace in spring, brand new. Look at the pretty green on Isn't top. Isn't that gorgeous? It's like a kiwi green. Four hundred, all I have left here. Wow. Okay. This is fall. But look, look at the fitting on the spoons. They're little leaves. That cute. Then this is your blue, always popular green, red, cranberry. Light blue, some might call that Carolina blue. I know I would. Next to that is the eggplant. Say it with me the chocolate. chocolate. Beside that is your um, spice. And finally, the black. Now, we are much more limited in Old World in every choice. So, beginning closest to Terra in the Old World blue. Next to that is confetti. Then we have the green. Then your cranberry. 300 left in cranberry. Here's your red, 250. This uh, eggplant, 200. The brown, 175. The spice, 130. The black, 400 remain. Whatever color you choose, you will get four mugs, four coasters, and four spoons. All right, here we go. All right, so here's what I love about it. First of all, it can go in the oven up to 500 degrees. So I love that, David, you can do individual portions. 14 ounces is a nice, generous size of how about mac and cheese with, of course, a little bacon. So look how great this is. I can come right out. Little sneak peek, maybe, at what's coming up next Wednesday. Um, a week from uh -huh. today. It's National Basket Weave Day. Did you know? Well, I did know, uh -huh. and I think that maybe what you see these all cups right. resting on might be coming up next Wednesday. Hmm. 
Is Imagine that, that. Is that dinnerware I spy? Yeah. Hmm. But look how beautiful. Of course, your mugs go right on here. So you have that beautiful bacon mac and cheese. Look, look. at that. I love how moist it is when you're cooking with stoneware. Again, no butters or oils, no extra added fats, and you get that moist, even heating, whether you're putting it in the microwave because you want to reheat or cook, or of course, you're putting it in the oven mm. up to 500 degrees. You can put smells. French onion soup in there. I know you love that. I do love that. Mm -hmm. One of my favorites because I love steakhouses and they always serve it at the steakhouse, the French onion soup. Uh, it's the best. You know what else is super fun? All of those mug cakes, all of those recipes for mug cakes. Here's what I love about it you can literally mix right in here and bake right in there. Look at that. Everything pops right out. You can go ahead and ice it. These could be little individual cakes, little individual desserts if you wanted to, or of course the ever popular mug cakes. So again, nice oversized handle. Put them in the fridge, put them in the freezer, and the best part, even though they're all individually hand painted, you can put them in the dishwasher to clean them. Mm. Um, by the way, I might have picked the bacon off the other two while we were waiting. Really? It's amazing how, we, how we're so similar like that. You know what? We're separated <laughs> at birth. Yes, we are. Mm. Twins, really. A sister from another mother. <laughs> mm. All right, so, so what else did we do? We did mac and cheese. We did some mug cakes. The we actually, chicken joint will be closed when I get off work tonight, so I got to eat now. The chicken joint. Mm -hmm. I love you. Um, of course, put it right under your Keurig. You have that gorgeous pedestal. Break these up. Excuse me for less than ten dollars a gift. If you're thinking about maybe keeping one, office mates, all the different ideas you have for these. Mm. I love this item. Yummy. All right, set of four mugs. Yes. With the little lidets. I call them coasters. Yeah, Lidets. that's fine. Either way. $300. You know what this is also great for? Tell me. It's a tea bag rest. Yes. Or your spoon rest. Yep. Absolutely. That's all the reason why or, it was or, designed. Or Tell take me. Take the tea bag and wrap the little string you around the spoon. Why not? Give it a little, you know, a little squeeze mm -hmm. and then put the tea bag here so it doesn't stain your linens. There you go. That's why we included the spoons. That's why, of course, they go in the fridge, they go in the freezer, they go in the oven up to 500 degrees, they go in the microwave. Look how beautiful that spring is. So again, remember, if you're picking up that floral lace, it's got that in, that carved, engraved detail pattern, and then the color is saturated around the edges. Um, so I love the fact that again, you have that gorgeous pop of color, and it's absolutely beautiful. And then look, of course, like we were saying, put them in the freezer. Come out with your ice cream. Look at how beautiful this is. Maybe you do some ice cream sundaes. You could do a root beer float in here. You can do mac and cheeses. You can do chilies. You can do soups. Our mugs are bakers as well. Super versatile. Yes. Don't miss out on these three easy payments on your credit card. 400 sets are now gone. You know, Tara, I'm not sure if you're aware because this started when we were in Chicago. What? But for the entire month of March, yes. on here and online, mm -hmm. Anything you buy with your Q card is normally how many easy pays? Two, right? Three. Three. You know what it is for the month of March? What? Five. Wow. So this is on three pay tonight, but if you want to put it on five, simply use your Q card. There you go. Now you're going to be able to get your Temptations You Love on even more easy pays. You won't be able to get the bacon because it's all gone. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. I mean, I found a little for you. Oh, oh. there just happens to be some noodles well, that's attached. That's just <laughs> going to be fine. Oh, and the best part, put it in the dishwasher when you want to clean it. Coming right back for that. <laughs> All right. Judy, just like last time, we'll start at the bottom work our way over. So, floral lace. Beg your pardon. Oh, that's true. Not down front is spring fetish. Thank you very much for reminding us. Actually, it was Sean, my producer. I have to give credit Thank where you, credit's Sean. due. All right. How many left here in spring fetish? 150. Wow. All I have left. Okay. Wow. And okay. these are seasonal, so you won't see these again until this time next year if we do bring them back. Floral lace. This is spring, brand new, 350. Next to that is your fall. Then blue, then green. We'll do this a good clip. Then red, cranberry, light blue. Uh, don't help me. Eggplant, chocolate, chocolate, spice, and black. Up top, much more limited is old world blue, confetti, green, red, uh, cranberry. Red, eggplant, brown, spice, and black. Over 500 sets are now gone. Three easy payments, unless, of course, you use your cue card, then it's five easy payments. Love that. It fits nicely under your Keurig it does, coffee maker. Which I love. And remember, you can put it in the microwave. So if this is the piece that you bring to work, you can reheat things, whether it's your cured coffee, hot chocolate, whether you're gifting it to maybe one of your coworkers, you can of course put some chocolates inside here. These are those types of things. A mug, everybody can always use a mug because everybody always drinks something, whether it's water, tea, coffee. So again, I love the idea of having these at, at the ready. I wasn't eating. That's okay. Just listening. I know. Thank you.
Hang on every word. I figured. Every word of that bacon. Darling. I will not see you on Sunday, but I, I will see you on Wednesday for a very big day. Yes, you will be. I'm a week so from excited. today. National Basket Weave Day. Very special today. Special value. Sorry. <laughs> All right. So as we are getting into the last half an hour of our show, it's time for a little recipe taste. That's right. Chef Nate Call, you're back from Le Creuset. Our whole theme this month is foodie, family, and friends. Mm -hmm. So we're we're really encouraging our foodie right. family Thank members you. to you provide too. us with recipe ideas, and this is one of the recipes included with today's special value. It is. So, chef, tell us real quickly what this is. So this is a braised chicken with spring vegetables and a mint and lemon gremolata on top. Mm. I love this because I just want to demonstrate you can braise something and still have a nice light, bright flavor to it. Mm. Here we go. Oh boy, is that good. Yeah. Mm. You're gonna like this a lot. I love radishes and turnips too. It's some of my favorites. I tried just a piece of the radish mm -hmm. first because I've never, I never really braised a radish. Mm -hmm. It's fantastic. It really is. It takes a little bit of the bite out. It tastes like it was cooked in French enamel cast iron too. Oh, mm -hmm. yes, it does. Now, if you're looking for this recipe, you'll find it mm -hmm. in your pack up with today's special value if you ordered that today. If you did not, you can also find it by searching David's recipes on QVC.com because Chef Nate was kind enough to provide us with the recipe and we made it available on. Absolutely. So be sure and check all that out. Stacy is actually going to help out with the next two items. Yep. Right. That'll give me time to jump in the chat, see what you guys are up to. <laughs> and then I'll join Chef Nate for our final look of only, I believe, two colors left. I think so, David. Of today's special value. Can't All right, wait. sir, we'll see you Thank shortly. You. In the meantime, here's our Stacy and some. Yes, ever wanted to make the trip for, to Paris but couldn't quite get there? Well, how about I bring Paris or France to you? Mm -hmm. Look what is back. And this is actually a very special opportunity because it's often that we see authentic gourmet croissants from France here on In the Kitchen with David. But we don't always see the minis and the minis available in the choice of chocolate mm -hmm. or the traditional butter. Jennifer Kovic is here with us. Always brings us great foodie items like authentic gourmet, busy mom as well, and wife. And this is such a special treat to have more back in stock. Right, this finally. Is awesome. <laughs> I know, finally. So, what you're going to get are 42 pieces. And what you'll decide is whether you want 42 of the chocolate mini croissants. Mm -hmm. And look at, they're all laid out there. Very limited in the chocolate, as I knew we would be. Or would you like 42? of the mini butter. That is your choice. This is on two easy payments of $22.50, and you can do auto delivery, so every 90 days for a year, you get these minis shipped to you without you having to replace your order at this easy pay. You can cancel any time. So I always urge, do the auto delivery anyway. But let's talk about this, because this is truly made in France, the authentic croissant and to see it with chocolate, mm -hmm. this is pure heaven. That is, it's unbelievable. Authentic Gourmet, so many of us know and love Authentic Gourmet already for their unbelievable butter French croissants. But what you may not know is they're a premier bakery in Europe that supplies to all those luxurious hotels, mm -hmm. those fabulous restaurants and cafes. You know, like you were saying, now we get the opportunity to bring a little bit of that artisanal flavor right to your door. With, again, starting right here with the mini French butter croissants, and then you get, again, the, every single layer, you're getting that sweet wow. French butter. It's sweet. It is unbelievable, unlike anything else you will ever have, layer upon layer upon layer of that crispy flakiness on the outside and just wonderful French sweet butter on the inside. But what we're also giving you here too is that ribbon. And we call this a ribbon because it's just a little bit of that dark chocolate right through there. And this is what I love about French pastries is that they don't overdo anything. Mm. This is not like, uh, you know, your American donut where the donut is simply there to hold the filling. That's not this at all. They don't want to overpower the croissant. They want you to be able to have a little bit of everything. So look at that. You get a little ribbon of that dark mm. chocolate. But let's not forget that signature puff pastry right there, the flakiness. Oh, it's unbelievable. Oh, yes. I mean, this is just look at how light and airy and layer upon layer right. of that flaky mm -hmm. butteriness that we love. Remember, you have your choice of either all 42 right. in butter or all 42 in chocolate. We do not have a combo on this. If you want the chocolate, 
I have 1400 to go around and that is it. Again, this is a rare opportunity to have these on In the Kitchen with David because oftentimes on gourmet holiday, they're there, right. but they're always flying out the door. They so are. have them here. Mm -hmm. um, I love the fact that these are so easy to make because I've tried yes. other croissants before, right. but there was so much like pre-planning. You had to have them out the night before mm -hmm. so they could arrive. That's called proofing, right? It's right? called proofing, yes, okay. absolutely. Yes, and thank you. That's a wonderful point. With Authentic Gourmet, there is no proofing. You don't have to plan ahead. So this is how they will arrive to you. They come individually quick frozen. So you take out what you want, when you want it, nothing more than that. Look at how they arrive. Here's that traditional mini French butter croissant and then the chocolate croissant. This is what you can expect. Bake these at 350 degrees directly from frozen. No proofing, no thawing, nothing to consider here. Just pop them in the oven at 350 and in about 20 minutes or until your oven shows you that they're golden brown and you mm -hmm. will smell them. This aroma will fill your home you will know when they're ready. And that's why I think they're so wildly popular is because there is no pre-planning that needs to go into this. Mm -hmm. It is delectable. Mm -hmm. It is the perfect portion size. So if you want just a little bit of sweetness with your tea or maybe in the morning you have, you know, a quiet moment to yourself mm -hmm. and you're really enjoying a nice cup of espresso or your, your favorite Keurig coffee, then you want a little something but not overfilling. This oh. is perfect. But yet, this is also great if you want to add this as a dinner roll. We mm -hmm. have lobster rolls right over here, mini lobster rolls. You can use this as tea biscuits. Great with the Rostelli prime rib if you want to do a surf and turf. Again, use those as your dinner rolls as well. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Just that ribbon of chocolate going Just all enough, the way through right? the center. Well, you know, first of all, the size is perfect because mm -hmm. my husband and I are chocolate croissant fans. Mm -hmm. And we pick them up at a bakery, the full size. We right. often find ourselves just splitting one because right. one would be too much. And right. we like it with our little coffee and tea. So I like this perfect portion size mm -hmm. for that little pick-me-up. And again, so easy to make. Yes, dust over a little powdered sugar right. or if you have a little chocolate sauce mm -hmm. and I'm sure you you know you could pour that over or I love a little raspberry to mix in a raspberry chocolate. Yes yes absolutely here's a little raspberry right here I mean look at how mm. divine that is and the thing is these are wonderful all on their own mm. or you can add a little bit more put your own honey if you would like on there a little more butter if you want you just saw powdered sugar we have caramel as well if you're thinking maybe for dessert I mean this is something that really it's so versatile it can really be used any way look enjoy it for this. breakfast lunch dinner just something a little in between all of that look dessert at all that chocolate. oh my gosh and it's just enough it's mm. not going to take over the croissant we really wanted to only give enough to complement the croissant because that's how authentic gourmet started i mean this is that time-honored traditional croissant that recipe mm. that has been used for years mm. That is beautiful. <laughs> Again, that really rich artisanal dark mm -hmm. chocolate, but it doesn't overpower the butter yeah. butteriness or it doesn't make it heavy. Right. You know, really nice and light. Mm -hmm. All right, so if you want the 42 count in chocolate, I'm definitely more limited in that. So please be on the line, place your order. Um, and we also have the butter version for you. Sean, if you said something to me, can you say that again? Okay. Two easy payments of $22.25 from mm -hmm. Authentic Gourmet. Bring a little bit thank of France you. to your kitchen table. Jennifer Kovic, thank, thank you so you. much. So good to see you. All right, you too. Let's go over. Mark Charles Masilli is not quite done yet. He's still hanging out here in the kitchen. And he brought us something that's really cool because I am a huge fan of the original two cup pull and chop mm -hmm. that you brought here to PBC from Coover Con. Now what Mark Charles has is something that is kind of a reiteration the grand of pappy. that pull and chop. The grand pappy, as we mm -hmm. like to call it. <laughs> While the pull and chop chopped for us really nice and easy, this one now is going to slice and grate. It's the four cut, easy cut food slicer. Uh, we have it on three easy payments of $14.67. We sold out of one color last time we presented. I'm happy to say all colors are back in stock. Pretty cool. It's Take it a great thing easy. and make it a greater. Yeah. So we, we basically give you a stainless steel disc. I'll show it to you. Actually, we have it in front. I think we have it broken down. The okay. color's down there. You get two discs that are double-sided. Mm -hmm. One thick, one thin slice, and one thick, one thin grate. 
They're right there. You just yep. flip them. Okay. You get a, a menu, a, what you, a recipe book. You get the mm -hmm. brush to clean it, mm -hmm. and you get the mechanism. It's the pull chop we know and love, but in a grater and a slicer. Which is really nice. Okay, so your colors here, you can see it in red. This blue color, that is the color that sold out last time presented, right. so it is back. Yep. Mm -hmm. Then we have it for you in black. And then green is our most limited color. K46999 is your item number. And you say this is really super popular so at QVC in the UK. UK. I go there five times a year and we sell this. We've been selling it for years. And you guys have been watching me from the UK on .com and say, bring it here. So we brought it here. There's a safety feature I got to tell you about. What I love is you got the hopper. So you can actually see that. And look, I'm going to pull on the cord and show you what's happening. See the spring in there? But what I love about this is if this gets taken out, which it can be to get cleaned, mm -hmm. watch this. It's a locking mechanism. Look, I cannot. So you won't have a moving blade that's close that you can get your hand to because look, it won't work. And it'll only work. This little lock unlocks it. And now I can do that. So with this hopper, I just take a whole zucchini. Okay. And it feeds a lot of it with the weight. Okay. And then when something gets too light, that's why you have the pusher. So this could be your making hash browns. And you know, you can take your little finger. Zucchini bread. Zucchini bread, of course, case. carrots. You name it, the veg. Could be there. Could be onions. You just gotta fit in the hopper and then you get the little, the little um, you know, plunger and watch. This is all silicone, it's not gonna slip. So you pull and just let the weight of your hand plunge this all the way down. And I just did the whole zucchini done. Oh my gosh, professional results. Not only that, but it's everything is going to cook safe. evenly yes. if that were in the bread, so um, you have better results. I love my pull and chop because sometimes I don't want to pull out a big food processor yep. that I have to plug in. We'll go this way. A lot of times, oops, yep. No worries. A lot of times I certainly don't want to use a box grater yep. because you can hurt your knuckles if you get too close. Mm -hmm. You don't get to use all of the vegetables yep. sometimes. Loaded up with mushrooms. And what we're doing now is I'm grating radishes. Look how great this is. Again, remember, it doesn't slide, you just pull, and I'm plunging down. Look what a beautiful job it's doing. Did you ever like to try to get great radishes for a salad or something this quickly? I think that was like five or six radishes. I can't even get and shreds of carrot like that. I'm done. Let alone a radish. Is that great? That's beautiful. So that's the small grate. This one was, the, just to show you, this was the large mm -hmm. grate. You can see the difference. There's the small, there's the large. So I'm doing the two blades. And again, the two blades are interchangeable. They're, they're, they just, you just flip them from underneath. Okay, and the, and the, and he, can you show them, if you want the, the smaller uh, shred, yeah. should that be facing up Watch. towards you so here, we know? Let me show you a little okay. secret here. There's a picture we put on both of them, okay, for slicer and shreds. You're going to see a thin picture, see that right there? Yep. Of that, and then I'm going to flip this, and you're going to see a thicker one. Okay. So you know that that's the thick side. You're going to pull it up. So you're going to see, when you see the picture, that's the thickness that's going to come out. Okay, but should this be the part that's facing up towards me? So if I want the thick slice, or does you're that have to see face it. down? You, you have to look at it. So when you, look, I'll pick this up. So if you look at this, okay. see that picture? That's the thick slice. So we're getting thick slice. So it's slice. facing towards you, you're going to get okay. thick slice. Yeah, does that make sense? Yep, absolutely. And it unscrews off that easily. Um, and oh, so we, what we're going to do in this one, I'm, we have a little divider that now we Now, what's give you. this for? Okay, so when you want to do skinny vegetables or mm -hmm. two different vegetables at one time. Oh, gr so oh multitasking. You multitask. <laughs> so we're going to put this in the middle. Okay. okay? Then I'm going to take a leek. Mm -hmm. uh, no, I'm going to take celery that fits it and a carrot okay. on this side. And I can actually do the carrot and the celery together. Wow. So if I'm doing a mise en place like before mm -hmm. any kind of stew or soup. Think about the fact that, I mean, it's just look, it's feeding it down. And then whenever you need, and then this is divided too, so this can actually plunge for you as well. And the discs and the container and all, the pusher all are fit. all, is, is that something that we hand wash? Everything's dishwasher safe except for just wipe this, even or this is dishwasher is. safe. Okay. Yeah, just the pulley system, just like in your pull chop, okay. you don't want to put them in the dishwasher, but done. What a great addition too great? if you have the two cup uh, pull and chop because that does chopping. Yes. This is slicing and, and grating. this is grating Correct. or shredding. Yep. So great addition to have. K46999. Let me show you color choices again and everything you're going to get. You get two discs, but they're double sided. So really four different blades. Cleaning brush. Of course, you get the food pusher and you get the divider to put inside. And this holds four cups. You also get a recipe uh, booklet along with your instructions. So here is your red color. This is the blue that sold out last time we presented it. We have it for you in black, 
and we have it for you in gray. This is three easy payments of under $15. It will go away at the end of the day. And it's about just having beautiful results. Results even safely. Even cooking safely. safely. In a compact thing. And you know what? It's really easy. much easier to pull this out. 100% than a big um, machine Then sometimes. something that you have to yep. pl plug in, put the parts in, put the blades in. You're really just making your prep work yep. turn out a lot quicker. And you can do cheeses and meats in here. We give you some recipes to start off with in this little booklet. So it's really great. All the instructions. It's a pretty simple, straightforward thing that really just makes our lives a little bit easier. It's just great little prep. I love the safety feature behind it. You're not going to get cut. It's not an exposed blade. Sometimes those fancy mandolins I get scared mm -hmm, of. Sure. How do you do even? You see that when I just pull it open, let's see, this is another slicer. Again, take, you know, the, if it fits, the whole thing, you can just, and just, let, it, just let it feed. I mean, the weight of the vegetable alone feeds it. And then when you get to the end of it, if you want to use all of it, I just did that squash. Done. Awesome. And then there's that silicone base yep, at the bottom. Base, so which, by it doesn't the way, comes slide off, in your countertop. And clean. You can actually store this in the fridge if you want to, if you're going to prep beforehand. This is just That's a great fantastic. way if you're going to do casseroles and stews and soups. Um, if you're just going to prep for veggies for like, you know what I love is my new thing is, since I've been on a, on a diet, mm -hmm. is instead of uh, chips, I've been doing uh, cucumber chips. Yep. So I use it to make it for, if I'm doing my favorite dips and stuff, I'm using cucumber chips instead of, you know, carbs. So this is my little cheat. And this is a great way to make those Perfect chips. Perfect thing for hummus. And the air fryer too. That's great Ooh. for the air oh, fryer. So do the chips and then put snap. them in the air fryer. Love know. that. All right. Uh, so let us know what color that you need. Get it home on the three easy payment because it piece. goes away at the end of the day. Perfect companion to your regular pull and chop yes. or try what pulling action is all about. It's great. Because it's love awesome. It. Mark Charles Vasili. <laughs> Thank you so friend. much. So good to see you. Good to see you. All right, so um, I'm going to get a little girly girl on everybody and talk about my other passion, not just um, food and cooking, but shoes. If you all know me, you know I love shoes. And I'm going to look at our brand new Today's Special Value coming up in just a bit. Sally Combs Hello. from Earth Brands look has brought you rocking us. Look at rocking them, girlfriend. I love this. This is getting me excited for just music festival season, Yo, for yes. uh, the trips to um, the museum, the zoo with the kids, everything. Tell me about oh, or what a you trip brought. To Hawaii. Oh, I'm going to well, I'll, 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 be, I'll be living <laughs> in these. This is a Sand Antigua special style coming up for you at midnight. This is a brand new bottom too for Earth. Yes, isn't it? it's a great outsole. The outsole is called Sand. That's why that's the name. But okay. classic two strap all premium leather upper the buckles are adjustable you buy this where this will carry you through mm. the spring and summer just gorgeous we've done some beautiful laser cut detailing seven colors seven colors gorgeous colors um things like these usually go for eight, i know cute regular qvc price is 82 dollars we're under 68 really nice we have easy pay she's gonna be with jane tracy to kick it off again at midnight <laughs> but in the meantime we've got one more look at the today's special ha value happening now from look crusade Good. david thank you And then there were two. We started our day with nine colors in our Lake in our Look Crusade Today's Special Value. And we're awfully excited to let you know now that only two remain and both getting limited. Now we started with 16,000 of what I call a two-in-one. This is a four and a quarter quart vessel down below, two and a quarter quarts up top, but this lid, in addition to being its own baker or skillet, is also the lid for this fantastic enameled cast iron vessel. So, out of the six over 16,000 we started the day with, I have how many left in white? I have 900 left in the white, and Marseille just sold out. So, Marseille is gone. Thank you, Ryan. So, Ryan takes that away. And then there was one. Now, if you are someone that has always wanted the white Le Creuset, we heard you. And we've got it tonight, and we've got it at a screaming good value. But I'm not going to scream at you, even though it's late at night. Everyone's kind of winding down. I get it. But you know what? Don't let this day pass if this white Le Creuset vessel works in your kitchen or can be a great gift idea. Because at retail, you're looking at $425. When you look at our price, we are already $195 and two pennies less. And then we're going to bring it in with free shipping and handling, which brings your savings to $210.74. 
five easy payments on the credit card, and free shipping and handling. I'm giggling because Chef Nate went, what? <laughs> so this is what it's all about. This is your opportunity. This, my friends, is where the cast iron hits the stove. Not where the rubber meets the road, but where the cast iron meets the stove. I've got fewer than 900 left in white, and that is all. Let's meet the man that's made it all possible all day. Chef Nate Collier is back with us. Great to see you again. Say, nice to have you here, sir. Really, really versatile vessel. It's absolutely versatile. It's two and one, it's three and one, it's four and one because it functions as a Dutch oven with the lid together. It functions as two separate vessels that you can use separately. But you can also use two separate vessels together for the same meal, too. But you're always going to get the heritage of the original, iconic French enameled cast iron cookware brand, and you're always going to get delicious flavor and food. Mm. So, now what we've already done in this case is we have seared uh, this um, chuck roast. Chuck roast, thank you. Exactly. And then, with the little bits left at the bottom, we threw in our veg so we can begin to soften that up. But what are we going to do with all those bits on the bottom? We are going to get them off. We're going to deglaze with some beer. You can use wine, you can use stock, you can use any liquid you want, and you can see already it smells great. all of that is coming off the bottom. It's releasing into your food. It's gonna that's what gives you that rich, delicious, brown, hearty base mm, to any stew. Yes. If you ever get a thin or gray or steamed looking stew, they didn't sear properly and they didn't release from the enamel, and you need the cast iron in the enamel to get there. Exactly right. So look at this. Then back goes your Pot roast. Right on top of This and is again, an inexpensive chuck. Uh, this is a chuck roast. Used the lid to rest my meat while I was getting the veg going. So, dual function there again. And our precision lip right here, just like any other cast iron lid we make. So, you're not sacrificing any function when you get this dual purpose lid. Right on top, it locks the moisture in. It's going to heat from the top, it's going to heat from the sides, and that is going to shred apart beautifully when I pull it out from the oven. Mm, and all right. I, while I do that, David, if you wouldn't mind dropping some fries in that hot well, oil over there okay. and showing me exactly what happens when we fry in cast iron. Well, what's really nice about uh, cooking in cast iron, particularly deep frying in cast iron, is what you're going to see is even heat distribution and beautiful results with fried food. Now, if you're interested in this white, which is the only color I have remaining, fewer than 800. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me. So in goes some fries. Let's get some more in here. I'm using a spider, which I think is a perfect tool to have in your kitchen. I checked your comments on the on the uh, as I mentioned earlier. I asked you if you'd like me to put together a David set of kitchen essential utensils, and you're telling me pretty overwhelmingly you'd like to see that. <laughs> so we'll start working on that with our merchandising team. If you have some ideas of what you'd like to see in a in a, a set, I think you're all telling me universally you'd like a spider. So we're of gonna put course. a spider in there, and tell me what else you need. I've got some good ideas, but I'd love to hear yours. Jump on my Facebook page and leave me your ideas, and I'll be sure and read those. Lots of you are telling me what you would like to see in an essentials utensils set. We'll call it David's kitchen utensils or David's essential pack up. All right, now this is a look at that versatile lid because this lid is two and a quarter quarts capacity by itself. Thank you, Stacy. So um, I think a little bit of black pepper got hung up in my uh -oh. throat. I think that's what it was. From the French fries? No, no. I, I, it might have been Stacy's French fries from her black pepper earlier. I'm kidding. It's not. So David, I love this baker lid because you're going to do beautiful things like this uh, strawberry ginger streusel. That's one of the recipes included in the cookbook. And I want to say something about the white right now. I know that Lake Rousseau is known for those bright, bold colors. But there's something to be said. I have a lot of plain white dinnerware at home. Look how beautiful your food looks in the white right here. That bright berry on the background of the white is so beautiful. And again, if you're a Lake Rousseau color collector, you can mix and match your colors at home to do the same thing. They really pop off this white. And then just see how easy that's, that um, swipes right away from the side. Nothing sticks to the enamel. Nothing to wash off at the end. Just beautiful, beautiful, thick strawberry ginger streusel right there. From Strawberry the, ginger streusel. One of the recipes cobbler. included in the 12 uh, recipe Yummy. booklet we have. And I'm glad you mentioned that, Chef, because there is a recipe booklet that comes with your new vessel. You're getting 12 recipe cards inside, all tested by the chefs at Le Creuset. That's right. So you're going to love these. Chef Nate had a hand in tweaking all these recipes and helping to develop them. There's his recipe we did tonight in our foodie friends and family theme. Lots of great things. That's the Italian beef ragu we tasted earlier. So delicious. So good. Oh my word. And this is the strawberry ginger crisp with the cornmeal sweet streusel. 
Yum. Yum. All right, so here's your story. We started our day with over 16,000 today's special values. I have 800 left, white only. That is all. We've sold 5,200 of our today's special value just during In the Kitchen with David. So, an exciting opportunity for you tonight, and we get so many requests for white. Look at our shelves right here. What do you see? You see white dinnerware? Do you see white vessels? Do you see white uh, bakers? A lot of people have white in their kitchen. A lot of you have white kitchens. Imagine how beautiful this is going to be. And also realize that you're getting it at one screaming good value. But I'm not going to scream at you. Just going to talk to you in a normal voice <laughs> and let you know that at retail, this is over four, this is $425. Here tonight, we're already over $195 less. In addition to that, we're also going to bring it to you on free shipping and handling, which now brings you to $210.74 less. Five easy payments on your credit card and free shipping and handling. Don't miss out on this opportunity. We are very excited to be able to do this as a today's special value. To find that we started with nine colors on the day and over 16,000 today's special values, wow. and we're down to one color remaining, and now fewer than 800 left wow. in the white. That's an extraordinary day. Now, we just took that beautiful pot roast out of the oven. Chevnade is showing you how quickly and yeah. easily that's pulling I, apart. I've got a spoon and a fork here, David. You can see how beautifully this pulls apart. And again, that's a chuck. That's a tough piece of meat, but you match it up with this enameled cast iron cookware and that lid that locks in the moisture, and it's no match for it. Look how beautifully tender that is. Shreds right apart in the pot and looks beautiful against that white. If you, it, it, you know, if you don't mind me saying so, David, I think it actually looks pretty good matched well, against the white. You know what? I think after this long day, you can say just anything you want to, as long as you don't use wordy dirds. Uh, wordy dirds. Uh, wordy dirds. Well, I got I to use that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so as we wrap up now, I'll tell you that we started with over 16,000 for the day and nine colors. I have one color left, white only. And 750 left to go around. Chef Nate, this has been an extraordinary day. I've really friend. had fun. We have had a great time with you. Thank you so much for being with us. Absolutely. Thanks, great David. Great to see you great again, see buddy. You as well, thanks, everybody. And I'm going to make my way over here, Perfect. join Miss Stacy. It's good to see you, Chef. Stay on the line for today's special value and that final color one wow. left. Wow. Isn't that amazing? That. want to welcome the 165 brand new customers who shopped tonight during In the Kitchen with David for the very first time, made the first QVC purchase. Awesome. So a big foodie salute to all of you. Sunday, we've got a three hour show coming your okay. way. And I'm making an eight cheese mac and cheese. You have heard us talk about our famous Carol, who works here as a chef food stylist. Carol's mac and cheese, she's providing finally the recipe for Carol's mac and cheese. Do not miss it. Set your DVRs if you have to because you're always asking for it. <laughs> Very happy. All right, so that's going to wrap up our show tonight. Um, I believe we're getting ready for the one and only Jane Tracy at midnight oh, yeah. with a brand new value of the day, which uh, you were wearing. Where we're talking about. I um, have my bedroom slippers on now. Oh, does she? <laughs> Janie's standing by with a, a nobody better to take a shopping for shoes with our brand new value of the day. Honey! Jane! Honey! You know, remember the song? She climbs a tree and scrapes her knee. Well, you are climbing a tree, you're scraping nothing. You're just going to be so happy. You'll be spinning around like they used to do in the Alps. Because coming up right now, they are as comfortable as bedroom slippers. We're taking a look at Earth for Spring and a brand new today's special value that is named after one of the most beautiful islands in the world. I want you to think about warm blues, uh, beautiful blue skies and warm winds and you know your favorite vacation spot. And then I want you to look down in a little bit because that is all wrapped up in this beautiful shoe. It's brand new. It's made just for you. So 